Hello everyone, welcome back in. This is for the YouTube people, if you guys weren't aware. Um, so basically, just a heads up, we are coming back in and we're starting off, I think, Strolls, Thingamabob, his bond. Um, you guys, if you haven't been there, I think if you missed the other one, I think we ended up coming to Brylehaven. Um, we did a few things. I think we did like two optional dungeons. So nothing super crazy that you missed, but there was like one really weird cutscene one really sussy cutscene that happened earlier um with joanna so that's pretty much all that you missed that's that's the catch up that's where we are so we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna talk to stroll now hey. do you actually just like save up points all the time so like is that like how you are because i i know a lot of people oh, that they, they right. do do that a lot um but at least like for me i only do it if I, if there's something that i really want to save up for otherwise like i tend to just blow my all my points Oh my god, what? Oh my god, don't kill me. He made a 100,000k redeem just for you. Don't kill me, bro. He begged for it. <laughs> oh my god. Aurora, do you um do you happen to live in an area where you actually have raccoons, by the way? Because low-key, we don't have them here in Edmonton, as far as I'm aware. Which makes me really sad. My um one of my aunts back in the day when I used to live in Toronto, um, she had like an actual den where she literally would just like feed raccoons like i remember when i was like i think it was like nighttime or something i went out and i literally had like um i had like peanuts and i would literally just go up to raccoons and i'd feed them it was so cute there's so freaking many bro oh my god i'm so jealous we have nothing here the only thing that we have here apparently is like deer and maybe like the occasional bear that's about it with stroll leading the way we arrived at last to his childhood home the village of halia looks like shit looks like something bad happened here Raccoons are so cute. They also watch their food. I know. They're so intelligent. If you go on YouTube, there's a person called Tito or something. He or like the channel called Tito the Raccoon or something. And like, I don't know if he's still alive, but like that channel was so cute. I'm going to need moisture, by the way, on my lips. My lips are so chapped from being sick all week. It doesn't look like anyone has lived here for a very long time. It is a chilling sight. <sighs> traveling here by gauntlet runner do you think that we were practically next door to the capital yet as i fled for my life the nearest settlement felt leagues away i recall wanting to lie down and give up on several occasions i have not i have not played the binding of isaac um but i have seen a lot of my friends play it and i had a friend who was a super fan um who we we went over to her house and her boyfriend was playing it with her and she literally was just like oh my god it's amazing and they they played it for like i think three or four hours and we all just sat there and we're like okay <laughs> like, we're like um we're like can we do something else like can you just give me a drink please it's probably hard to tell now but this was once the village's main road full of people crossing every which Jesus. way you used to be able to see the mountains cresting their horizon above the rooftops. It was beautiful. I wish that you could have seen it. I used to do that. I mean, I still do. I play, ga I play games for very long sessions, too. I'm the same way. I just feel like I wish I didn't have a job, because then I could play for 12-hour sessions. Then we could play forever. No, no. I know that I'll see it someday. What? That should have been a good answer. Excuse me, rude. It's been like seven years since that day. It feels like forever ago. And yet only, sorry, and yet only the blink of an eye at the same time. Afterward, I was shuffled between various relatives, nothing more than another mouth to feed. Fitting, I suppose, of the burden I had become. I went to the site of our manor and all I found was rubble. I have a dead god file of 100% in the game on one save file. Going for infinity percent? Wait, how does that work? Oh, that's for the oh for the Binding of Isaac. I was going to say, I don't know how exactly that game works. I just, I know that a lot of people really like it. Um, And apparently, didn't they get, didn't Twitch get rid of the latest emote or something? It was like a global emote that they used. Um, And then apparently they replaced it with somebody else's thing that they made. And like everyone, nobody liked that. Like everybody fucking hated it. Yeah, they got rid of Bible Thumb. Yeah, that's what it was. Yeah, Bible Thumb. Like, why? Like, and apparently the <laughs> apparently the developer was just like, I would have given the rights to you if you would talk to me. Like, the fuck? 
yeah they're just i think i think they just didn't want to i don't know maybe maybe they, maybe it was cheaper to get the other one or something but mm, it's a bit weird a few walls were sort of sort of standing but it was a sorry sight compared to how i see it in my mind Yeah, who the fuck literally who is going to use that emo bro yeah we have we have bible thump at home home children that's the one that's the that's the emote i've discovered a letter mm. take this i only use it to make fun of it yeah i feel that i would be the same way too i there's no reason to use it honestly there was a corner of my father's study that seemed to have been designated sorry designed to withstand a fire Ooh. I found a box there with a letter inside, and I recognized the writing as my father's. Hey. I'm afraid that I must ask a favor of you. I have no doubt that this is his will, and I know that I, I know that I must read it, but I'm gonna go over there and do just that alone. But would you mind waiting nearby? Yeah. I'm here if you need me. Thanks. Oh my baby. Oh my god, I love him. You know what's really interesting? Have you guys played Persona, the Persona games, especially like Persona 5 or like any of those? At least we still have this. I don't thank God. If I lost that one, I'd be so sad. Hello, Judy and chat. How's the game going? Game's going good. We just, we actually just started. I literally spent 30 minutes doing anything but gaming, apparently, because uh, my brain just doesn't work. <laughs> so welcome in, Dango. How are you? Um, I don't know if I have any mods in right now, but if there happens to be somebody here that I think I ha think has mod status, please um, go ahead and give um, some shout outs to people, please. But otherwise, don't worry. Everyone follow each other. EFE babes. Everyone love each other. Welcome in, babe. How are you? Dango, are you going to stream today? Mm. Wait, what's the plan for today? I'm still kind of sick right now. I, I probably You can probably tell my voice is a little bit weird today, um, but hopefully... At least either tomorrow or after the weekend, I should be feeling a bit better, hopefully. Well, it's a good thing that we found this. It seems that I do indeed have an inheritance. And The will said the family's treasure was dispatched to the royal capital. Um, the Tihi? Well then. Thank you. Yeah, it's it is what it is. I'm pretty sure that I'm pretty sure that Bond, my boyfriend, took me out and like got me sick or whatever last weekend, which is usually how it goes. And then he's all, he's always just like, how did you get sick? That's crazy. And it's just like, you dragged me, you dragged me to the pool. You dragged me through two malls and then you took me out to a birthday party. Do you think I'm not going to end up getting like a cold or something after all that? That's crazy. <laughs> he's like, what the fuck? It's my fault that happened. I No, 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 that's cool. I, I like, here's the thing, Snowy, and I'll be honest with you guys. It has been a bit quiet lately because I know people are busy. I do like chatting with people. I don't know if I have it. Do I have it in there in my tag? Like I have, I have lurker friendly in there, but I do love chatting with people. I'm just a social butterfly. Um, I'm like friends with like probably at least like 90% of people at my work because like I just, I just don't shut up. Like I literally will not shut up. Yeah, don't feel bad if you wanna, if you wanna talk. Like I'm here, I wanna talk shit. I feel like, I feel like this game has made people a little bit more quiet too because people don't wanna like interrupt it. But like, girl, interrupt it. I don't give a fuck. I'm all just getting, getting warmed up for the game for the day. Ooh. Did you have to work today, too? I'm sorry if you did. I'm technically still on the clock right now, but I have pretty much all my work done. It's been a shitty week. I'm not gonna lie. Work has been kind of shitty for me right now. But at the same time, though, it's also because I just, I don't want to work. I just want to play the game. You know what I mean? I've been, like, falling behind from my own volition. It's my fault. This happens very often. I made gamer talk for, like, an hour before I started gaming. Bro, don't kill me, bro. Oh, my God. Sorry. My father names me the sole heir of his estate, and he even addressed the letter to my beloved son, Leon. Oh my god. Oh. This game has actually been like a little bit sad. I'm not gonna lie. Like they're not even trying that hard, and like they're they're making me kind of feel bad. I feel only shame at such endearments. Oh yeah, by the way, um, just in case if anyone is interested in this game, I highly recommend it. I don't think we're even like I want to say we're maybe like not even like a like a like a one third done the game probably I could be wrong, um, but so far the game is top tier, super super good. Looking with love in Fortnite. Yeah, no worries, baby. Enjoy your lurk, baby. Have fun Definitely. in Fortnite. 
I will be whatever they want me to be, a noble of prominence or otherwise. I think one of the things too that I, I would love, oh, I feel like that I want to game all day, but I got to work too. Yeah, I, I feel that. Um, one thing that I will say too, and I don't know if, um, I know that technically it depends on the person, but like, I've always found that when I play certain games, I always kind of like a part of me really wishes that people like knew the game series or they like, they knew the company or like something like that. Cause like actually talking about the games that you're playing, like having people that are knowledgeable about them or like that love to talk about them. That always means a lot to me too. That's the kind of thing I usually, um, if I play like a Nintendo game, like like if you say say like you play Pokemon, Pokemon players will come out of the woodwork and they will do nothing but talk about Pokemon. They love it so much. And I feel like some game series, I'm always like, I'm like, damn, I wish I could have like, like even like IRL friends too, but just people in general that I can actually like, like nerd out and be like, bruh, I'm like, I wish I could talk about that shit. Like have a full on conversation for an hour and a half or something just about that game. I'm getting ready to get off work. Ew. Uh, I mean, those are almost on workies. I still haven't eaten today, by the way. So if at some point I I end up feeling I, I, like I have to order food, I will let you guys know. Maybe then I will embrace the words, my beloved son. <laughs> I never imagined the day would come that I had come to terms with these feelings. I owe you so much and more. I sense Stroll's deepened trust and his determination to confront his destiny. Is he gonna? Oh, okay. Maybe we have one more that we have to do off the Gun Runner because I feel like there's more. Let's fucking go. Yeah. Oh, does anyone have plans for the weekend? By the way, um, I don't actually know what we're gonna do on Saturday, um, but I know that Sunday I should be able to do movie night again. I don't know what movie we're gonna watch. We might end up finishing Underworld because apparently we still are not done. But besides that, hmm. I don't know. Probably more scary movies or something. Apparently, apparently don't let go or like there's like a movie about like um a black family like holding onto ropes at their house or something. I don't remember what it's called. Um apparently that came out um for for downloading. There's also what is that thing called? Oh, Alien Romulus if anyone hasn't seen it. Um you can also torrent that too. That is out now as well. I will be here with my friend talking about the lore of Isaac for like hours. Honestly, ugh, wish it were me. Wish it were me, bro. I wish I could talk about the lore of like Persona and like SMT. Like the, the lore for those games is so deep, by the way, for the most part, depending on like how you view it. Um, But like, I don't know anyone else that really like bothers to like, like, like really talk about it. I plan on like streaming Saturday and watching Terrifier 3. I haven't watched the Terrifier series, but I know of them. I should probably start them. Do you recommend them? Like, are they are they worth getting into? Or is it more of just kind of like a cheesy hobby mm. kind of thing? I'm sure that he entrusted the inheritance to someone in the capital, but I have no clue who that might be. Um, Tell me more about your father. What was your father like? That's... He was a big man. Oh, Ayo. <laughs> okay. So much so that standing next to my mother made him look tight. made her look teeny. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. It's kind of hot. But despite his size, he solved his problems with his head. Which head? It's like very gory. Oh no, no that's fine. I, I'm into that stuff too. If anyone okay, there's there's actually two movies that I really recommend. Um, and one of them is very gory. If no one here has seen um The Sadness, um, it is I believe a Korean horror movie um about a virus or something. Um, and it's called The Sadness. It is anything but sad. The movie is not sad at all. It is extremely horrifying. Um, and I'd actually, I think I showed that to Bond recently and he actually told me, I remember he actually, he, at one point he told me like, he was like, oh, um, he's like, he's like, oh my God, like turn off the TV, just turn it off. Because like, he just didn't want to watch it anymore. But I forced him to like go through like the next like five minutes and then everything was okay. But <laughs> there's like one scene that like really freaked him out. Um, there's also, I think, don't blink. Oh, sorry, not, no, no, not don't blink. It's, um, Blink twice. Blink twice. I think I recommended this to a few people um, already, but just in case, that is another movie that I highly recommend you see. Um, it's not technically gory, um, but it's like a psychological thing where the beginning of the movie is like kind of weird. Um, it starts off really fast, and then you're kind of just put into a weird scenario, and then it just turns into like this weird mystery movie, and then there's like a crazy genre shift after, and it's like really fucking good. Super good movie. Grand Trad was able to source fresh fish from Brylehaven, but in Halia, they were a rare feast. Uh -huh. Aha. 
Hey, maybe I'm onto something. He spoke highly of the fish market, so he must have gone to the same one at the, the same one every time. Just give me one second, guys. I have sussy cold things I have to do. Hold on. Perhaps they might remember him. That may be our best lead. And I'm afraid that I shall once more take advantage of your generosity. When we return to Grand Trad, will you help me walk in my father's footsteps? It could still turn out fruitless, but I will need all the help that I can get. Oh, smile. Oh, I saw smile. Ooh. Smile is very good too. Um, the second one that's coming out, by the way, the trailer for it is amazing. And me and my other friend who's like a horror buff we were like uh i think we watched the trailer together and we were like we were like oh my god like this actually looks really good um i feel like the first movie is kind of it, it's like a really weird slowish burn it's not exactly what i was expecting from the trailer but i did think it was a good movie and the ending was wild um i think that the trailer for the second movie looks amazing though and i'm really hoping that they pull it off this one's important Stroll has asked me to help track down his inheritance, and he recalled that his father frequented the fishmonger. Oh. Okay. All right. And apparently we can do this at any time. This is good. This is going to be like that. They've given Let's us a lot back. of quests that have no actual time frame, which I am about. I like that. It's night time. What are we going to do? Let me take a look. I hear a voice. <sighs> Nurus. Okay. Um, Heisman is okay for now. He's ranked five. We'll leave him alone. Um, oh. Oh, God. Oh, Brigida? Brigida can get up too. Interesting. Um, you know what? Mm, let me go ahead and we're going to go talk to Nurse first. Oh, my God. Temi. Hey, babe. How, how are you? Welcome in. How are you feeling today? Um, I was going to say I got, I got on earlier and I checked. I want to say, uh... I don't know if it was like around 1 to 2, around 1 p.m. or 1.30 my time, but I don't know if you ended up streaming today. If you did and I missed it, I'm so sorry, babe. I'm right, you're tired. Oh, did you end up streaming like early in the morning today than I said? Also, I'm so sorry to do this to you, by the way, Tammy, but um, can you do me a favor if you're able to? Can you give um, can you give some shout outs? I think give like give one to uh to Dango. Um that is in and i think aurora is here as well i appreciate it i accidentally just i didn't ping anyone on time it's my fault but at the same time it is what it is do you have any plans for the weekend temmy do you have plans girl Ooh! oh my god that heart is disgusting Let's, let's creep on our boyo. Mm -mm. Well, we did pick up a, another weird thing of a bob, but I'm not sure if it, it's one of the one of the lost relics well. or not. Sounds intriguing. Might I give it a look? Also, just a heads up. I don't remember if I mentioned it, but I think that Norris's bond thing of a bob is kind of weird. I feel like his like personality is fucking strange. So don't mind me if I am slightly <laughs> off put by him. Just a good twist there, and then a push in. Oh, <laughs> that's what she said. And then there you are, you see? Yeah. That's a teehee. This? Meow, meow, meow. This game is like 70% cracked. Oh, are they almost done cracking it? Oh my god, is Jester gonna end up getting a crack? Don't kill me. Cook dinner and then hang out with the family for game night. Ooh. Oh, what do you guys, Denison, what do you guys do for game night? I have like Monopoly and like other stuff that we do, but um, I find that a lot of people that I know don't actually like that stuff. There's someone, someone who's actually attempting to crack it. Oh my God, please. They probably sat there and they're like, they're like, fuck, like I don't want to pay a hundred dollars for this game. God, I've got it. Yes, by God, it's coming to me. I can see it now. A heaven sent cerebral nugget of pure genius. Oh, okay Thank then. You. All right. Even so. I gotta say, though, I didn't think that I would get to see three relics in such a short span. 
It must be thanks to my healthy living and intellectual curiosity, huh? <sighs> thanks to us, you mean. You haven't found a thing for yourself, you know. Why don't you come out and help us search every once in a while? No. He has like, I think it's like the sniper class or something. That's like the only thing I care about. Like, let's be honest. Oh my God, this guy's a mustache. Oh my God. Why does everyone loves his mustache? It's so funny. It's so fancy. He's got uh, bird wings too. So far, there's only like two people, two people on this planet who know how to do it. I don't know. I don't know what it is though. Like, it's one of those things, like, honestly, like, I understand that like, it's probably hard to do it, but like, how come if they crack the game, why are they not posting it online? Isn't that kind of weird? It's not like difficult. It just takes a very long time. Yeah, like, I mean, I, I guess it makes it makes sense. But like, again, like, why are they not posting it after? Yeah. You would think that they would hurry up and do that. I certainly did. A strapping young lad with a genius mind and familiar, sorry, familiar, blah, blah, familiar prestige. Why, I was every debutante's dream. Wait, what? Wish that were me. Wish it were me. Oh, my God. <laughs> Bro. Quite. Literally same. Oh, well, it still might be. You're young lad. Still got all that freedom and time in the world for ill-advised romantic peccadillos. It's a peccadillo. Is that like Australian? But in my case, I'm afraid that most of my admirers cared for my family name far more than they did for me. Because they're selfish. Yeah, I mean, uh, I mean, I get, I feel that. But at the same time, though, if I if I had the ability to crack a game and I did it, why wouldn't I upload it and like do it anonymously so that it, nobody can trace it back to me, right? Like that's kind of weird. I'm currently cracking Black Myth Wukong. Only about three spins undone. Wait, are you actually trying to crack it yourself? What the fuck, Snowy? What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, Tammy's just like, yeah, hit me up. Yo, yo, hit all of us up, please. DM us. I plan on posting it on Steam Rip. Oh my god, don't fucking kill me. I even had a fiance at, at one point. Huh? Wait, what? Wow. This man was married? Oh, yes, but I remember I was a young, a young obsessive. A romance and career both fell to the wayside as I threw myself into runner research. Ugh. Poor girl got tired of waiting. Um, by the time I thought to check on her, she had sloped off and married some other blue blood too. Okay, get like a get get like a job at, at like Fit Girl. Oh my god, yes. Oh my god, do it. I feel like I feel like them and um Oh, what is that? There was like another another website I think that used to like post stuff too. I think it was like Skidrow or something. Um, they had a lot of cracked stuff on there. I'm only like 460,000 lines done. What the fuck is that? Oh my god. Rather. I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know, Snowy. That sounds terrifying. Yeah, like GOG or like Skidro or whatever. They have some stuff too. Um, you're perfect for each other. If you ask me, you two are perfect for each other. Ooh. Exactly. I think that it is quite a happy thing, though I do say so myself. I've reclaimed a dream that I had left half unfinished. <laughs> Can't say much else other than that I am grateful to you for both all of this relic business and having me along on this journey. My passion had been all but smothered, but you have rekindled it. Without you, I would be rotting away in my chair with a stationary prototype. Now then. Well then, I've got to go and sharpen my skills some more. We'll show those other runners that you'll need more than big bulkheads. I don't know if you're interested, but Bloodborne PC port can actually load the title screen out. Wait, what? Wait, I thought, well, hold on. When you say that they can actually load the title screen, um, I was going to say, isn't it like fully ported over now? Or is, I thought it was already fully ready to go. Or maybe it isn't. I thought I heard differently. No. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're getting, Um, I think we're getting the sniper. Give it to me. Mm, it feels good. We like big gun. Day. Yeah, I feel like I haven't actually had a good chance to go on Fit Girl yet because I'm gonna be honest with you, I haven't had a chance to really crack anything or like download anything. Um, but anywhere else that I go, I don't know where you get your info, Judy. I just got it from like Twitter, like um, because people people online like okay, so here's the thing. Um, ever since the whole thing with um, uh, what is his name? Is it Kai Sinat or something? It's the guy who like ended up playing Bloodborne recently. Um, apparently there was like a lot of interest in getting the PC port done. And then I heard that apparently the PC port was pretty much ready to go. Um, I know that there was already a port for like the PlayStation where it was like cracked to like run at like I think 60 frames. 
but I heard that they were already almost done the PC port as well. I was gonna say I cracked Forza H through bubble H5 or whatever through Xbox servers. Ooh, you can actually get the achievements there too. That's kind of <laughs> cool. Important. I'm not gonna be pirating, by the way. I don't know what Judy's talking about. Yeah, I was gonna say yeah, we don't pirate games here. I actually have copies of my games and I have receipts. So Twitch, don't out me. Thank you. <laughs> that was perfect before he was relevant. I mean, I guess. He technically how did he become relevant though was it because he was playing all the souls games or something i don't fucking remember time marches on and the age of a new king draws nearer oh god what day is it i don't remember what's the first we still have to do i think we have to do at least one hey. to two do optional dungeons i'm pretty sure Supplies have been scarce lately, and I hear that there's plenty of ingredients in the Gracia Forest. All right, sounds good. He has connections and cash. He's just a trash Souls player. Don't kill me. Tell me and don't kill me, bro. That's kind of <laughs> savage, but I love it. There's something that there is something that I would like him to look at. Oh my god, is it his fucking dong? Can I see his dong, please? Thank you. Barden comes to mind. Maybe I should go talk with him. Ayo, ayo, T. Oh my god, don't. Oh my god, if you tag him, is he gonna fucking come in here? I hope not. It only took like four months or whatever. We don't pirate. We, yeah, I was gonna say, we're talking about, um, yeah, the Rice Krispie treats, bro. Oh my god, don't. You guys fucking. You guys are actually killing me, by the way. It's so funny. Um, okay, let me. We're gonna take a quick look at our quest. Our questies. 12 days for that. Okay, not bad. Dental distress. Wait, how do I, how do I do this? Actually, I'll do the one after. Let me, um, let's go, let's go talk to Hulkenberg. Let's go talk to Hulkenberg, bruh. <laughs> Thank you for giving us, uh, Snowy a shout out, by the way. I appreciate it. Um, and Temi, at any point, whenever you feel like it, feel free to give yourself a shout out as well, if you have not already. Yeah, everyone, please, please, um, go and follow each other. If you guys know that you're streamers and stuff, um, and go and support each other, especially if you're smaller, you know, small beans. I'm gonna send uh, an SS in the Discord of my progress. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, yeah, I was gonna say. Yes, yeah, put it put it in the Discord somewhere, somewhere that I can see it or something. I feel cringe for giving myself a shout out. I mean, it's it's whatever. Like you you have you have you have permission to do it if you ever want to. Um, but don't worry about it. We're gonna go. We're gonna go talk to Hulkenberg. Yeah. Yo, this girl is crazy. She she eats like the weirdest stuff, by the way. It's kind of disgusting. Um, uh, yeah, let's go ahead. She wants us to continue our training. You know, despite Troll's little outburst the other day, he's been quite diligent in his training since. Oh no. Oh god. Where can I send the SS? Um, oh, I was gonna say thank you. Yeah, just throw it there. Um, so fun fun fact um hulkenberg tried to train us i think before and she made us do something called the beast walk and we had to get on all fours and we had to run around on the gauntlet runner earlier it was fucking disgusting oh no like in the server what channel um just do uh do like general chat or something i'm sure it's fine I, i'm pretty sure it doesn't matter okay i'm going back to my date Wait, what? Oh, are you talking like your date, like like your your voice chat date? Are you going into a like a call? Ayo. Hey, okay, BB, have have a good night, babe. We're watching. Oh, you're watching Attack on Titan. Yes. Oh my God, let's go. I remember this. I remember you guys were talking about it before. Also, welcome in Angel. Hi, BB. Um, I was gonna say, by the way, um, just in case, guys, I know that at some point Angel is actually planning on doing a little bit of streaming as well. Um, so if anyone is interested in following her, please go and drop her a follow. Um, oh, oh my god, cat! Welcome in, babe. How are you? Hello, everyone. Thank you for giving her a shout out too. I was gonna say, eventually Angel is going to get um her brother's computer, and she will be able to hopefully use that to do some streaming. Thank you for giving Cat a shout out as well, baby. Listen. Hold on. Sorry, your boyo needed needed water. Yeah, I was gonna say, welcome in, baby. Everyone, just relax. You know, if you guys if you guys want to talk or whatever, go for it. But um, if you guys need to lurk or anything, I totally understand. Don't worry. 
We also actually, we managed to start a little bit early today, but um, I don't know if I told you guys earlier, but um, we ended up like, I think we came on and we were chatting for at least like 30 minutes. So it was kind of a tee here. Hmm. That voice, is that Rodanth? You remember he is my former comrade that we met before. Oh yes, he's the racist. The racist. We have a lot of racism in this game, if no, no one else is aware. Do it. Wait, Wait hold on. Uh. Well, if it isn't Hulkenberg, I will ask that you not interrupt my duties. This is your duty? What knight commander presides over executions? Seek no more. It is only right. Those who would do this nation harm shall be punished. I know he enjoys that. He enjoys that stuff. So then... Send it to the chatting, please. I'll take a look at my phone, too. Hold on. Ah! What exactly has he done? Treason. This fool, a petty officer of the military police, slandered the honor of the Royal Knights. Bro, you're killing officers, bro? What? Disgusting. Oh my god, you're actually... Oh, oh my god. I was gonna say, Snow, you're actually doing like you're doing like proper programming stuff too. Oh my god! I can show you the world. Thank you. That's Tihan. You have forgotten any oath to the throne. Now you are just dogs barking on command, bro. This guy's crazy. <laughs> you guys want me to add the Pedro fucking channel command or the channel e or channel redeem? Super bad. I can already tell. Oh god. You cannot be serious. This insolence is why you would have him killed. This, after all of the trifling uh, sinners that you have sent to the gallows, righteous fury rings false from a hypocrite's mouth. Wait, what? <laughs> now die, dishonor. Ride like the mega you are. Bro, what did she do? What happened? Heed my words. I only have like a couple more months, I think, before I'm done. Oh, okay, that's terrifying, by the way. Trying to crack that shit for all that time, bro. I would probably, I'm not gonna lie, I'd probably just like wait for somebody else to do it. But if you manage to get it done faster, I mean, I guess it's a good thing. So like, does is it like an automatic program that like cracks, uh, cracks it open? Or do you have to manually go in and like do a bunch of sussy things? They could kill me for any reason that they liked. Bro, this is messed up. Rodanth. I like his outfit, though. Rodanth, this is beyond outrageous. You've authorized nothing less than public butchery. <laughs> Maintaining the capital's order is the knight's duty. It is only natural that we punish those who spread lies. You... Have you sold your soul to the Sanctists? Were you blinded by the prospects that you would win by their coronation? Well, it hardly matters who takes the throne, so long as the royal knights still stand to flank it. Oh, oh he's one of those... I made a program, but like it's only like 90% accurate, so I'm doing the other 10%. Oh, okay, I was gonna say. You no, that makes sense. That makes sense. You have to manually go in and fix what what, what they um what they don't catch. So it's gonna take a while since they use like random obfuscation on every single game. Yeah. Whoops. It's a tee here. Pets you softly though, because honestly, if you do crack it though, that's actually badass. I'd put that I, if I were me, I would put it on my resume. Bold words. One would almost think that you and your friends sink the hangman's noose yourselves. Riot. Yeah, like I'm gonna what? beat your ass. No, if something happens to you, no, no I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna beat his ass. I see that your whelp hasn't learned to hold his tongue. <laughs> Pity stays my hand today, but there will be, well, there will not be next time. Hulkenberg, bro. Why is everyone so power hungry in this game? Everyone's so racist, bro. Power is not a tool to torment and kill the innocent. It is meant to guide the weak and the vulnerable, that each and every one of us might live together in a better country. Apologies. Well, I apologize. I forced you to into my troubles again. I was, I was going to say, it's... Yeah, he's Wasn't the bad I? one here. <laughs> All the same, I'm glad that you are here with me. Who knows what would have happened and had I been alone. Yeah, she'd probably stab him. <laughs> I can see it. I have like one terabyte hard drive to store all of the, the data that I'm working on since I have multiple copies and whatnot. Listen. Oh my god. I don't, do I, actually, I think I have a terabyte hard drive and I'm not gonna lie, that shit runs out fast. It's actually kind of crazy. You have given me such strength. Oh, oh my lord, kill me. I will pray for your success though. Do you end up doing this stuff on the weekend or do you just like, do you just like do it all the time? 
I'm only like using 108, sorry, 800 gigabytes. Oh, geez. Actually, fun fact, I actually had to go through, after I started up this game, I had like, I think it was like 600 gigabytes of video files for like other games too. Um, and I actually had to delete like pretty much everything that I had saved on there because it was like every, every other file is like, it's either 50 to 100 gigabytes. Like it's fucking crazy. I don't know why. I like whenever you feel like it. Ooh. Wow, having freedom, which were me. Oh my god, there's a there's a man behind her. What's he doing? I think he's a parapus. He's a parapus, bruh. Meow, 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 meow. My external hard drive I use on my PC laptop. I wish I wish I had like um I mean I wish I had a bigger one too, but like I'm gonna be honest with you guys, like is it just me or like do computers nowadays like do they not need like massive hard drives now? Like wouldn't it be more productive if everyone had like a 10 terabyte hard drive automatically like installed in their computer? Like I'm surprised that like it hasn't like gotten to the point where like you can like actually make more efficient ones. How's the Karen, how's Karen handling the situation going? Oh my God, bro, cat, don't kill me. <laughs> don't kill me, bro. I can hear a voice. He doesn't need to come here any longer. And yet, oh my God, she wants us to talk to her. Ah. Who's that right now? I know Alonzo's on right now, but I want to, we want to go talk to Brigida. Brigida, if we can get her leveled up, I'm pretty sure it's going to give us like some wild stuff. All right, let's go been 84 years i want to go see her if we can end up getting the next merchant class but i think there's only one left let me double check what now which one was it um the merchant i think it's this one yeah this one here oh god that's gonna be broken we're gonna be making so much fucking money deals heavy physical almighty damage yeah i like that i like that Item connoisseur, blah, blah, blah. Time Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. What do I have on this one? Increases the effects of consumables by 1.2. Oh, oh my god. Oh, and then I don't, oh, okay. I don't need it on everyone to do it then. Oh, I see. That's why I was, that's why I was healing so much before. Interesting. Very good. I have like four, sorry, four terabytes of storage on my PC, and you can also get like a ter 24 terabyte hard drive for a PC. Okay, you know what, then in the future, guys, I'm not going to lie, I might end up actually looking for like a Prime deal or like a like a Black Friday deal and see if I can get one. Do you happen to know how expensive they are, though? Like, are they, like, I'm assuming they're like up like $1,000 or something, or like 500 They have to be expensive. There's no way they're not. Um, Let's see. Two bros. Two bros. I'm back in the work. Oh my god, Dennis, can you finish your work? I'm so proud of you. Oh my god, pets you softly, baby. Gives you huggy wuggies. I'm so happy for you. Wish it were me. Pretty expensive. I'll ask a friend who bought one though. Yeah. Let me oh oh, did we actually get it? Oh, let's fucking go. Yeah, let, let me know if you can find um a really good priced hard drive. Not external, like I want like an internal one. Um, but if not, I can get external. It's like whatever. You are most welcome. The pain of work has now subsided. You can now do other things. Amazon are selling TV drives super cheap right now. I think it's because, is it because of Prime Day or something or Amazon Amazon Day? And they last for a really long time too. They do, the one that I have right now that I use for all of my um my movies and like my video stuff too, I've been using it for a while. Did you know that you can actually get, um you can get terabyte, um uh, what are they called? The USB sticks as well. I think I have like, I think I have two of them. I think I have two of them and like, they're actually really useful. They're very, um, I think it's like 40 to $50. I think it was like around $50 per USB stick, but like they're, su they're super fucking good. Good quality ones. It's like $500 it's for a 24 terabyte. I feel like if you got it, if you got it on discount, it would not be so bad. Like if I wait until like Black Friday or something, I might be able to get one. The ones who took my dog, the anti-igniter extremists, the church has discovered their base. What are you planning? So reductive. Do you have to ask? Even the church knew that what I would do with this information. That's why they sent it to me. Apparently, this faction is based in a small village, barely close to Grantrad. Ooh. 
I'm gonna go there and I'm gonna eradicate all of them. Oh my god, <laughs> yes. She's scary. I will kill every last one of those extremists. No survivors. And once they get and once they get to hell, they can look my dog in the eyes and beg her forgiveness. Wait, is the dog fucking dead? No, stop. Stop it. I will string their corpses up. Three days and three nights exposed to the elements. Long enough for everyone to see what happens if you cross you me. Right. And I would like you to help me punish them. In exchange, I will support you however I can I can from, from here on. I refuse. You talk big, don't you? You have no desire to be king, yet you parade around as a candidate. You're little more than a fraud. If someone needs a slapper, bro. It's like 20 It's off right now? It's, it's discounted right now? Okay, I gotta take a look later tonight. Brigitte is suspicious of me. I need to tell her the truth or she will never fully trust me. I explained to her that I had entered not to take the throne, but to raise someone else who could forge a better future, uh, future for our country. <laughs> Did you expect me to believe in that nonsense? But for you to speak such words at this point would mean that your goal of seizing the throne is no lie, at least. Ah, oh my god! Ooh, Seagate Ironwolf Pro. Can you actually do me a favor? Can you DM it to me on Twitch or DM it to me on Discord just in case? Because I don't know if I'll be able to see it in time or if I'll remember where it was. That's fine. If that's how it must be, then I will spare no expense to see you fall. The throne ill suits a wretch who can look past the butchery of a dog. No. I, w I have never for a moment thought it was right for her to die. Then is it not just for those who kill to be killed? Is that not your precious equality? Bro, girl, I mean, I see where she's coming from, but Jesus, bro. Also, thank you for the DM. I, I will take a look at it after. Do we like Brigida? We do. I like I like Brigida. I like Brigida. She's stunning. She's amazing. But here's the thing. Apparently, apparently a bunch of people killed her dog. Like, just because. For no for, for no good reason, if I might add. So I understand. I understand um why she's angry. <laughs> What do you truly understand? You have no idea how much comfort she brought me. And they... See, hold on. And they ripped that away from me. Can you say that I should just allow it? No. <sighs> Fine, I will not do something so unsightly in front of you. In I feel. Case. I do feel really bad for her, but jeez, man. She needs to calm down. I'm going to go to their base, but I will not kill them right away. I will find out who did this, and we will try to negotiate clearly and openly. I wouldn't even negotiate, bro. I just pu I punch them. What in the world? If that doesn't work, then I will murder them, and we can move on. Oh, my God. <laughs> bro, don't kill me. Did okay, okay, Snowy, you? enjoy your lurkies, yeah, babe. I bet I did. That is the most that I can promise you. Oh, my God. This is terrifying. We will take my gauntlet runner. Dangers of the night be damned. If we break down, so be Obviously. it. You come, you come as well and see for yourself. The best large... Oh, drank so much Mountain Dew they exploded. Oh my god, let's fucking go. Yeah, I, I rearranged. I, I like changed all my lurk messages recently. So now they're like fucking wild. I love it. Thank you. I appreciate it. If you're going to try and drag me into the light, then you deserve to see what happens. No, oh my god, I feel so bad for her, but like, god, bruh. She's like losing her mind over this dog, and I feel that. I, I love dogs. We have arrived at a small settlement located close to Grand Trad. Wait a minute. This is... Are you kidding me? This is weird. Is this the place? You hey, you there. I am Brigitte. I am the scoundrel selling magic igniters all across the land. Oh, the igniter merchants again? Our village really doesn't have money to buy any. I'm sorry to keep turning you away, what? but wait, what are you talking about? Oh, are you not the one? Are you are you not one of the church's dealers? They keep trying to sell us igniters, but I keep refusing them. <gasps> wait, the church has been here several times. They've never reported that to me. So if I said that merchants of igniters were, would face the wrath of God, you wouldn't agree. <gasps> Oh, no, we, we don't have anything to do with Igniters at all. It's not something that ever really comes up here. Bro, did the church just try to fucking get her to fucking blow up a whole village of, like, innocent people? Excuse me? Hey, miss, do you sell magic Igniters? Well, that's brilliant. Papa, I want an Igniter. I want to be popular like Brigitte. I want an Igniter, too. Enough. 
Why C? Say no more. Yeah, she almost she almost got bamboozled. Oh no. Hmm. This is no hideout. They know nothing. It is not something that you can hide in a village such as this. I have been getting detailed reports on the anti-igniters group's movements from the church, but now I am not even certain that such a force even exists. If, if it was all a lie, then what does the church get out of it? To spread magic oh. igniters? Maybe it's actually about more, more about selling magic igniters. Oh my god, the twerkies. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Yo, this guy's, this is why we don't, we don't trust, tr never, never trust religion in a video game, okay? <laughs> like, don't ever trust that shit. I fucking knew, case. I knew. And the funny thing too is I think the last stream that we did, um, they showed Forden, um, having like a hot moment where he was actually being fucking rude as fuck. And I was like, bruh, I'm like, they made him look like such a fucking saint. And then he ended up being like a fucking asshole. So that's a tee here. Anyways, I take it back. There will be no killing today. If you hadn't stopped me, I would probably have ordered my private army to burn this place to the ground. Oh, he do you guys want me to put on emote chat only and then you guys can like spam emotes? Let me know if you're down for that. I'm glad that you were here with me. I can sense Brigitte's deep trust. Sorry, deep gratitude. I'm glad to have you at my side. Receive a discount at weapon, armor, and igniter shops. Ooh, wow. But my dog was taken from me, and I will chase the scum to the ends of the earth. This is my job, not yours. So our business together is concluded. Excuse me? No, no. Still, I would like to come and visit you, Brigida. Oh, you know what's so funny? She was saying earlier, every time we hear her, like, um, her voice before we, like, do the follower thing, she's like, oh, I really want to see him, but I don't think he wants to see me. Well, guess, guess what, girl? I do want to see you. What are you saying? What could you possibly gain from hanging around me? Well, then, fine. Since it's you. Oh, my God. We're going to be best friends. Speaking we're of... best friends for Brigida. Oh, my God. You mentioned earlier of your true aims for the throne. I thought it a clumsy lie, but it does bring to mind a certain someone for me. After a king is crowned, it would be nigh impossible to put another on the throne. However, if my suspicions are correct, then none could deny the claim. You're down for the emote only? All right. Everyone, you're being you're tech you're not even being punished at this point. You're all you're all down for it. Let's go. Everyone, go ahead and just spam your sussiest emotes for like a good like two or three minutes, and then I will I will take it back off. Show me what you got. Let's see. After a king is crowned, oh he already read that. Oh my god, Batman? Where did you <sighs> girl? You gotta tell me where you got the Batman emote after. What the hell? If you are willing to throw yourself into battle for that cause, then I shall support you all the same. Yes. If you would like to come, then come. Oh, that's what she said. <laughs> Yo, I swear to God, this game is so fucking weird. Uh, mm. When I'm around you, much to my surprise, I find that even I still have a beating heart. So come if you wish. I, I will come if I wish so. Thank you. How are you? In how are you guys enjoying the vibes of this Time game? By the way. On. I'm just curious. It's like one of those things like I feel like I feel like the art style is really cool. I feel like the way that I have it set up is like relatively clean too, so you can like see most of it for the most part or whatever. Um music is good. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the music. Exactly, yes. I agree. Wonderful. Wonderful. Alright, let's take a look here. Apparently Barton wants to talk to me. I don't want to talk to him right now. Um I think we're okay to go. We have 11 days left. So I think what All we're right. going to end up doing... <laughs> what we're going to end up doing is we're going to go over to the All Gauntlet right. Runner. Let me take a look here. Oh, hold on. Let me do... All right, then. There's the thing somewhere around here. I think it's over here. We're going to go... We're going to go put in... Ayo. We're going to go put in our... Uh, our... Our questy. The bounty. And then I think after that, we're going to go and uh, finish off two of the quests that we have done. And then we're going to go take the Gauntlet Runner. We're going to go do uh, some optional dungeons. Welcome. <sighs> Impressive. Boop, 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 boop. We did it. Big money. Ooh. 
Very nice. Right. We love that. I'm so used to being poor in RPGs to the point that like I will go out of my way to make a shit ton of money, by the way. Also, let me go ahead and take off emote only chat. Oopsie. <laughs> I feel like I did punish you. Just got metaphor for gestures, so now you can choose you two can talk about it. Oh my god, did you actually go and buy it for him? Oh my god, let's fucking go. Temi. Also, I love how I love how you literally you said that right as I took off emote only chat. Let's fucking go. Oh my god, I'm so I'm so happy for you guys. I'm actually gonna have such a good time talking to him about it. Okay, here's the thing too. I'm gonna I'm gonna message him later, and because technically I am ahead of him, um, I'm pretty sure that he'll be able to come in and talk about the game too. So um i will actually get a chance to actually like talk about something on the stream about the game let's fucking go oh yeah i was gonna say yeah mods mods and vips can talk during vip is it's he here oopsie <laughs> which why did they even put up emote only chat there was no point that's a t here aurora is always emote only oh my god for real though exactly i think we got everything there um oh look, hold on what was i gonna say Okay, question. Does anyone have any um anything interesting that they've seen on like Twitter? Let him play it first. Oh no no, I no, I I I know what you mean. I'm just I'm I'm just curious like if he ends up like wanting to talk about it, like he can, he can actually talk about it here. Because it's like one of those things like I'm just I'm so far ahead. Like if he has questions, I can I can talk about it. Um what was it though? Yeah, I think um there was some stuff going on on Twitter recently, but the only thing that I've seen is that apparently um what was that? Apparently, apparently Asmongold got banned. I don't know if anyone saw that. Apparently he got banned from, from Twitch for a little bit. Okay, bye again. Okay, yeah. No worries, baby. Enjoy your date. Other than like someone getting beat with like a metal pipe. Wait, what the fuck? Okay, can you can you give me context though? Give me give me some context. I need to know. I spilled the tea. Enjoy your lurkies, baby. Oh yeah, Tammy, by the way, I was gonna say use the um try using the, the lurk the the lurk command because we have it updated now and like there's like some, some like really fucking sussy things that i put on it they jumped a guy and, and beat him with pipes oh my god let's fucking go i mean uh no hey, that's you. a bad thing wait what was it just like for no fucking reason now i'm innocent okay fine miss family friendly over here all right then oh here we go Tom. wow oh yeah by the way um so apparently um what is it mario party jamboree came out um i still don't have my copy of it yet but when i do get it i will let everyone know and we're gonna start playing it um i will try to play it either sunday night or monday night -ish, if i can or like during mondays so if anyone is down to clown and play that game with me we're we're gonna go we're gonna go on it i'm very excited i've seen i think i saw teeks to play it for a bit and she was having a great time too that's a lie <laughs> Huh? That's weird. That's suspicious, friend. <laughs> oh, you're back? Does that mean that you've brought me my toothbrush of Hygienia? Yo, this man has cavities, bro. Yeah, you're you're totally a nun, Temmy, for sure, one hundred percent. So this is the legendary toothbrush. Ooh. What did you say about teaming up? Wait, what do you mean? Um, I was sorry. I was saying if you're talking about um the Mario Party thing, I was gonna say um just in case, like if anyone wants to play it, let me know because I really want to fucking play that game. I could like send the Twitter post so, like I I bookmarked it. Okay, actually, yeah, Snowy, God bless you. Yeah, send me DM that one to me too. DM me all the things that you want me to see. Did I jump scare you? You you yeah, did. I bet I did. Wow. Oh my god, so scared. So scary. I don't know, it's like healing magic or something. They say that it can kill all of the mouth's toxins in a flash. What what? Bro, I need that I need a magical toothbrush. My Twitter is just violence. I don't know about that. I was gonna say also by the way, Temmy, go back go 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 back to your date date, babe. Make sure that you're you're having a good date. Don't don't leave the don't leave your, your boyo hanging, bro. It's a gold beetle. Ooh, okay. Just can't stand it. Tooth monsters. What was I thinking? Tooth monsters are very real. You're a stand-up fellow, but not a great comedian, bro. I've seen them. I've seen things, bro. I've I've seen I've seen um dong monsters before in SMT, bro. I've seen things. Timmy Kubo, Timmy Kubo needs a smoke break. Oh my god, like don't fucking kill me, bro. Leave him hanging. Oh, yeah. yeah, for real. 
Don't leave your boyo hanging, bruh. Where's the other one? I know there's something here. It's hiding. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I see it. I mean, technically, technically though, like watching Attack on Titan with your significant other is a vibe. I have a few uh, a few anime that I would definitely recommend for you, but for you guys, by the way. But like, let me know if you wanna if you wanna watch more later. Also, thank you, Bones, for contributing to the cringe goal. Thank you, BB. We got some miraculous mead. Thanks. I never imagined that I would gaze upon this cup with my own eyes. Ot holy. Hydrate. Listen, I'm trying, okay? God, God. God, I fucking hate cold, though, for real. Um, God, what was I going to say? I don't remember. That's a T. Thank you, Bones, for giving Tammy a shout out, BB. Appreciate it. I was gonna say, um, by the way, because technically, um, um, I know that Tammy didn't want to give herself a shout out earlier, but everyone, please, if you're all streamers and you're small beans, please go follow everyone. Please support each other. Um, Tammy also is an amazing mod. I know that she she fully admits that. She likes to brag that. Um, she's also an amazing streamer. Please go and check her out. <laughs> and also, please go and check out Bones, too. I don't know if he gave himself a shout-out, but please go and check Bones out and give him a follow, too. Thank you. Wait, what? Don't get the wrong idea now. My brew would never lose to this cup, and if I drank from this, I would absolutely... I would be absolutely perfectly fine. Probably. But you never know, of course. Always a risk. And I can't afford to break my promise to you. Sorry, to support you, can I? Oh, okay, I see. Aw, that's a tea here. <laughs> Snowy's just like, where did that come from? B Bone Bones, when he comes in, he has to make sure that everybody gets their shadow. It is still on the agenda somewhere. Well, that's it's a tea here. Snowy is my mod, and he never gives himself a shadow. I tell him. I was I was gonna say um well it's 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 one of those things like I mean I I understand like sometimes like there's not like a it's not like a the best time for it it is what it is um but I would say um I would say that at least like if 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 it looks like it's okay to do it go for it like I wouldn't worry too hard just don't just don't like spam it that's all I hate doing myself nah I I would I would wait until there's like an opportunity where it's like it's like maybe like a little bit quiet or something and I'd be like I'd be like hey babes don't forget I exist and then. I'd awkwardly just be like, okay, bye, and like, thanks. It's a tea here. Right. No, I feel that, I feel that. Let's see. Um, I think we got everything here. Let me take a look at the questy westies. Do we have every, oh, do we have all the deadlines done? Let's fucking go. The post got taken down. <gasps> no! Nor. Oh my god, Nor. Wait, hold on. Did I just see? Oh my god. Oh my god. Deadass. Nightbot actually doing his job for once. That's crazy. I love that. All right. Okay. Let's go over to where were we going? The gauntlet let's runner. Go. We're going to go take a dump. No, I saw something. No, no. Hold on. All right. Then. Hold on. Hold on. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it there. Hold on. Let's go. I saw a bug. I need to get, I need to grab that. 
I was gonna say I feel you, but like self shadow is like self love. I mean, like if 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 your streamer again, like it, it just depends. If your streamer tells you like, hey, give yourself a shadow, like it's it's like whatever. Um, it sounds weird, but I mean it like sincerely. No, no, I I feel that. I mean, it's it's like the same thing. I'm gonna find some other fight videos that are cool. Oh, pff, oh my god, snowy! Oh my god, don't right. kill me. Let's go, go to the gauntlet runner. All right, we're gonna take a big fat dump. We're gonna take a big juicy dump and the game is totally gonna give me a, a stat boost. Pretty please. Right. I feel refreshed after spending some time in the bathroom. Got no, it. it didn't give me a stat boost. Oh, feels bad. Gonna go in the pantry. Gonna steal some stuff. Mellow milk and fragrant spice. Mm -hmm. Let's see, I think we have to go. I think well, we're going either to the do? forest or something. How far do I run her? Uh, Racia Forest no or how much? Seven. How long? Three fucking it's days. Your All right, Just we're gonna, yeah, we'll do this. The person making the request said it's infested with bird and bug monsters. Quite a remote place, it seems, too. Precisely why it is the perfect hideout for thieves and a potential trove of treasures that they may, leave, may have left behind. Wait, hold on. Uh. You know what? Okay, let me. Mm, it's your call. I guess I'll do it. It's fine. I feel like part of me wants to wait until we get further in the story to do it, but I mean, it's like whatever. Which way should we go? Wait, a choosing a route to your destination when multiple routes will take you to your destination in the same room is. You can choose which route to do. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. What? Let's be off. Okay, that's weird. Interesting. Huh. Maybe, maybe I should leave the uh, the last optimal dungeon for later. Let's see who who is busy, who is around. Time to do some cooking. I have like the best Twitter Twitter feed. Male thighs and fights. Oh my, bruh. Listen, you trying to rev my engine right now, bro? The funniest thing. Okay, listen. Okay, I'm gonna admit something to you guys, and like obviously I'm not gonna give you my Instagram because like it'd be kind of sussy, but. Um, my Instagram feed itself is literally like cute dogs and animals. And then the other half is literally just like a bunch of fucking sexy men. That's literally all it is. And I'm talking like, I'm talking like, like 11 out of 10, like every single person on my Twitter feed that I see is like disgustingly hot. Yeah. W Instagram for real. That it's actually fucking funny. Stop telling me to hydrate, bruh. It's been like two seconds. Bruh. I must say that I am impressed with this kitchen. Certainly a stark difference from what I've... Oh, it's this one. Never mind. She's just going to eat it raw. That's how she is. That's how she be. Oh, so we, sh we should have a new book. Oh, no, hold on, hold on. Hey, we have a new book here. The Future of Magic. Oh. He's obnoxious, but he does know a thing or two, so maybe we might learn something. It looks like a complicated book, too. So let's get comfy by the window before we dive in. Heck yeah. What's that? Sustainable Magical Living. What is he getting at? Anyway, the first chapter is called Thinking About Fuel and the Magical Future. All things considered, our world is still primitive, foolishly relying on wood and fire to warm and feed its people. This wood that we burn makes smoke, and the smoke pollutes the atmosphere and destroys life beyond our cities. Combustible fuels must be prohibited by law. Bro, this is literally... This is like an anti-fucking pollution PSA right now. And the void left there is where magic comes in, it says... In other words, he wants to do everything with magic instead of firewood. But what if, what if, uh, what if that ends up being a bad thing too? It won't work for everybody. 
I think it might work for some, but certainly not everyone. I agree. So few can afford igniters. Hell yeah. Did that make me wise? Ooh, see, I completely shut... I, sh I shut that shit down. Get dunk on, bro. <laughs> You're like, what the hell? Get out of here. People's lives in the present are important, but so is the future. I think that we should treat both with the respect that they deserve. Heck yeah. All right, we got two more two more chapters that we can go through for that, so I think we should be good. Oh. Curses. A bird of substantial size has been pecking away at the cockpit? Oh, hey, yo. Hey, it's battle time. It's just a bird. Nuke them. Let's go. These are just small fry. If we play it cool, oh yeah, it's just a regular bird. The Kandra. Ooh. All right, I see how it is. I see how it is. I'll be taking that. It's okay. Sorry. Merchant. I'm going to steal all the mech from this person. This is, I, I think we did this like yesterday too, but like we found out that there's like this really weird workaround for getting extra mag. You can literally just like spam the steal skill. And then if you know that your party is going to get refreshed MP after the battle, it's literally just free money. It's crazy. Yes, mommy. <laughs> Wait, so, oh my God. Did somebody make the fucking, did they make the sub, the, the, what is it? The, um, uh, the subbies badge of fucking thing. That's so Let's fucking go. funny. No. The next one's yours. Face me. Merchant. Ooh. This is nothing. Delicious. Oh power of heroes. It's okay. We're looking good here. Let us all power of kings. All right, we're good. I'm going to take this thing I out now. On royal power within. Is that all? <laughs> That's a team. Is I was going to say, by the way, did everybody get their subbies badge? Heisman's in real danger. He needs healing now. Like for real? It is so fucking cute. I love it. Elusive dream. Oh, go for it. They yet cling to life. Let's, I won't hold back. Done. More enemies. Still more. Brace yourself. Only one. I will fight with the prophet. Ooh. Okay. Nice hit. Okay. Again. Oh my god. Let my let's son. fucking go. I'm ready. Hey, uh. I shall vanquish evil. I defer to you. Merge it. Still up? I won't Come on, babe. Back. I just need another crit. Come no! No! There Why are you like this, bro? Get out of here. Let's keep this up. That's rude. At least we got a lot of mag. I wanted to actually kill that one, though. So sad. The gauntlet runner arrives in a land mm. thick with trees. I feel like this would be a the bad idea, but I feel like I have like my, my aloe vape in front of me, and I feel like I want to try hitting one time. Because it's, it's tasty. A He's good. Oh, just a heads up, by the way, guys. Um, we are going to take a five to ten minute break um, in about ten ish minutes. All right, oh, then. thank you for donating to the Cringe Girl BB. I appreciate it. Next time, next time I make a Cringe Girl, by the way, I didn't realize that it would like take super long to like fill out. Um, but I think I'm, I'll probably make it much lower. I'll make up for all the all the shit that I've caused. Indeed. Hmm. I think this will kick her butt. Mm -hmm. Well then. Oh, that's chest or something, right? Oh, okay. I was gonna say. Can I talk to somebody tonight? No. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna All go right. we're gonna go take a bath. We're gonna take a bubble bath. At the rear Let's deck. Go. <sighs> A Hell's Boiling Bath Bomb. Mm, yeah, sure. We'll do one of them. I don't know what this what the stat increases, though. I think it's like strength. It is so hot that my skin stings, and I can't stop sweating through each and every one of my pores. 
As the impurities drain from my body, so too do my heart's anxieties. My endurance increased. Oh, oh, okay, that's not bad. I still feel like I'm not gonna lie. I think that I'm gonna end up like spamming the agility one because apparently, um, apparently doing that is like extremely broken. Um, because every time an enemy misses you with an attack, they lose like half their turns. It's crazy. Oh, cat, thank you for contributing. I know it probably sounds fucking weird, but like honestly, you guys, like the cringe goal that we have for like the swigging of mouthwash. I'm telling you right now, like, it's actually going to be fucking disgusting. It's going to be one of the worst things I've ever fucking done. I can tell you right now. Hey, yo. Like, sometimes if I even have to, like, swig mouthwash for too long, like, it literally makes me want to throw up. Like, it's fucking disgusting. I might actually gag on stream. Time marches on, and the age oh, thank of you for giving, um, Cat of Shadow Bones. I appreciate it, BB. to pick <laughs> i hear a voice i mustn't allow things to remain the way that they are Ooh. um he's rank five she's rank four. Oh. okay this is actually good let me do that um oh time to take a shit hold on it's shitting time right got it I'm also gonna go ahead and cook too. I think there's like one more meal that we wanna cook too. Curious status elements for all allies. Oh my God. I can make a lot of that too. Hold on. Increases hit rate of one attack to one, we went to 100 for one ally. Oh, okay, I see. I see. Kind of sucks. I'm not gonna lie. Kind of sucks, but I will go ahead and I'll just make it now. <laughs> Girl, why are you so sad? Babe, what's wrong? Why do you look so sad? Ah, it's you. Sorry. I apologize, but I must ask that we save training for another time. Right now, I have some things that I would like to ponder alone. If so, could you spare a moment for me then? Since about Rodon, the Night Commander. Uh... My family found prominence through means beyond the wealth that we lacked. Scholarship mostly, with some having developed a taste for politics. I was the outlier. My single-minded pursuit of martial arts put me quite outside of their sphere. And perhaps my temperament, they had no idea what to do with me. Yes. My family offered me no meaning, sorry, no meaning worth pursuing. So I volunteered for the guard when I was still quite young. I thought that in the military, I could blaze my own trail on strength alone. But while such ideals were meaningless to House Hulkenberg. Oh, did she, did she get turned away? Does her family hate her? Before I had the chance to prove my abilities, they had already made arrangements for to assign me to the knights, ensuring that I would not disgrace the family name. But... But I was fortunate enough to meet Rodanth in the course of my training as a new recruit. He was born into a storied rogue household, but his house dissolved, and he joined the military after its decline. That's why. We were alike in that way, seeking to rise by our own individual efforts, regardless of familial background. Mm -hmm. What changed him? The truth is... After our training concluded, Rodanth was openly being considered for an appointment to the Prince's Royal Guard. <laughs> However, instead, it was I, still tender in years, who was ultimately selected. Rodanth lacked for nothing as a knight, and he and I were equals in all things, save that my family had put the right words in the right ears. Sounds about right. He was denied appointment to the Royal Guard, and instead he was sent to the front lines, alongside the common footmen of the state mm. army. I'm sure that he was probably frustrated. He made a name for himself and returned to the Order. But to see him rise to the rank of a commander in such a short period of time... Um... Are you trying to say that you respect him? No. Rodan's current behavior does not befit a knight commander, and it hardly bears saying that we cannot allow such abuse of power. Even if I am partly responsible for his attachment to power, 
Nay, indeed, I it would be all the more reason to intervene. Mm. But I cannot help but wonder whether it is even my place to judge him. Even as I sought to carve my own path, my knighthood only came at my family's behest. And after failing to protect my charge, I left the capital a wanderer. I... Girl. He's got like, uh, what is that word? It's like, um, it's got like that disorder where she's like, she feels like she's like inferior or something, probably. All of these lofty words, what weight do they bear from one such as I, a knight errant and erred, failed in her solemn duty? No. That is not who you are, Hulkenberg. <sighs> Yet even if I now say my course, then what of my past self? What if what if she who wandered? Once upon a time, I thought myself righteous, and I respected order, and brought many a criminal to justice, and I saw many a punishment mended out. Alas. And yet looking back, I know it was a matter of convenience, a way to disguise the weakling that I was, my knightly standing a replacement for the family that I had broken. Of course, in my time as a knight, I failed to protect the prince, and I abandoned my post to seek him out with no more honor than a feat than a knight. Okay, to be fair, now, you know what? I see, I can see where she's coming from now because technically, if she failed to pretend, sorry, if she failed to protect the prince, then technically, I mean, it is technically her fault. Yeah, she has like imposter syndrome. See, that there's that too, but then there's also the fact that technically, and I for, I don't know why the fuck I forgot, but um, she, um, she ended up like completely failing to protect the prince from like an attack or something. So, like, for her to be in that position as, like, a royal knight and fuck it up, like, really fucking hard. Apparently, apparently they fucked up really bad. Um, the actual guy, Rodanth, probably was, like, sitting there just like, bro, like, I could have been in that position. It could have been me. I could have stopped it. And she probably knows that. So, I kind of, I feel like I understand where she's coming from a little more. I fled my family, and I fled my knighthood. Rodanth, he sees this in me. Very and clear. Who am I to claim my chivalry over him? Would you run so again? Then. So you would repeat the past and run from her damp? <laughs> oh my... <laughs> Bro. I... No, I was simply afraid. Afraid to face him. And afraid of facing who I once was. <laughs> did uh, I jump scare you? Oh my god, wow, you yeah, got me. I wow. Did. Wow, Bones, thank you. I'm not gonna lie, unless I'm playing like a genuinely scary game, I don't know if that's gonna scare me, but but nice try though. I can show you the world. Thank you, Aurora. It'll be fine. Oh, okay then. What the fuck? Why did I just pull out a fucking dagger? Excuse me. <laughs> that was so random. I'm like, I'm like, yes, we're all friends here. Just pulls out a fucking sword. You know. Tis the way of a broken sword, I suppose. Oh, it's the sword that we broke earlier. Oh, I completely fucking forgot. I'm like, what the fuck is she talking about? Brute force will avail avail it nothing, huh? But still. I see. Bro, imagine doing that in real life. You go up to your you go up to a, like one of your friends and you're like you're like you're like, no, we're best friends, and you just pull out a fucking dagger. That'd be crazy. But you've always been there to remind me. I am truly indebted to you. Know that you have my sincerest thanks. Hulkenberg seems like she has realized something, and I sense a further deepening of our bond. How deep can this bond go, though? Let's find out. Wow. Rank 5. While in reserve, the amount of experience, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so she... I think um, if we can get everyone to max rank, then we can take them off the team. I can replace everybody. If I may, I would like some time alone with my thoughts. When I have found my answers, let us speak here again. Sounds good to me. Sounds Gucci. The gauntlet runner arrives at the Gracia Forest, temperate and fertile. It was once a place of repose, where the songs of fairies echoed throughout. But as the furnace of commerce demanded its wood, the fairies began to vanish. And having lost its divine protection, monsters made their dens. Can we just like talk about how beautiful the artwork is for the world map here? Like it's literally just a big painting canvas. It's like a what is this like a water painting or something? Looks really nice. Stonen. I wish I had talent like that where I could just paint. <laughs> I could just do something. I'm more I'm more of like a like a Photoshop editor kind of guy. 
we're here now. My, this forest is quite dense. Assassins could be hidden throughout and we would never know. Huh? Must you be so grim? There are not any assassins out here. I'll be fine. Yeah, the assassins would just get bored out here. Right? right? Those Shadow Guard days did a number on you, he's me. I was no. going to say, bro, imagine they're actually out here waiting for us, though. We did stand out at the exhibition, though, and it makes sense that someone might actually seize the chance to take us down a peg. <laughs> I'm just saying. It's true. We are might mighty but few. Were even one of us to go missing, it would jeopardize our participation in the tournament. Uh. Enough of that. We're here. This is where we are supposed to collect ingredients for the medicine. Well Oh, well, I was just half-joking anyway. We need a count of seven samples of dragon thistleberry, right? Yes, although apart from assassins, do any of you feel a strange presence? A rather large one? That reminds me. Oh, the herbalist mentioned that. How strange birds can show up near dragon thistle. There's going to be a big fat Almost. bird. Is that big fat bird on my way? The same photoshopper here because I yeah can't draw at all. Yeah, I was going to say, oh, you feel me then. You understand. You understand my struggles. Like, don't get me wrong, like, I can try and draw things, or I can try to do stuff, but, like, at the end of the day, like, my expertise is, like, being a Photoshopper. Like, I would rather edit things, or, like, use, um, use, like, other software to kind of, like, edit things and, like, do stuff for me, and then I can go in and I can edit it after the fact, if that makes sense. I'm, like, a, I'm, like, an after the effects guy. I can't do digital art because I can do pen and brush. That's actually really good too, though, because technically, although I know some people actually prefer, I, I know that they prefer to do digital stuff because of Photoshop and the convenience for it. Um, technically, there is a very good market for, for in real life stuff. So like if you made like paintings or you did like really cool stuff um, or like whatever, you could sell it at like a really good venue. Like if you if you if you manage to get like pictures of your artwork and show it online, like I'm pretty sure that you could you could sell it for a lot of money at some point if you build your way up. I designed stuff and I created my PVFP myself. Ooh, wow. I could never, but I mean I would rather pay someone to make my PFP myself TBH. It's a GG. Especially oh sorry, I love painting and especially creative art and theatrical stuff too. Ooh. I've never been to an opera before, if we're talking about theatrical stuff. Um, I really wish I could go one day. There's apparently an opera house nearby in Edmonton here. I would love to go. <laughs> Bugs are a key resource for the Thrifty Traveler. Uh, no, no. It... I've already I've already lost interest because of her. She's making me sick. Makes me want to throw up. All right, let's see. What did I want to do here? I think there's like a... Mm, okay, then. Yeah. I think there's like a boss here too. Let me double check the quests instead before we go through, but just give me one second. Hey. Our goal is to collect some dragon thistle berries, correct? Yeah. Right, there are a lot of territorial mm. birds. Yeah. Alright. Let's let's see here. Um not that one. Oh, yeah, we have to do that too. Um, okay, there's that. Thistleberry. Okay, maybe it's just that one. Maybe it's the deeds one. Oh no, that's from the tower. Okay, well maybe it's just um maybe it's just that. Oh, that's weird. Well that's a tee. Okay, so T, um, I'm going to take a break. We're going to take a five to ten minute break. Um, everyone, please go grab your, uh, go grab your snackies, go grab water. Um, I'm going to take a look and see if I can actually order some food as well in a hot minute, as I think. Um, just in case, because I don't want to accidentally get lightheaded during stream again. Not really about that. Um, I'm going to go check out my work too, make sure that my work is not blowing up on me. But when we are back, we will continue. We will continue the dungeon. So. Excuse me, Stream Deck. What is your problem? Sorry. The fuck was that? That was weird. Did y'all see that? I just got muted twice in a row. What the fuck was that? And that was not my fault. That was Stream Deck. What did I walk back into? I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know. Um, okay, let me let me try that one more time. Okay. Okay, welcome back, everyone. Um, so we're going to be... Uh, we're gonna end up doing. Um, we're looking for. We're looking for dragon thistleberries. I think they said in this dungeon, there should be a boss here, um, and then we have another dungeon that we have to try to go into. I don't know if we're gonna do it during the time that we have, 
Um, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. If they give us enough time, I'm down to do it. But we shall see. Also, yeah, it is what it is. God has a plan. Apparently, apparently, Stream Deck just wanted me to be muted, apparently. They didn't want you to hear me. Oh, I've about had it with this place. Maybe I should just burn it to the ground. Hang on. Oh, come on. There are other people here, too, you know. Don't be so dramatic. Yeah, same. Why are you so dramatic, bro? Sorry, I'm just on my last nerve. What with all of these birds and bugs darting around? Right. Yeah, they wouldn't be easy targets for swords and spears. A weapon that could attack them from afar would seem more useful. I should have brought a bow with me. I mean, I mean, I can technically, I can put something on. But if I'm the merchant class, I think we should be okay. It's not like we're planning on doing grinding. It should be good. All right, let's see. Yeah. Gonna be some susy little bugs, boogies and birds here. Look. Hey, are, they the, are those the berries that we're looking for? Mm. Yep, there's no mistaking right. them. Great, let's just go and pick what we need and get this over with. Ooh, I got a mag. Wait, hold on. Did I get a magla pill for killing that bug? No, 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 no. Excuse me. I could farm here for magla pills, bro. What the hell? Oh man, now I'm sad. Now, I'm, now I'm mad, you guys. That's rude. He wants to grill a bird. I would very much like to grill a bird. I feel you, girl, but I don't, I don't, I don't know about that one. Do they actually drop those? Hold on. They do! What the f Are you kidding me? Bro, that is so suspicious. That is so sussy. Except, oh god, oh Jesus. That was the last of them. That scared me. Where the fuck did that manticore come from? Oh my god. Exemplary. Haha. <laughs> hey the hey you there. Are you feeling lucky? What? Oh, it's that talking tooth again. Any more good advice, Toothy? When your luck is good, enemies will drop more loot and you'll land more critical hits. There's a lot of benefits. Attacks that will hit multiple times will actually hit lots of times, and you'll also recover from status ailments quicker. <gasps> what? Oh my god. Bro, if I had known that earlier, I would have kept I would have kept pouring my stuff into into luck. Oh my god. I think what I'll do, I'm gonna get magic and I'm gonna get magic to maybe magic and strength to, to 30, and then we're gonna pour everything into luck. I think that's probably the, the next best thing. That would probably be good. Because we can just get agility. Well, we can get luck through the bathroom too, but we can also get agility from uh, from like the bath salts or whatever. I need to go kill this thing. Hold on. There you go. Okay, we're actually gonna kill it this time. Hell yeah! All right. Ooh. Okay, what do we get? What do we get? I want to see. And with the unscathed, it's like 2,000. Oh, hell yeah. That's nasty. That's a dishwashing, bro. God, it's like free real estate, literally. What the fuck? Well, you know it'd be fun if anyone wants to do like a, a question of the day, a QT, QOTD. I'd be down for that. Does anyone have a question of the day that everyone can can answer? The only thing I can think of is because we're in a jungle. It would be like one of those things where it's just like, what if it was like jungle themed? What would you what would you bring to what would you bring to an island if you got deserted on it kind of deal? Poison stinger. Ooh. How much do we have? Okay, we're actually doing pretty good. We're doing good. I go up there. I think it rounds us up right back to the beginning there. 
Oh, there's a berry there. Mm -hmm. I was right. It's a dragon thistle berry. I knew it. I knew. I literally... What the fuck? I see that thing flying up there. What the hell? What do you mean? What do you mean you're not dead yet? Oh my god, ew. Ew. Great find. Keep it. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of bugs, by the way, if it wasn't obvious. I'm trying to think. I have mm, Okay, I can name I can name like three different fears off the top of my head of what I have. I have a fear of blood. I'm not about that. That includes things like blood drawing and like other weird shit too. Um let me see what else we have. I think it's, um, is it phasmophobia or something? It's like fear of like deep water, like anything with like the ocean. Not about that either. I think people have tried to get me to play, um, Subnautica or like some other shit too. And like that shit is not a vibe. I'm not about that. And then bugs, spiders and bugs, anything like that. Not about that. Just take it. Ooh. Nice try. Got him. All right, let's see. Um, wait, is that is that not gonna loop me all the way back down? Hold on. Oh my god, it's not. Nice. Nor. Hey. Hey, wait, hang on. Do you feel that? Wait, what? Oh, we're done now, aren't we? No. No, I hear something, and it's coming this way. Raw. Is it a crab? Oh. What? What is that? It looks like a. It almost looks like a, like a dragon bird. That's cool. It's pretty. Oh, it's like a. It's like a cockatrice or something. It's a cockasados. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I know why they call it that. Oh. <laughs> That's a he here. All right, let's see how much damage we can actually do here. <sighs> Excuse me, no. Disgusting. Ooh, okay, that's what I'm talking about. Lurking Nightblade. What was that? Decreases their hit innovation for three turns. Here we go. Merchant. Nice one, bro. What Just has she got? Prevail. Elusive Dream. Um, main one hit kill. Uh That's like whatever. Come forth, royal soul. Damn, I'm not gonna lie, this boss is a little stronger than I would have thought. Please and breath. Nice try. Now accept your fate. Now, what's the play? Hell yeah. Um, what do I want to do here? Maybe like a fairy dust. Let's try this. Thanks. My thanks. I'm obliged. With blade in hand. Oh, right. Merchant. Oh my god, that's disgusting, bro. It's so nasty. And it, it's only gonna get worse once we get the upgraded merchant class too. Oh my god. Bruh, get out of here. Let justice prevail. Nice dodge. Wow. You're here. Face me. Run. Apologies. Would you finish it? I call upon royal power within. To you, come forth, royal soul. Give me your money. I'm gonna take all your money. The pick of death. What? Excuse me. Someone help her get back in the fight. That was rude. I was saving this. My spirit is No holding back. Is 
Wait, did that fully recover her HP because I had the thing on? Oh my god, don't kill me, bro. Okay, yeah, 10 out of 10. I think the merchant class, if you have every... I, I'm telling you right now, if we could bring this class into like the final boss of the game, I'm pretty sure we'd destroy it. 100%. Now accept your fate. Commendable bearing. I shall vanquish evil. Delicious. I like that. I defer to you. Let's go. Nice hit. That was perfect. Okay. We can do this. Merchant. Nice. Got a tower white mask. That'll do, Pig. That'll do. Hero's leaf of light too. I feel stronger already. We get something nice from that. I feel like I should have tried to steal from it too, but I mean, mm, I may have so. forgot to steal from it. It's fine. Indeed, all young novice soldiers apparently attacked by monsters in unfamiliar territory. Oh, yeah, we have to change that. I guess that thing it started like killing everyone that would walk into the forest here. Yes. This bad. Are any of us content to live in a world that leads its lambs to the slaughter? Is that a, is that a joke? Is that a trick question? I would hope not. All right. Shall we head back to the entrance? Um, yes. That's I still want to quickly map out the rest of the map, but other than that, we're good. Let me just go back in here. see here it's literally oh my god <laughs> it was just that one part of the map that i didn't touch ew that's rude we won't lose this First fight ours. come forth royal soul it's still up it's okay we're looking good here you think yourself eat much i'll take this all yours I defer to you. Coin can solve problems of... Let's go! The magic seed! Alright, we're Gucci. I can get out of here now. That little bit of extra That'll mag, too, is definitely going to help us when we have to start buying things. Time to go back to the base. I don't know if they're going to send me back to the town, or if they're actually going to give me the opportunity to keep going to the other dungeon. Mmm... I feel like they won't. I feel like they're gonna skip past it. Hey. Yeah, let's just go. Okay, then. Right. It's dinner time. Wish it were me. I <laughs> wish I could be having food right now. It's back to the Brylhaven Tavern. Certainly. Dragon Thistleberry, was it? I believe that we got all that we're uh, that we were asked to retrieve. Yeah, I didn't think that we would have to go up against a Kakasaros to get them, though. A Kaka what now? There's nothing... I'm sorry, there's nothing to be done about that. If someone suddenly took your food away, then you would likely... Sorry, you would be likely to attack them as well. Oh, well. Whatever its reasons were, the deed is done. Let us deliver the goods when we've got time. Looks food look good. Food look delicious. Mm. Time marches on, and the age of a new king draws nearer. Should we do? <laughs> no, I'm Barton Nor. Hey, those are the samples of Dragon Thistleberry. Here you go, babe. I think she was gonna use that to make medicine. I think, right? For that. It should be enough to ensure that everyone gets the proper treatment. I can't thank oh, you enough. Right. Well, I'm glad to hear it. Hopefully, they can all make a, a full recovery. I can never repay you enough. But please accept this token of my gratitude. It's some money, as well as the leftover medicine. Ooh, okay. Is it special medicine, though? Or... Because I'm kind of full. My inventory's kind of full right now, babe. Perhaps now I can be forgiven. What? 
some some time ago my son was attacked by patrolling the bo uh, patrolling the border and there was a medicine shortage at the time so i could only watch as he slipped away from the pain this time i will vow to save those young lives though i know nothing i do will absolve my sins i was gonna say it won't happen again babe right yeah. young people dying on the front lines and medicine shortages making things worse it's not one person's fault the entire country has gone wrong we're working to make sure that tragedies like this will never happen again I see. Is that what drives you to fight? Well, you can count on me among your supporters. Hell yeah. God bless. God bless America. Alright, where... Alright, then. Where's the crier area? I think it's over by... This area here. Just give me one second. Where is that? Where is that? I think it was over here. I have a feeling that I mm, I may have accidentally missed doing one of the debates or whatever, but I mean, like, it's not like the game actually tells you when they're happening, so not my problem. Oh, no, he's here. Oh, is he actually here? Oh, God. Okay, hold on. All right, I'm going a, I'm to a whoop this guy's butt. I'm going to out-debate this man. I don't remember I don't remember which one of you it was, but somebody somebody said that like they really found this man attractive. Was it you, Angel? Was that was that Angel or was that somebody else? I don't remember. What is this? Come to tear me down a peg, have you? Well, if it's a battle of words that you want, I accept the challenge. I would prefer to strike with more direct methods, but I will spare you for Count Luis's sake. You will realize soon that I, soon enough that I am the rising star. Your little help anyone in need shtick is a farce, and I can't believe anyone is falling for it. I'll make sure that you pay for it tenfold. Me. When I take my place among the upon the throne, I will reform this rigged society into a true meritocrat. Merit How do you say that? Meritocracy? Merit what? Meritocracy? What? Merit Meritocrat. I don't know. I'm not gonna. I I'm not gonna bother anymore. I tried. I tried my best, guys. We live in a society where tribe and family name matter more than will or ability. Are we sheep to accept such a, such a world, or are we lions who will devour it? As king, I will appoint only those who can demonstrate true strength, even those from inferior birth. That is true equality. He's certainly abrasive, but he does make a good point. Haven't we heard all of this before? I think I think he's like mimicking Luis's shtick as well. You only, yeah, he's only parroting him. Hang on. Your words are mere echoes of Luis. Do you have any original ideas? What? what, my words? You don't understand. Count Luis and I have simply come to the same conclusions. Well, if that is the case, then I would just rather, I, was, I would honestly rather just support Luis. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Oh, I feel kind of bad for him. Right, I had the same feeling as well. I'm glad it wasn't just me. Bro. Damn it. And that's literally all it takes for him to get knocked down by. I knew it. Wow, that was an amazing debate. Glodel was seething. A lot of people appreciated what you said, and they wanted to give you this as a show of thanks. Works for me. All right. Money and stat boosts. Ooh. Wow. And another ranking to 36. Ooh, okay. Hmm. Oh, Interesting. is it Brigida? I would like to know more about him. Ooh, okay. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. What now? What is his, what is his thing saying? Oh, it's only, we have to get him to rank eight to get this one though. That's the only thing. I don't I don't know if I want to talk to him just yet. Is there somebody else? Ooh, okay. We can go talk to Ooh. We can go talk to Brigida. Uh. This is good. Rank five. What's her what's her rank six? Hold on. I think we have to get her. Oh, we do have to get her to rank 8. Oh, okay, I see. 
uh reduces the mag cost of merchant boosts the exchange rate at the mag exchange i guess it's not bad i mean if we can get her to i, I guess if we can get her to like rank six or seven i'm not mad about that all right let's go talk to her what's our wife what's our wife doing i didn't expect you to show up do you hear the criers everyone the anti-igniter terrorist hideout has been burnt to the ground local village a front for criminal fiends torched thanks to the renowned igniter merchant lady brigitte elysian we didn't do anything are you serious those fear mongers cried of the dangers of magic igniters and planned to raid our, our royal capital grand trad once its people were unarmed hear ye, hear ye. however they have been brought to justice through the overwhelming power of magic igniters three cheers for lady brigida three cheers for magic igniters bro they they murdered an entire village for that and there you have it what 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 do they mean burnt to the ground it says the crier says that entire village it went up in a sea of fire everything was a lie they did all of this just to fucking make her do something they wanted her to lash out or something um and then she did she didn't so they went and they burned down the village anyway are you kidding me i didn't do anything but the people that i met then at the village they're dead now those people they were no anti-igniter group it was the sanctus church or rather those who perform its dirty work they want the world to see that igniters are the only defense that they have against the violence around them and so they set a village ablaze to prove their point and by taking my dog of, <laughs> of course of, and by taking my dog they made me a tool in their scheme bro i can't, I can't fucking i can't deal with this this is so funny Even though, even though you stopped me before anything happened, someone else raised the village and named me responsible. Right? In short, this is a warning. From here on, they will ask nothing less than total unquestioning obedience. No, I'm going to fuck them up. So what do you plan to do now? <laughs> Killing some churchmen will not change anything, not when the entire institution is rotten. This, this world is a horrific place defined by inequality and intolerance and the ones who shaped it are the wealthy few who sit atop it in other words the church in those days i had friends of my own when i was a child of poverty and even though sorry even through all of the sludge and the mire we survived together and broke bread together and they all died slow starvation or torture took them the Sanctus Church wheedles the strong and takes from the weak, their wealth and their lives. I remember holding their cold bodies in my arms, and that's when I decided from then on I would be the be, sorry I would be the one doing the taking. If the weak one all sorry if the weak always die and if they'll lose everything, then I would become strong. I would be on the side that takes, and I wouldn't let anyone else steal what I had. I swore it. I threw away my heart. I threw away my hope, and now I have clawed my way here made myself an underling of the same church that killed my friends this is getting a little <laughs> deep oh and still even once you climb out of hell there's only another circle of it waiting for you it never ends tis true that is why it is called the, the circles of hell as they call it <laughs> how far must i fight them how must how much how much must i take from them to ensure that i they can no longer tear things from my grasp <sighs> it'll be your head next so I will be the church's slave. I will be whoever they need me to be. Girl, what are you doing? And nearing the three hour mark. Yes, let's go. We're almost at three hours. Thank you for thank you for letting me know, Angel. Are you playing? What are you doing right now? Are you playing game? Are you work? Or you're not working, right? Are you playing game right now? What you doing? Let's see. Um. but oh you have a homie over okay make sure make sure you focus on your homie baby no worries we're doing okay here love you do your skumas things will never change that way shut up. oh shut up <laughs> bruh mwah, 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 mwah. with all you must have been through how can you live a life like that and still believe in light 
Oh, thank you for posting the Discord link, by the way. How can you live a life like that and still believe in light in this world? <laughs> why do you... Why won't you let me give up? Brigitte's vulnerability and her desire to be saved are bringing pain to my heart. Oh, I was going to say, by the way, technically, um, the command list that we do, it's um, without the S. Do it, do it, do it without the S. It'll show the actual command list that we have. The one that we have on Wisebot, I don't think I have it on there. There you go. It's easier that way. It'll just like let you do everything there. No, you're no, you're good. You're good. It's one of those things like unless like I have people actually like do it enough times, like it, it's like it's literally like a difference in like one letter. Ooh. Go get Skuma, 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 so that I don't have to. When you think of this world that you want to create, what do you imagine there? smiling faces a place where you can smile i would hope i see well maybe there will come a day do you really think that the girl that died that day could live again i wish i could have a heart like yours strong and beautiful oh my god oh, she's trying to riz me up right now okay <laughs> i feel like ooh. i calmed brigitte down and i waited until she fell asleep before i left the room Time wait what on. And the age of a new king we we, we were waiting for her to fall asleep well that was weird oh that's sussy i didn't know that we were at that level of friendship apparently let's go let's see um how many days do we have left eight i mean we, sh we should have enough time that we can we can do the other dungeon the only thing though is that i don't uh, I don't, I don't want to do Barnon right now. I just, I don't know. Maybe we should start doing the actual story quest. Let me take a, let me take a All look right. at the map real quick here. Actually, no, let me take a look at this, the not? quests. Let, let's look at quests first. Satihi, enjoy your lurkies, BB. Um, Relic Surge, I think that was for Nurus, I'm pretty sure. Uh, they want us to go there. Ooh. I need to slay the Orgus in the tower. Yeah, assassin or faker. Um, I suppose he wants to hear an angel story. I think that was for that one too. Okay. All let's right. just um let's go to we're Martira too. and the capital. And we're just gonna take a little look to see if there's any additional quests that we can do. Let's see. Okay, hold on. Where, where did Lu, uh, Stroll say his thing was? Saying that his inheritance is in Grand Trad. No. Yeah, you know what? Let me let me go talk to him real quick because maybe he's gonna tell me where we can go. I don't remember. Regarding the inheritance, if you're willing to look. Sorry, if you're willing, can you look into who knew my father? Sorry, who, who my father knew? I have an investigation of my own to attend to, so it's best that we divide and conquer. Oh, okay. Okay, I guess I guess they just want us to go. We're just gonna have to run right, run around. Um Grand Trad. Let me go let me go take a shit though before um before we do that. Alright. Can we get our luck up? Use the toilet, please. Did it get luck? Oh, oh my god, let's go. Let's go. Okay, hold on. What's our stats at? Ooh. Delicious. I like that. Got it. Let me actually double check what is my food at. Ooh. Okay, so apparently. They're on their way. Let me actually double check to see what it says to them. Mellow milk and fragrant spoils. Mm. What time is it? 56. Oh, okay. It'll be here in about, I mean, around 10 minutes or some or something or whatever. All right, That's not bad. Let's head there right away. Oh. Uh, let's go Wait, to yeah. Grand let's Trad. Go. We have to go talk to literally everybody. 
Oh yeah, no worries. Welcome in, sexy. Um, if anyone here is uh, is available, can you give sexy a shout out for me? I would appreciate that. Um, everyone, go please and check out sexy's channel and drop him a follow. He's very very awesome. Um, loves to play good games. We also hang out usually during community nights. He's very awesome. Um, knows a lot of people in the community. Um, and he plays D and D. So if anyone here likes D and D, go for that, please. Enjoy your D and D. Enjoy your lurkies. Um, let's see here. Um, we have apparently we have to talk to literally everybody though. So I don't know who we're gonna find. We're just gonna we're just gonna skim through everything. To get extremely fast because I don't know where I'm supposed to go here. I'm gonna speed read. The legendary hero kings could all fight without igniters. With someone like that, we would have no fear for humans. Damn it all. What's he saying? Why are you acting like that, bro? Excuse me. Mumble, mumble. You know, it's interesting. I'm going to bring it up again because I just remembered it, but I think um, during that one cutscene, Forden was talking about apparently the Elder Race, and he was saying something about how the Elder Race apparently, um, this is not the first time that they have tried to get under his skin and tried to um, to get in his way or something is what I think they were saying. Um, I find that very interesting because as far as we know, we are the only Elder around in this area. So it kind of makes me want to see the, the Elder Race or like see the village that they live in. Get some more info. Oh, get your fish, get your fish. Oh, is it this guy here? Hold on. It might be him. Hey, that reminds me. I had business with a fishmonger. I should talk to him. Oh, is this not the same? Is this something else? Welcome. Welcome, welcome, one and all. If it is swam in the rivers or rivers or seas, then I have I have got it here, and it is all fresh as the ocean breeze. Apparently, Stroll's father frequented the fish market. Oop! This is the guy. This is him. You are acquainted with his son, really? Now, I hate to break it to you, lad, but you're an elder, and Clamar nobles are not really known for befriending your kind. I'm actually looking for his inheritance. What are you playing at? If this, if this is some matter of pawn, then I will make it known far and wide, especially if it concerns the Count of Halia. He saved my skin once, and some pain in the Ars Noble started making accusations about my produce. He happened to be there, and he stood up for me. From what I gather, he was the only sorry he was only in the markets to find a souvenir for his son. Fancy that a noble buying things for himself? Well, that's crazy. Like father, like son. Blimey, you really do know him, don't you? Well then, I know another merchant that you should speak to. He did a fair amount of business with the Count. That day, he said that he had an appointment to meet with his sorry with this merchant in front of Regaleth Grand Cathedral. Odd that he bought the fish first, eh? Wait, so it's just over there? Oh, okay. Apparently, wait, what? If it's not over here, maybe it's on the other side. What do you oh, is want? it this one? What do you want? You are not one of my clients, and I only do business via referral. Troll's father went to meet a merchant in front of Regaleth Grand Cathedral. Could this be him? So foolish, it arouses Indeed, great I was pity. acquainted with the late Count of Halia. Oh, is that so? You say that you know his son, do you? The Count was a truly honorable, upstanding man. I doubt that any son of his would associate with riffraff like it. Excuse me? This merchant is still suspicious of me. What should I say next? Did his fish stink? What? Nah, this is rude, bro. Thanks to my overwhelming imagination, I was able to choose words that convinced the merchant that I have no ill intent. Mm. Oh, interesting. Yes, they did in indeed stink. The Count would often buy fish himself and then show up for our meetings with them in hand. 
Amusing as it was, I was worried about how he would keep them fresh. That stir some memories. The Count of Halia that I remember was a magna magnanimous man, and he was genuinely kind oh, to all that he would meet. Perhaps I should have learned from his example. Very well. Tell me your story and I will listen. Hmm. I see. Well, you must forgive my suspicion. You truly are a friend of his son, are you not? I do apologize, but surely you understand my caution. Word of, a, of his lost inheritance has spread, and con men have tried every trick in the book and to I claim it. I have indeed been entrusted with the inheritance always meant for the Count's son. Please give him that message. The rest are details that I would prefer to share with him directly, so please bring him with you when you are able. Hell yeah, let's fucking go. I found the person who was entrusted with the Count's inheritance. Ooh. I don't know if it's going to take up time to do that, but I mean, at least we can report that in. All right, let's see. Um, while I'm over here, let me go ahead and let's go talk to the giant, the, the king statue here. The coronation roll. Ooh, okay, I like that. Very nice. Let's go. Let's go talk to our boy. Wait, hold on. It says it's gonna do a rank up, though. No. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave him alone for for right. now. Mm, oh, hold on, hold on. No, you know what? Let me let me go talk to him because I'm pretty sure that we're gonna need to do it anyway at some point. And if I go on the Gauntlet Runner, then we're not gonna have enough time to to do all the other quests too. Hey. The merchant that Stroll's father entrusted with his inheritance. Blah 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 blah. blah. Okay, let's go. Oh, it is so nice to finally meet you. Well, we have met, but you were just a babe in your mother's arms. Funny how much you have come to resemble them both. Your father and I did charity work, providing aid to the downtrodden. It was hardly lucrative, uh, but I was quite taken by his charisma. He did charity work in the capital. Well, I, I hardly knew that his business was... Uh, sorry, I hardly knew his business here, to be honest. My connection to your father is ultimately what led me... Sorry, what led him to entrust your family fortune to... My guardianship. I am pleased to finally put it in your rightful hands. No. I don't mean to pry, but have you decided what you will do with it? That is. I had thought to use it to rebuild our house, but to hear my father use his fortune to help people, I admit that I am having some second thoughts. The refugees of Halia are struggling to survive without permanent housing, and knowing this, I would put these funds to the needs of my house. Hmm. It would take tremendous time and money to restore our territory. And I wouldn't be able to tend to their sorry to their hardships for many seasons to come. Ah. You are truly a stroll lad, right down to your father's strength of character. If I might be so bold, Tihi, what do you say? If I might be so bold, allow me to present you with an option. Oh. It would work thusly. You purchase a parcel of land from your pick of the gentry, and then many are in desperate need of coin and would easily part with estates that they cannot sustain. You could then offer this land to your people to build upon. Would that not give them solace? True. Kind of like, so kind of like being like, "Hey, like here's a sheet piece of land. Do whatever you want with it," kind of thing. Interesting. I see the wisdom in it, but I can't imagine that finding such an ideal expanse in such short time. Well, if it's the negotiations that you're concerned about, then this is where I come in. Right. Perhaps you've heard of the name of Lord Hydran, best known for his piety. Wait, what? Do you have anyone else? <laughs> Excuse me. I love that our instant answer is just like, um, can we pick somebody else, please? <sighs> so you do know him. Well, I can't appreciate why you would recoil from him. But for such an occasion as this, um, he would be a potent ally. I dare say that he would be precisely the savior that you would need to realize your ideals. Ooh. My ideals. Yes. I apologize. I'm just caught off guard by how quickly these ties are changing. I gladly accept your generous offers to aid me in negotiations. Mm. Interesting. Hope is only a step behind a clear conscience. No. Words that I would hear, for, hear my mother and father say often, they practically bludgeoned me with it. <laughs> they instilled you with wise words. Yeah. Only now do I see that. Back then I just couldn't appreciate it. Hmm. If I can, sorry, if I can procure new land, all of those people could return to some semblance of the lives that they were forced to abandon. They could go back to a time of peace before the human attacked. Just... And you have no small role to play here. You know that, don't you? 
If treachery claims the throne, then this whole country will fall to ruin, and I will have no hope of saving the people of Halia, let alone realizing my ideals. Hey. In other words, the future of many depends on our fight. Our hope lies with you, Captain. Is that rank six? Whatever nice. burdens you carry, I'll carry them too. Battle hypnosis while in reserve stroll gain experience at a normal rate. Ooh. Okay, nice, nice. Thank you. I owe you my thanks for discovering the man safeguarding the inheritance. It was surely no easy feat to find him. You're a lifesaver. I know. <laughs> I know I am. Thank All you. Right. All right. Oh, we're already halfway up to tolerance level four, too. God damn. We're moving very fast. I'm not going to lie. Things have definitely been picking up. If you don't mind me asking, did you hear anything else about my father in the search? Um, He loved his son. <sighs> Only that he loved his son to the ends of the world. Oh, come off it. You've gone a bit over the top with that one. He's like you're <sighs> reaching. Were my father in the same position that I am now, I wonder what he would do. Is it thundering tonight? A little stormy. Back to the Brylehaven Tavern. All right, let's just let's take a look here. Alonzo. Uh, see, as much as mm, as much as I want to do Alonzo, the only thing though is that we should probably. I guess we should technically do some more, more of this. Ah, oh, it's you. Why, hello there. For all of the time that we spend in battle, it is good to rest our wings every once in a while, huh? Oh, my apologies, but I must ask a favor of you, specifically concerning my son's urn. Anything for you, babe. I love him so much. I would like to search the village. If you're otherwise un unengaged, might we head there? Let's go. I'm in your debt. I'm going to find the people that stole his son's ashes, and I'm going to fucking burn them to death and hang them. I'm just saying that right now for everyone here. On guard for monsters, we made our way cautiously by carriage to the forest near Hazemay's village. By Dadari's account, the remains were not anywhere in the village. He searched homes, streets, and even crawl spaces, but he found no sign of it. Yet it was surely the work of a villager, no doubt that they had hid the urn somewhere that it would not be found. And they did not have they they would not have had much time, scant moments to hide it to avoid arousing suspicion, which means that our culprit must have probably buried it somewhere or taken it out of the village sure. maybe they rushed it out of the village i agree if there's no sign of it within the village bounds then that would be the logical next step suppose that it went like this a villager d disagrees with tadari but isn't confident in speaking out directly and then they suddenly find themselves alone with the, with the urn they then seize the bones and hurry outside the village an act of impulse then if true, then we are sure to find some traces on this road leading to the village. Let us keep an eye out as we move along. I just hope that we get to the ashes before a monster like or something like broke it or whatever. Like did something to it. Oh, there it is. Is it is it buried though? Or Oh, oh my god, baby! Thank thank goodness. And the bones inside are safe too. It's just as you deduced. Excellent detective work, me. <laughs> Whatever it takes to hold my son in my arms once again. It was placed haphazard in the shadow of a tree easily found. It suggests to me that the culprit did not truly wish for it to be lost to me forever. I can only think that as long as I give I, I give up on laying my son to rest here, um, that will satisfy them. However, But is that truly how this should end? Do you think it's time to find the culprit? Uh, hold on. No. No, there is little to gain from finding this culprit. I feel that a greater conflict demands resolution. Yes. It's the actual villagers. If they didn't want my son buried there, I would rather have been told. Had we talked openly, perhaps we could have found a spot of mutual satisfaction. Yes. But they staked no claim and they hid themselves outright and played at accepting me, demonstrating cowardice to one that they deemed an outsider. It is a tendency that runs deep, yes, but the village's isolation has magnified it dramatically. With such a shadow cast, their trade and relations may never recover. There are our children in that village, too. Ought we really turn our backs on a village such as this? One that grows poorer and more isolated by the day? Uh, yeah, let's go, let's go talk to them. 
I mean, I don't like it, but I mean, I see where he's coming from. You have to remember, guys, you have to communicate with people. This is how you solve problems. If you don't fucking communicate, you're going to get fucked in the ass. This is how that works. Should we try talking to the villagers about that? Hmm. You're right. The adults of the village need to address this for the children's sake, if nothing else. I would like to speak with Tadari and the others once again. My time with you all has changed me for the better, and now the time has come to pass the favor on to the villagers. I can sense Heisme's kind-hearted determination and deep trust in me. Oh, with Bean, hell yeah. I found a way to change. He also got the, the same thing that uh, Stroll got to. I'm like 90% sure that I think it's either the next one or the one after. Um, That we might get another archetype from them, but I could be wrong. I don't remember. Could I ask you to indulge in my selfishness just a little bit longer? My thanks. Thank you. Let us head back for today and return when we are ready. All right, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume that there's like one more, Time one more thing that we can do with him, and then, and, the age of a new king and then I think they have it. So, um, there's like a certain number of them that you have to do on the Gauntlet Runner. I'm pretty sure. So I think that we are actually making very good progies, oh, doing too. very well. Can't do highs me for now, or maybe we can. Sorry. What am I supposed to do at a time like this? I don't know if they will talk to me right now. Wait, why not? Is it like a quest? Weird. Let me go. Let me go run over here and talk to her. Hold on. Also, I'm I'm like slightly worried that we won't have enough time to do the optional dungeon, but I think I think we can manage it. I will do my best. Hey, there's something that I would like to talk to you about. Um, though I hesitate to speak candidly of today's nights out here in town, what I have to say is not for the public here. Ooh, spicy. Okay. It is suffice to say a complicated matter. Might we speak when next we set to the road? I wonder what she has to say. I should talk to her on our next trip out. Okay, okay, I see, I see. So we, okay. She's at that point. We have to talk to her on the Gauntlet Runner. Um, all right, let's, let me take a look at the map real quick here. I think, mm, I'm just gonna take a look at the podium, which is just down over there. And then, if there's nobody, if there's no one there to debate, um, we're gonna go ahead and do the optional dungeon because I think we're doing good. Let's see. Oh, also, I'm pretty sure my food might be here, by the way. Oh, he's here. Oh, I fucking knew. I knew. I knew this person would be here. All right, hold on. This is gonna be a, a really good stat boost, so we're gonna we're gonna do it. I will become king and create a military state for Rusant by Rusant. So that's what they're basing their campaigns on. Hey, why don't you debate him? Let's do it. I'm gonna squash him. Mm hmm? Are you not that Elda who turned in the Sanctorus? Just that I would expect of a lesser tribe. A frontal siege was beyond you, so instead you opt for the uncouth tactics of a rear assault. Excuse me, sir. She was um, she was feeding children to a monster. Are you fucking are you crazy? Bro. Your juvenile tricks will have no effect on someone as experienced as I. I will eliminate you here and now. Listen all to your next king. My good people, the dream of a united kingdom has failed. When I am king, our land shall be reborn under the proven military leadership of the Rusant. What has the United Kingdom actually done for you? Forcing the tribes together has only spurred further skirmishes and tension. Furthermore, the throne and the other key positions have been strangled by the Clamar's nepotism. The time for the Rusant to reclaim their pride and independence is at hand. Here, here, the Rusant embodies strength. The Rusant represent the very best. The land of the Rusant? Surely he jests. Where does that leave the rest of us? It sounds like Rudolph is playing to the fanatics among the Rusant. Um, the tribes must stand together. Here's what I would do. We can't let tribal differences define us. I envision a world where everyone stands as one. What? Nothing but idealistic platitudes. You are too young to lead if you cannot see that. He's right. How the hell could anyone make it so that everyone helps each other or whatever that all that's about? People are free to dream as they please, but I find the boy's dreams more appealing than Rudolph's. 
I was gonna say, like, what is this shit, bro? It's racism. Get this shit out of here. Impossible. I refuse to be humbled by an inferior tribe. Well, guess what? You just got humbled. You just you just got manhandled by me. Let's go. Man, that was a great debate. You ran circles around that guy. Your ideal struck a chord with the people. And they gave me money too. Ooh. Oh. This experience seems to have honed your eloquence and imagination. All right. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Yes. Thank you. Hell yeah. 34. Hmm. Not what I was expecting. I'm not going to lie. I thought we'd be going down a little bit faster. I'm pretty sure. Didn't I make like a bet with that, that gambler guy that we would get to like a certain rank? I could be wrong. Let me. Um, we can go talk to Alonzo too. Let me. Okay. Right, give me. Give me one sec. We're going to go to. Let's go. We're going to go take a shit. And then we're going to run over and we're going to go talk to the gambler guy because I want to see what the actual All deadline right. was for the gamble. Right. Well. <sighs> meow, 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 meow. Oh, got some rock beans and a gauntlet shroom. Wait, there's shrooms that grow in here? That's kind of gross. All right, then. Um, okay, so we want to go to... Um, oh, I think it's there. I see it. The gambler's down there. Let's go bug him. I think I think I said it was like 20 to 30 or something was like the um the placement that we would get by the end of the month. But I could be wrong. <laughs> You only have you still got eight seven days left. Oh, but don't worry, I'll still be here. What what what, what did I do? I don't remember. Uh, I don't remember. All right then. I guess the only thing we can do is um pray to God that if this next quest that we do will bring us down to twenty to thirty. Interest. All right. Give me, give me one sec, you guys. I will BRB. I'm just, I'm, I'm not actually gonna like change the screen or anything. We're just gonna go grab my food and then I will be right back. Give me uno second, un momento. Boy, oh boy, do I have some amazing tea for you guys. So you guys know that sometimes that people like do that do like deliveries, like they're not the brightest people ever. Hold on. So this man put the order literally right in front of the swinging door that we have. So the moment you try to open it, we tried to get around it. The fucking thing spills the drink everywhere. <laughs> like literally like because we didn't see the drink was right in front of it and it spills it everywhere and i tried to fucking upload a picture to uber eats and they're like they're like this photo can't be it can't be validated i'm like bruh like how do you how do you not validate the photo it's literally the drink is completely poured all over the fucking doormat like are you fucking kidding me it's like it's like on the doormat it's like visible bro I'm so mad. Ooh, literally, ooh, okay. There's two. There's two. And I'm, I'm sorry to be a hater right now, guys. But like, there are two people in this world: people who work at Tim Hortons, and people who do Uber driving. You can have some good people that work there, but I'm telling you right now, some of the worst people work there. And I, I'm so sorry. I feel so bad for anyone that has to work there. But like, there are some people there that like, oh my god, unbelievable. I, I've never, I've never had any other issues with people other than that. Fucking Timmy's and fucking Uber Eats. I'm the worst. Anyway, there's my TED talk. Thank you. Brief. Let's go talk to this guy. Maybe he'll make me feel better. Hmm. At least my food is okay, but bro, you should have seen you should have seen the fucking <laughs> the look in my eyes, bro, when the fucking drink fell over. I was like, I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? Like, are you fucking good? Anyway. I will leave that open. I will seek some once in a while. Oh, the, how how intriguing. I'm very keen to know more of these experiences. 
if you would indulge me. Have you some free time right now? Yes. Oh, you are marvelous. Oh, I love him. I love the way he talks. Very fancy, very posh. Thank you. All right, well, follow me. I know of a great spot. Alonzo asked me to tell him about the, some of the things that happened on my journey. I see. Oh, I see. Very intriguing. So an external force protects the candidates. For outsiders like myself, it is rather difficult to get a hold of accurate information pertaining to the Royal Magic and the Tournament for the Throne. Weird. Very sussy. This makes it sound like all of this stuff is like just very like it's very condensed into like this one part of the world, like one part of the country. And like nobody else really gives a shit or knows anything about this stuff that goes on. It's kind of weird. Information is quite the weapon, you know. All the more reason that meeting you has been such a boon. Understand? In fact, if you really wanted to take down the other candidates, the most effective method would be investigating their families and homes for info that you can use. Quite effective. Oh, I like him. Quite effective against blackguards who seek, sorry, who hide their misdeeds, naturally, but outstanding, outstandingly so against good upstanding family folk. Sir, what is your problem? Yeah, I would never, I don't, I don't want to fucking do that. No. But of course. Oh, no, I know it is not in your nature, but still, not every weapon has a pointed end. A villain will always strike where it hurts most, like snakes, and those I associate with are usually the most venomous kind. So is he, like, doing me a favor? That's cute. I like that. Speak of the devil, here comes one such associate now. Oi. How is the client look a situation looking? Yeah. We've 20 at present. No delays securing their contracts. Arrangements have been made. Should any default on payments? <sighs> so you're not all talk. You know, my lord may have taken a shine to you, but let me make something clear. One false move, and I promise I will flay you, flay you alive myself, understand, Cuculus? Does he know his actual name? Kind of sussy. Was he a mark? Ridiculous. He's an underling of the landowner that I'm working with, and he's exceedingly cautious, as you might expect. And for some reason, he still doesn't trust me. Can't blame him, really. Said landowner is my true target, and he is a foul one. He's been trying to take advantage of the struggle for the throne to net a huge fortune. Ambitious sorts all over the country are using the tournament to rise up in the world, and this landowner is their lender, turning tidy profits. I am his middleman. <laughs> of course, the landowner only lends because he knows that he will collect. So when he realizes that he can't, why, that is an awful lot of money to disappear into the world. Ooh. That's your aim, what? huh? That's your plan. Now then. I'll spare you the details, but the man's money will end up in my coffers eventually. Bro, he's so shrewd. I l I'm digging it. It is a curious thing. People are never more vulnerable to tricks than when they think they are playing one themselves. <laughs> when all is said and done, it'll be his loss and my gain. And I do mean gain. Enough to buy a small village, really. Why would he do such a thing, though? My, my. Why, indeed. Perhaps I can trust you with that. Oi. Oh, Alonzo. Yes. Oh, do not worry. He has my confidence. Listen. That flunky that you talked to earlier, he is snooping around the village. Oh. What? Hey. I gave him the slip before he saw me, but this is bad, Alonzo. If they find out that you are connected to the village, then... No. Is he, like, secretly... Maybe he's, like, secretly kind of, like, a good guy, but he's, like, taking money from, like, the weirdos and, like, giving it to, like, the good people? Yeah. All the same, you should pack your things in case things go south, and we'll bring you the money to stash soon. I like him, though. He always has a plan. If something goes wrong, I'm pretty sure he has a plan for it. That lackey of his, I hadn't expected him to move so quickly. He even went as far as, dug as, as uh, digging up my roots. Or the moderators are like, our Twitch deleted my post. I forgot, like, what? Wait, what did you, wait, hold on. What did you try to post, though? What happened? Um, Are you gonna be okay? You. If push comes to shove, so, so, <laughs> if push comes to shove, I may end up needing your help, your muscle, that is. I. I am trying to buy my hometown with the money that I am biking for bilking from the landowner. It's about me not being affiliated and having an average. Oh, I was gonna say um, 
they're they're kind of weird apparently i mean like affiliate is one thing but apparently even like with people who do partner you can technically um you can have the average of 75 for like at least like two or three months or something or whatever i can't remember how long you need it but twitch will literally just like deep dive all of your stuff and if they feel like they if you're not well if they feel like you could be more consistent quote unquote or some shit, i don't know um they will just straight up tell you no you got deleted for slandering twitch mm, i mean that's a little sus but i mean it i mean at least it's just affiliate it won't it hopefully won't take much longer i'm assuming you're trying to get to affiliate right now so don't don't worry about it gold hash plan i think the biggest the biggest thing about getting affiliate is getting those cute little emotes and doing cute little things you know hmm. that's about it I've got to make this piece of my deception succeed at all costs, and it would save the whole poverty-stricken village. Hey. I knew he was a good guy. I knew. I had a feeling. When are you free? How about you come and check on the village with me? I've got a strange, nagging feeling about all this. If you catch me in, if you cut me in, or in. Yeah. I'll help, but it'll cost Thank you. you truly. <laughs> it's free. I'm not going to actually, I'm not going to charge him in the stats page because I said that Twitch wasn't counting my views which I had a stream with like five people in it the entire time oh okay so mm, I know well here's the thing I think actually me and uh Jester and I don't remember who else it was I don't know if it was Aurora or Dedison or somebody else somebody else was talking about this with us I don't remember who it was um but we were talking about how apparently stream manager can get a bit sussy and there are times i've heard it from like other people too apparently there's times where like stream manager will literally just not register that people are there part of it also has to do um it has to do with how people are doing their lurk um you can't actually make a lurk count quote unquote all the time if it's audio only um unless maybe you're on your phone or something i'm not sure but if you're on the computer and you're trying to do a lurk, you actually have to have that person's page open. So for all you know, um, maybe whoever you had lurking with you or like or like in your stream, I mean, like maybe they were off stream, quote unquote, with audio on more often than not. It depends. It's a little bit weird. I don't like how stream. I don't like how Twitch counts how they do their viewers because technically, if your page is open, technically it should count. But at the same time, though, I know that they have reasons for why they don't count it either. Oh no, it's not even like stream manager. It's like in the actual stats page. What? That's kind of weird. Yeah, you know, you know what I would do then. Yeah, I would have bugged them. I would have been like, I would have been like, hey, like, why is it not showing up then? That's kind of weird. I understand. Okay, I, I understand what you mean. That's kind of suspicious. My hometown is a small village. It's nearby, in fact. If it were up to me, we'd head there straight away. Alas, I know that you have a schedule of your own. Even so, I implore you, please, do not delay for long. I will be waiting. I'm on my way, babe. Don't worry. Time it's okay. On, and the age of a I made a post about it in, like, the Reddit, and Twitch is trying to silence me. <laughs> yeah, they're, trying, they're out for blood, bro. It's okay. If it makes you feel better, um, I, I had my Uber Eats delivered just now, like, a few minutes ago. Hurry. And um, literally, the driver put all of the food and the drinks right in front of like the door part where like it swings open. So like I didn't actually technically really see the drink. So I tried to open the door and it was like jam packed like on the door. Like I tried to open the door just a little bit to like grab something, and it literally just knocked the drink over and it spilled everywhere in front of our house. Like it's like literally all over the fucking um the doormat and like all that other stuff or whatever. So. Um, I'm probably, I'm probably gonna fucking cuss this person out. If I ever, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave a review for that driver and be like, I don't want to see this bitch again. <laughs> like, never again. Do not come into my territory. <laughs> I hear a voice. <laughs> There's something that I would like him to look at. No, Barden, bro. Oh, yeah. Leave me alone. I love, I love him, but I need him to leave me alone. Um, okay, let's see. Right, let's take a look. I think I think that we're gonna go ahead and do um let's do the dungeon. All right, then. I think that's the best the best course of action for now. Let's go. Oh, if you don't mind me asking, by the way, Snowy, how long have you been doing Twitch stuff? Did you start streaming recently or like the last couple months or something? Or be well. Oh, I forgot to take a poopus. Let me go ahead and use the bathroom here. About four years. 
I was going to say, um, when did you start talking to people, though? Like, have you been, like, networking or, like, doing anything? Um, I know that technically, like, you can get you can get to affiliate if you have, like, your friends help you out, too, which is technically at the very beginning how I did it because I didn't do any major networking or anything. Um, but I was going to say, um, once you get to that point, I mean, like, it just depends on what you want to do. So I ended up having to take a pretty long break from Twitch for a while. And then um, I think I started up again. I think it was, like, around March this year-ish, quote unquote. I don't got friends. Wait, didn't you just say that you had like five people in your stream? Were they not your friends though? Oh, where did I? I thought I read that wrong. Maybe then. I thought you. I thought you said you had. Um, you brought your friends in to help you too. That's what I did. I mean, it is what it is. But it was just random people. That that is kind of weird. Then that the um the thing is not telling you your stat page is not telling you that you have um the thing in Bob or whatever. Here's where we are now. Deeds and diversions. Okay, no, I was right. Okay, so we have to go this way. Hmm. Certainly. This is the tower that we were tasked with clearing of monsters, is it not? Keep yeah. Wits about you. The farther the farther from the city, the greater the danger. We have to be prepared. Yeah, but it's your call. Okay, let's Which go. Be... Why do they keep Let's be what? Yeah, why the fuck do they keep telling me that I have to choose another route? But it's the same fucking route every time. The fuck? Deadison was in my stream, and that's like the only person I knew. I to pick. Yeah, I was gonna say, that's yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's weird. If you actually and the fact that you knew somebody in the stream too, and they're telling you that your stream the numbers didn't count. Sorry. That's kind of fucking weird. I would try it again. See if um see if you can get people to jump in and do like um like an affiliate push or something, and see if the stat the stat page is not showing it up. Because, like, that is very, very sus. I don't know why it would be like that. Um, oh, let me go ahead and take a little shower. If I have enough showers, maybe I'll level up. Yeah. Got it. Got some cute little fries in here, too. Oh, you know what I forgot? This is so funny. Apparently, the fries from KFC, apparently they have, like, um spices on them or something. Oh, yeah. Oh, those are good. Wait, what time is it right now? Six fucking forty. Oh shit! <clears throat> I was gonna say, just a reminder: in twenty minutes, I have to go punch out. I'm gonna, do, I'm gonna stream again tomorrow and hopefully get affiliate. But this isn't the first month. I'm stuck at that average. That that is very weird. Then, if it's not the first time that you've gotten stuck like that, I, yeah, I would definitely make a support ticket. Maybe even go on Twitter and be like, hey, like, can I have someone reach out to me or something, or or send like send like an email to Twitch support. Like do do everything that you can to get their attention and be like, is there something going on? Because like this is weird. Oh, let me cook. Somebody's cooking, and it's me. Okay, magical bread. That one I don't really need. Invincible noodle. Get immunity on the field for sixty seconds. Oh, oh okay. Interesting. I like critical meatballs. Let me do this one. That. I love me some meatballs, bro. Hey. Ah, tis you. Say. I apologize for being so absorbed in personal thoughts at a time like this. I would like to talk through them if you would lend an ear. Absolutely. I thank you. Yeah, I was gonna. Yeah, I was gonna say if that's the case. Yeah, just like you shouldn't be having a problem if it doesn't show up later after the stream. Definitely go out and reach out to Trich. That's kind of sussy, sussy McGussy, bro. And then. You recall that we had talked about my one-time compatriot, Rodon. I have decided to challenge the Knight Commander to a duel. Oh my god, we're challenging him to a duel. Let's fucking go. Oh yeah, by the way, Snowy, what kind of games do you usually like to play? I mean, streaming is one thing, but like, what, I don't remember if I asked you. Which games do you usually play? To settled. 
We are warriors. As such, it is only through battle that he will be shown the error of his ways. Literally anything. That's hot. So you're verse. You're a verse boyo. Let's go. Mm. I don't think KFG is supposed to be that healthy for you, but that shit is so good. It's so tasty, bro. Mm. If you're also looking to from what i've heard if you're looking to boost um like your average numbers or like at least like get more people in to like check you out i've heard apparently playing um specific types of types of games i think um what is that fucking thing called palia i think it's called playing palia um the dark souls games like other stuff like that like if you play certain types of genres like you're gonna bound you're bound to get more people in anyway and like check you out so like if you want to like naturally like bring your bring your um your follower count up apparently those are really good but it just depends i'm just more of the kind of person that, like i would just kind of play whatever the hell i want to so i released i recently started playing a started playing a fps game called red match 2 and i'm actually on the leaderboards not for for most no scope kills oh my god Ooh. yes damn girl okay oh, certainly i've realized that anything more underhanded would surely backfire it could not have ended any other way, really. To that end, any knight who prizes their honor would never risk the shame of refusing a challenge, and my would-be opponent is the knight commander himself. Were I throw down the gauntlet in public, uh, he would scarcely, sorry, he could scarcely deny me. It's yeah. true. Do you recall the broken sword from the other day? It sparked a realization. This is a problem only blades can solve. And indeed, in the tally of all of our previous bouts, we stand even. This seems a fine opportunity to settle things once and for all. Hell yeah. Right. If that's what you want to do, I'm pulling I for you. you. We still have our mission to complete, rest assured. I cannot lose. I will accept no less than victory. Number 24. Ooh. See, I feel like the only game that I've ever been on like a leaderboard for, from what I remember, it'd either be like a fucking gotcha game, or like something fucking sussy, I'm not gonna lie. I would duel Rodanth for the people, yes, but even more so, I would take T, I would take measure of myself. He is single minded, as much as as much now as he was then, and once he decided on rising to knighthood's peak, um, so indeed he did, by whatever means necessary. All while I issued familial honor to pursue knightly calling, and then when that was lost to me, I sought the prince. My shifting purpose has weakened the path beneath my feet. I have been long mortified at the truant that I saw in the mirror, and long did that feeling fester in my heart. I... But no longer do I stand ashamed. My path, however serpentine, has led me to you all, and to the woman that I am today. If so. A lack of doubt does not make one strong, nor does it make one right. I shall face him headlong. That's good. Are you show him. Yeah. You do it, babe. <laughs> Say. I have a request. I want you to be my witness for the duel. If only to witness your victory. Certainly. I accept so I can witness the rightful victor. <laughs> Hell yeah. But... The duel must be fair in all things. No matter what happens, I will ask for your impartiality. Alright. But you better not fucking lose. I can sense Hulkenberg's strong resolve and extraordinary trust. They saw that I got really, sorry, re, they saw that I got really good really fast and a lot of the beta players friend of me on Steam. Ooh. I feel like, um, I'm trying to think of like what other game, I mean like, mm, at one time in my life I played Arcage and I actually like, I did pretty well in that game in the beginning, but apparently Arcage kind of like took a huge dump at some point. I don't know if anyone else was aware of that. So I don't like to play that game anymore, but I've heard that, um, I've heard a lot of people like games like that, and I would love to jump into them and, like, no-life them, but I have a life, unfortunately, so. I shall propose the duel to Rodanth in the days to come. Call upon me when it is convenient for you. And in the meantime, I have many preparations to make. To make, Ao. Tis a hungry business, all of this thinking. Fortunately, I have just the thing. My prized cache of tender fermented meat. <laughs> You'd be hard-pressed to find meat this soft and pungent and ripened anywhere else here as a token of thanks take some uh no 
I think I think we're good. Thanks, babe. <laughs> She's fucking crazy. There's something wrong with her. You lot, enemy attack! Oh my god, a bird? Oh no, not a bird. Oh, I used to, I used to complete like 100, I used to like 100% like all the games that I used to play. I can't do it anymore. I mean, I try to once in a while, but like any, anything higher than like, anything higher than like a handful a year, I, I can't do it. I don't know. I just don't have the time. I wish I did. Wish I could, wish I could literally just win the lottery and just literally sit here and play games for like 12 hours a day, every fucking day. It'd be beautiful. Who does not want that? Wait, why is it saying Raptor Corvo? I was like, is it Thunder? An ambush. Brace yourselves. Only one I will fight with Vitus Power. Oop, no, no, no. Retry, retry, retry. Only one left. No. Better concern. No, I could have got extra money. No, don't do this. No. I'll be taking that. That's rude. I'm not gonna beat it. Sorry. Nothing personal. I call upon royal power within. Oh, that is so rude. Uh, if I if I had realized I would have insta killed that bird, I would have used all of my my MP on it. Fuck. The gauntlet runner arrives in a land grown thick with trees, the shadows enshrouding it as their claim. A warm, damp breeze passes above the gauntlet runner, its sensation cooling the thirst for battle. The night carries on. Beautiful. Couldn't have said it better myself. I think um All the right. amount of time that I actually used to know life the same game over and over again too probably probably didn't help because I probably I could have gone and played a bunch of other games and like completed them too. But I instead chose to spend all of my time on like one or two games a long time ago i think i'm pretty sure i'm pretty sure i've beaten final fantasy 10 probably so many times to the point that like i i, I want to say like um probably like 20 to 30 times and that's like back to back kind of stuff like i would just beat the game and i'd be like damn that was a good game and i would just keep playing it um and like the amount of time i could have spent on like other games bro it's a tee here that's that sweet gremlin life, bro. I wish I could go back. All right then. Let me do. Oh, hold on. <laughs> you know what? Just in case, um, can I get my imagination up? How? How do I do that? All right then. Let's go. Let me go to the lounge. We're going to take a look over here and we're going to see if we can read that book. Oh, stop it, Brett. Get some wisdom. I don't mind that. What's that? Mm. Speaking of food, okay, interesting. All living creatures, whether beast or food, or sorry, beast or fish, have intelligence. And this we know. And yet a shocking number of people still elect to consume these beings for sustenance. Let's see. We need not be so barbarous. People who sorry, people can live well on grain and nuts. Yes, supply is a challenge, but we can develop igniters that will increase grain production. Ooh. So why wait? Start adapting now. We should immediately cease the consumption of meat and live off of magically produced food, it says. What do you think? Um, I think it's a great idea. Hmm. Really? But if we suddenly cut off the, wor the world, the whole world's supply of meat and fish, then don't you think that most people would starve? I was going to say, like, I mean, mm, like, fuck them. I mean, <laughs> it's like extra green, bro. Welcome back. Still, though. Oh, you know what? Mm, to be fair, I couldn't. I could not live in a world where I can't have meat once in a while. That me that would make me sad. 
Fish, I could leave with. I could. I, I could live without. Snowy, oh snow, snowy refuses to touch grass. I know, I feel that right. I mean, I used to be the same way, but it is what it is. I wish it could be me. Wish I, wish I didn't have to do anything. Wish I could be in a cyborg body. Right. Got it. This is... Mm. That's so good. Yeah, I feel that. I only I only touch grass on the way to work. The funny thing is, is that I don't have to touch grass anymore. Except for Saturday. Every Saturday, I get dragged out of my house. Hmm. Well, hey. So I work from home, so I never, I never get to touch grass. No, I feel you. I'm literally, literally the only reason I even touch grass. I think I didn't touch grass for like eight months after I moved to Edmonton. Um, and then as soon as I started dating, I was like, I'm like, oh shit, I actually have to go out once a week. That's the only reason. It's the All only right. fucking reason. The gauntlet runner arrives at the Gracia forest, temperate and fertile. It was once a place of repose, where the songs of fairies, but as the furnace of commerce demand fear of what... Giving it some thought? Do you want to stop? Okay, this is what I was thinking. So can I... Okay, next time we do this, I'm going to make it so that my, my thing goes through, goes to the next dungeon. Because I have a feeling that you can technically stop on multiple dungeons on a on a gauntlet runner run. I think that would be really good. Let's just keep going. And that's rude. Not about that. Huh? Oh, is there a bottle? What's going on? Oh, it's a gauntlet runner. Oh my god, no! Finish it quick! Oh my god, it's Lena. Get her out of here. You've got an absolutely brilliant runner there. I haven't stopped thinking about it since the opening ceremonies. What's a tea? I actually walk my my dog, but only at night since I work in the day. So my neighbors have yet to meet me. Oh my god, no, that is in. That's a, <laughs> that's like how I used to be too. I like it that way. I mean, I, I like it too, but at the same time, though, it's like it's like it's a specific type of lifestyle. Why is Lena so fucking happy, bro? And that's some ace detailing on the hull. Oh, and the speeds top class too. I bet it's like a palace on the inside. Uh, if you just want to look at the runner, could you stop hopping all over the place? Oh no, I, I've got a bit ahead of myself. I was actually hoping I'd get you to step down first. Um, how about you ask some Hebrew? That is, step down from the runner and step down from the tournament. I'm awful sorry, but I've got to be queen no matter what it takes. Once I'm in charge, I'll commission runners for everyone in the kingdom. And Caden Workshop won't have to worry about turning a profit. I swear, again. these these candidates are like their their actual like what are they called? The um like the promises that they want to like keep or whatever. They're so they're so weak. Like I want to make I want to make a hundred cars for everyone. I want everyone to have a car. Like excuse me. Like are you dumb? Like, bro. Yeah, nuke her. We can nuke the fuck out of her. You like for real yeah like everyone race. needs everyone needs a boat everyone needs an airplane like but are you stupid I'm like sure ew you good intentions, but... By this power. Nice hit. Mm. Sorry. I'll take this I don't uh... even really want the crown she doesn't even want the crown what she just said i don't even want the crown are you dumb what is your problem 
Why are you like this? Let's go. No holding back. Oh, power of heroes. Why did they? Why are they making her say that? It's so bad. I just want everyone to have pars. By this power. Okay, that was rude. I'll be taking that. My son must wait. Just a little while longer. I was saving this. Ooh. Plus needed. Helpful as ever. I call upon royal power within. Come. I won't hold back. Nice hit. That was perfect. Sorry. Some dark arts. If she can, if she won't hit me, maybe it'll give me my turn back. Okay, she might kill people. Oh, okay. I see how it is. All right. Well, apparently, apparently she's one of those bosses. It's okay. I have to go punch on to work anyway. Give me, give me like one hot minute. I'm sure you had good intentions, but. I can show you the world. It's okay. We can do this. can solve problems of late cannot This anime does not deserve the epic song. I know, right? Also, she's fucking rude. She's so rude. She's like boosting up her magic attack like a fucking dunce, bro. Disgusting. That hurt. LOL. Let me do it again. Oh, you know what? I want double crit. I want double crit. That's what I want. Also, welcome in. Welcome in, Angel. Or welcome back. I know you're still lurking. You're still doing skooma. No. <laughs> I just want to crit her. Let's go. Let's stay calm. Oh, oh my God. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna do this one more time. I just, just give me one crit. I'm over this. I just want to fucking beat her ass. This is getting really annoying. There you go. Some darker arts. You first. I don't need to wait. This ignites. I'm trying to charge. Yeah, bring it on. Nice try. 
Now accept your fate. Just leave the runner out. Of Hold on. Go for it. She's a real beauty. Here. I knew you'd help. Quite a boon. Coin can solve problems of late, cannot. Merchant. By the power. Another one. Ooh. Okay, we got. Uh, did we get three of those in one turn? Let's fucking go. Miss. Miss me with that gay shit. Oh yeah. She. She's. You know what's so funny? She's given up on actually like doing the general attack boost. She's just concentrating. Like she literally just doesn't know what to do anymore. Don't mind if I do. Observe. Oh power of heroes. Uh, Come forth, royal soul. Coin can solve problems of late, cannot. This'll do it. Should hopefully work. Much thanks. I'm obliged. Helpful as ever. I'm still gonna I'm gonna rob her blind. Now face me! I'll take this. Is everyone all right? I just the thanks. Quite a boon. My thanks. How can you make sure that? Come on. How can you make sure that no no one loses a profit if you go broke? Wait, what do you mean? Um. Say that again. Hold on. How can you make sure that no one loses a profit if you go broke? I don't know. What do you mean? How does that work? By this power. I my I don't understand my brain. <laughs> don't ask me money questions, bro. It doesn't it doesn't work like that with me. I'll be taking that. I mean, like basically, all I'm doing, I'm just like I'm just robbing her. No, you're good. I'm literally I'm using um, it's like mag. What should call it? Mag thief or something? Debt collection. And so basic basically, what's gonna happen is that if I do this, because we're not actually in a dungeon, after the battle. Um, I'm gonna recover all of my MP. So I'm basically getting free money. It's literally just a shit ton of free money for for no effort. It's literally so stupid. I don't know what I don't know what the fuck they were thinking. <laughs> Making this like an actual thing no, in the game. But like this is easy clap. Easy clap uh, trap. I will fight with pride. This should work. Not like sense. look at this. Like I can bro, it's I owe you. Why, why grind? I don't even, bro, I don't even know. Why even grind? Just steal. Steal everything and win. And then use the merchant class and then literally just auto crit everything, every time. Oh, hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Sorry. All right. All right, get fucked. Apparently, your higher luck stats do give you more more attacks or something. Ooh. Hi there, Miguel. I heard the whole story. Hell yeah. Caden's little girl, eh? From Caden Workshop. Sniffing work done there. Fine parts, very fine. If you're short on funding, I'll sell out the cheddar. But I'd be much obliged if you dropped out of the damn race, eh? What, really? You, uh, you know about our workshop? Gosh, <laughs> that's awfully nice to hear. Right, then I quit the tournament. Sorry about all this mess. Huh, nice kid. She's quitting? What? Just like that? Oh my god. Why the fuck? She literally said, she's like, why am I even doing this? Why am I even in the tournament? Or like, why do I want the crown? Bro, what the fuck? What was the point of this fight? What was the whole point of that? The gauntlet runner's slowing pace signals their arrival at an encampment. Exactly, that's all it took. Death. Literally, they being queen was didn't even mean anything to her. She just, she literally just wanted everyone to have a free car. That's all she wanted. That's crazy. Couldn't be me. <laughs> I want everyone to have a free car. I don't care about being queen. I just want everyone to have a free a free airplane. 
All right then. You know, you know what it reminds me of? Um, I don't know why, but like it's giving like legally blonde vibes. If you've watched that, if you've watched like the movies, like everyone is just like really fucking stupid. All right then. I fucking love those movies, by the way. They're so good. All right, let's let's see where do we have to go. Where are we going? Oh, can I read the book? I think who who is the main actress in it? Um, it's the girl from like Scary Movie. If you remember her, I don't remember. I know she's really famous, by the way, but I don't remember her name. Is it is it Anna Ferris or something? I can't remember. People assume it's like a chick's a chick flick, but it's actually not. Yeah, it was. It's like one of those movies. Like the beginning is like a chick flick, and then like after after that, it like it turns into like this weird like, um, this weird movie where it's like she becomes like a lawyer. Like it's fucking crazy. Wealth breeds inequality, and inequality leads to strife. To know this and continue our, tra our trajectory as a civilization is tantamount for planning for its ruin. Let's see. In this case, our best move for the future is to stop our march altogether. Abandon pretenses and upgrade. Become living fossils cultivated by magic providers. What the fuck? Bro, I swear to fucking god, this cold is literally going to fucking be the enemy. Hold on. Oh, annoying. Was it Reese Witherspoon? Wait, what? Are you sure it was Reese Witherspoon? Are you sure? I thought, no, I, I thought, um, I thought that the main actress for that movie was, was that other girl. It's like the blonde girl. So we're, because we're going to end up fighting, we just quit living. We go into some weird kind of eternal dream connected to igniters. Bro, what the fuck is this? Oh my god. Wait, hold on. What in the world? What are they saying? I just Googled it. Are you sure it's Reese Witherspoon? Are you sure? Hold on. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll look it up after. If I remember, I'll look it up. But I'm, I, I don't think so. That's weird. Uh... I think that we'll find our best future by continuing to live and fighting to find ways to avoid being ruined. What? I agree. People will always fight, but we can still build a good future as long as we don't give up. Galica and I were on the same page, and I feel like I've gained some wisdom. Right. I like the, I like how the only way to actually get smarter in this game is to make sure that you always agree with Galica. It's crazy. Hmm. He does seem sincerely concerned for the future, but he's also kind of stupid about it. I wish that he would have a little faith in people. <laughs> what the fuck? I swear. I'm now number 23 for the most no-scope kills globally for this game. That's disgusting. Imagine actually being on a real, like, a leaderboard for that kind of thing. That's actually fucking crazy. Wish or me. With that, I have finished the book, and I feel like my understanding of the world has deepened. All right. Another one. Ooh. Okay, we're actually... Oh, wow. Hold on. We're actually getting... We're halfway done, at least. The, the wisdom, tolerance, and eloquence. That's not bad. That's really good. She looks like a fairy version of, like, Misty from Pokemon. Oh, my God. Dedison, you said it. I did not... <laughs> Wait, we've got an enemy raid? <laughs> Wait, what? What the fuck is going on? I can pull the SS7 from Steam Lotus and Ooh. Our barrel man hides me spotted them. They are already on board. Oh, okay. I bitch, I'm trying to sleep. I wanted I wanted to catch the EPs. 
Is my MP restored? It is. Easy clap. Alright, debt collection. Oh, let's fucking go. Yeah, I'm very proud of you too, Snowy. If only I had talent. <laughs> if only. Sorry. Left him counting on you. I'll use what I must. Nothing personal. Mm, oh my god, yes, give me all your money. I do? Oh my god, thank you. But what's my talent though? <laughs> Name the talent. I call upon royal power within. Another one. It's okay. We are looking good here. Merchant. I'll be taking that. Now accept your fate. Is my is my talent stealing from people? Because apparently this is this is what we're doing. God, I, I literally, guys, I literally can't get over how disgustingly easy it is to make money now. Merchant. Especially once you know that you can just spam deck collection. It's so it. funny. Let justice prevail. Another one. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Ooh, what, nice hit. Okay. I'll use what I must. Oh, they're weak to oh, they're weak to electricity. Ooh, okay, hold on. I can't afford to hold back. This should work. Oh, I might actually. Oh shit. We might actually get this one. Hold on. Ooh, apparently even monsters and animals have money. I know, right? It's crazy. Oh my god, that is disgusting. So here, here's the thing. Hold on. So technically, using the merchant, you can you can basically go farm gold if you're like grinding in a dungeon. That's fine. You can just do that easy. But if you use the steel um or like the um the deck collection one for mag, um what happens is that mag on extremely bad days of weather the um the currency exchange rate increases up to about eight times so if i wanted to exchange like a hundred thousand fucking mag and I, if i exchange a hundred thousand mag or something into money it would be i'm pretty sure eight million money that's what i'm getting from that or something it's, it's probably be something fucking disgusting um, the other thing though is that if I don't want to do that, I can use that mag to teach my my uh, my characters other jobs and skills and like inherit skills. So it's just like it, there's no, I I just I it's it's so broken, especially for the early half of the game probably. Like I don't think that the devs realized how broken that that is. Disgusting. My RPG veteran roots are kicking in right now. That's what I that's how I'm feeling right now. Oh hell yeah. Oh, that shit's snowy. Show them. Alright. Where's he's me? Why can't they talk to he's me? Ah, let's take a poop. Right. Let's take a shit. Right. Oh, no, well. okay. We've read all of the books. We've done everything else. Um, I need to make sure that I cook. And I guess maybe like tonight, if I can't talk to he's mate, I can get my agility up or something. I don't know what else to do. I'm sure it's fine. Meow, 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 meow. Meow, 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 meow. I think it's this one. I want a lot of this one. This one, will, it'll restore every single status ailment on every character in a battle. That's crazy. I demand that boost. Gauntlet runner incoming! 
Another one? Another one? Are you fucking kidding me? Again? I bet it's Katharina. Hey, you. Yeah, you. The rogue making a go at the throne. Be a good man and leave the kingdom to me, you hear? <laughs> Get out of here. Love for conquer, conquer all. No, I'm just going to win again. Same strategy as before. Fight her and win. This is like the third time that she's fucking trying to come after me. He's so stupid. <laughs> the way we got up so casually, we're just like, we're like, not this shit again. Here we go again. Yeah. What? You want another round? She can go multiple rounds. That's hot. the same answer from us. We're not losing to anyone. Yeah, I get it. I know we're both serious about this. That's why I trained hard. I mean, really hard to get myself ready. I hate it. I hate it so much. All of you, my all right, all right, shut up. Ooh, I, I love her character design, but oh my god, I want to punch her, bruh. It's okay. Um, we can do this. I want crit. I want a crit, please. I need to get her agility down. We've got coins. Solve that, problems of late cannot. My pure eye. This is it. Merchant. Meow, Tear meow, hard. meow, Tear meow. meow. Let's stay calm. The bunny girl's gonna go hard. Merchant. I know, right? Sorry. Nothing. I shall vanquish evil. Up. Wait, is she weak to something? Like no. Just saying. Okay, interesting. Oh, she. Oh, yeah, she missed. Ooh. That's exactly when I. Ooh. Oh, my God. Mm. Oh, my God. Disgusting. No holding back. Give me all your magla. Thank you. These candidates are literally just... <laughs> They're literally just easy prey for me. Disgusting. Do it again. Wait, is she not like a bunny? Look at her tail. Oh, she's... um. No, hold on. She's a... Uh... What did they wait? What didn't you what didn't what did you call them? They're like a fox. It's like a fox or something or like a or whatever a neko or something a fox lady You had I swear it was you somebody had a name for them a neko or something Kitsune yeah, something like a kitsune or something. It's like a fox girl Come on sir Bring it on Bring it on, I dare you. I'm now weak to strike. Huh. Take it. Quite a boo. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to have him guard, unfortunately. Yeah, it's like a neckle girl. That's what yeah, that's what I was saying. I, I was like, I'm like, somebody fucking told me that, and I was like, what? Can take it. All right. Face me. And then, uh, uh, oh, oh, oh. Ooh, okay, good. I like that. You're wide open. Merchant. This I defer to you by this power. Merchant. Merchant. Some dark arts. Yeah, I gotta make sure that we don't get that off of her. I only follow like one ASMR channel on Twitch. I'm not like 100%. I was gonna say, um, I I think I have at least like one or two on here, but like I don't ever really see them on anyway. So I'm like, I'm like, whatever. It's fine. Okay, I would love it if you could like crit. Thank you very much. Sir. 
I would like to get paid. Undisturbed serenity. Oh. On, oh Interesting. Yeah, I knew you'd help. My oh hey Fuzzy, how are you? I was gonna say, um, game's going, game's going good. It's just, um, it's, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to beat this enemy and she's taken 84 years to get beat down right now. So also just in case, by the way, so you're not surprised. I did try to message you, um, about the whole modding thing. We do have, we had, we had way too many mods. So after I looked back, I was like, Tiki, but if I need you again, I will let you know. I do appreciate it though. Let's see. Can we get a shout out for Miss Fuzzy, by the way? See, now you would think that this this is about, sorry, this is about me until you realize who the ASMR person I follow is. Oh no, who? Who is it? Who's the ASMR person? Did I tell you guys about how we um we jumped into, I don't know if they're, I don't know if I can see them on right now, but there was, um I think Folklore ASMR. We jumped into her channel for a raid. And the first thing I heard when I, when I jumped in was like her talking about um deer getting murdered. And I was like, what in the world? <laughs> I was like, what happened? Not this one. With blade in hand. Ah, Not I don't know what to do. I claim that. It's okay. We can do this. Come forth, royal soul. Nice I won't hold back. That's Still nothing. here? <laughs> now accept your fate. You lost it. Okay, I think we're good. It was Sevi. Oh, 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 oh. This is a joke. Let's see. What? Did, did she heal again? No. Guys, I have to. I have to win. Pop that. I can show you the world. Come on. Thank you for contributing to the cringe bowl. Thank you, BB. Are you prepared? Oh my god, please die. This is actually killing me here. Come on. Wait, what? Oh, hold on. Mm. Let me try that. Oh. Oh. Why? I trained so hard. Oh, come on. Why can't I win? Just give up. Go home. She's gonna whoop that ass. I know, right? Literally, I literally don't know what the fuck to do, bro. Like, she. This is the third time that she's tried to ambush me. And, um, I don't know if you saw it, Miss Fuzzy, when you came in, but, like, right before we fought her, like, the main character was just like, oh, fuck, we gotta fight her again. And we just, like, casually got up out of our chair and we, like, we're like, oh, we gotta kill her now. Like, oh, God. Oh, my God. No. Did you get moderated by Autobot? What happened? Hold on. I want to read the message. <laughs> Why y'all kill me? Everyone is so loosey goosey with their verbs, bro. You gotta guard guys. You gotta find workarounds for swear words and like sussy words. Otherwise, auto auto mod will come for your butt. I continue to grow. It's giving it's giving giving pony vibes, bro. Pony has no filter, bro. Yeah, there you go. Easy, easy clap. The first, I said it earlier too. The first thing that'll happen half the time when Pony comes in, it comes in, is that she'll say something and she'll immediately get fucking auto modded. And I'm like, bruh, like no filter at all, crazy. I'm not saying that, by the way, Snowy. I almost read that. I almost read that shit. I lost again. How is that possible? I am ten times stronger than I was before, but you're still on another level, Will. <laughs> But whatever though, I'll beat the stuffing out of you next time and then you'll have no choice but to join Team Catherine. Oh, she wants another Boy. round. Bro, I fucking swear. Chill chilling with the anxiety, I feel you, unfortunately. is that It is that time of year too. It is getting colder. It is getting a little wintry. So when the anxiety is going to come, we love that. Oh, is it this guy again? This is literally the same fucking group that they talked to before. Hey, isn't the rendezvous point the rendezvous blah, rendezvous point a little further away? <laughs> well, we wanted to report to you immediately because we managed to lift some coin from those filthy nobles. 
Ayo. Also, this is a good time, by the way, because I don't know if the story is actually going to pop off at all for a bit. Um, I'm going to go ahead and because I haven't taken a proper break, um, I'm still I'm not we're, not we're not taking a break yet, but I'm going to run an ad. We're going to run our full time ad here. So it's going to be a three minute one. So I apologize, everyone. I'm just making sure that we get some pre-roll in before I take my next break, probably around 9 p.m., about an hour and a half from now. So just a heads up. Raguchi. It was smooth sailing once I took this doddering old man hostage. Oh, oh. Sir. <laughs> Pretty good doings, don't you think, Catherine? Bro, they took an old man hostage. Are you fucking good? I'll wait. Wait, Menaha, you think that's right? Weren't you the people who said that you were only after the really bad rich people? But the rich are all evil, every last one of them. All they do is live in luxury off of the money that they have exploited from the poor, no? No. Now is our time. Why wait until you're sitting on the throne? You've got people willing to fight to make your dreams come true. Let us swarm the land and cut the purses from the rich. Our liberation of the poor has begun. Wait. Wait, hold on a minute. I do gotta be queen to make this official, yeah? And just because you got money doesn't make you bad. Pardon, but... I was gonna say, if she ends up getting money, or like other people get money because of this, then doesn't that make them bad too? Like, this is not how that works. What the heck? Oh my gourd. I'm having a procedure in the morning and I'm like really nervous. Oh, I'm so sorry, Fuzzy. Are you are you getting like um is it like a like a proper surgery or something? Like one of those like, like the sussy ones? Oh, you're a good angel. Don't worry, don't worry. I appreciate letting uh you letting people know though. If things get too intense for you, I will always message me. Yeah, I was gonna say, Fuzzy, if you if you have um like anything happen with the surgery or whatever, feel free to like, you know, message people and let us know. We'll be there for you. It's an endoscopy. I, I, I've heard that word quite a few times. I'm not gonna lie, it's been 84 years, but I'm assuming it has to do with like your intestines or something, right? Yeah, I was gonna say, don't, don't try. I mean, I know it's hard to think about it or not think about it or whatever, but like just try, try not to, try not to overthink if that makes sense. Just um, take some, vi take some vitamins. You know, go for, go for like a run. Um, just relax and, you know, spend time with the fam. Just chill. And just kind of, like, you know, pray, etc. It is what it is. Do you have a say in this, Will? Is it right to bring people down just because they have money? Mm, not necessarily. Well, I thought as much. Who the hell are you anyway? One of Katharina's fanboys? Well, get on out of here because she's not going to take your side. I mean, mm, she kind of just did. She kind of just did, though. It's just like a camera that goes down your esophagus and your... Oh, okay, you know what's so funny? I was actually supposed to get one of those a long time ago, and then I pussied out, and I didn't do it. So I know exactly what you're talking about, and I was too anxious to actually get it done. Right. That was for when I when I first started getting acid reflux. They, they recommended I do it, and I was like, um... I was like, maybe not. <laughs> it's like, maybe another time. Yeah, I don't. I I think I've heard that being under anesthesia is not exactly the the most healthiest thing to have done, but luckily, it, it for to my knowledge, I mean, it's not too bad unless you get older. I think it's like the older that you get, the 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 harder it is to be under anesthesia, as far as I'm aware. Maybe I don't have acid reflux anymore. Yeah, I was gonna say maybe I'm not sick anymore. Like maybe maybe I don't need to get that endoscopy, bro. Crazy. Yeah. What's gnawing at you so bad? Look at the money that we have now. She's just tired. Well, Katharina will be the first to forge ahead. Oh, I think she regrets all the shit she did. I, I, I'm sorry. Those men are my, well, I guess you would call them my supporters. They united and declared for me when I joined the race. In fact, Manaho is the one who said that I should be queen. <gasps> he's the one who fuck, who's trying to fucking probably, um, he's trying to take advantage of the whole situation and fucking rob people. Not about that. But we agreed we was only going to target the filthy, stinking rich. Well, crazy how the tables have turned. If I win the throne, then it'll just empower fools like him all over. I'm not sure that I even believe what I said anymore. And I mean, is handing out free money a good idea in the first place? If you give stolen coin to someone else, then you're saying that is all right. And soon you've got a whole nation of thieves. Can't really imagine that's what the world wants. In that case. Then I know that we can find a better way. Another way. Yeah, I can see another way. Girl, you good? What you doing? 
If you want my opinion. I think I ought to step down. This crown ain't for me. You're the one who ought to wear it, Will. <gasps> I, are, are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me right now? Another one? Another one already? Like I said. That whole helping anyone in need thing that you've got going on. I know it's just, it's not just a cute slogan. You're building a better, a better world and I want to see it happen. That's crazy. We spank these people and they're like, they're like, maybe I should, maybe I shouldn't run in the tournament anymore. <laughs> That's crazy. I was going to say, yeah, Miss Fuzzy. I was going to say, um, she, I don't know if, um, she, Got that emote from someone else or if it's hers. Angel, who, where did you get that emote from? I know that Ryu also has emotes too. Do you also have your own emotes too now, Angel? I do not remember. I explained to her that I entered not to take the throne, but to raise someone else who could forge a better future for her country. Oh, so we're just spilling the beans to everyone. We're just telling it to everybody now. What in the seven hills? You've gotten like stupid famous and yet you've got no one protecting you. The work that you're going to have to do, I can't even fathom it. So anyway. Well, I guess that means that someone out there is dreaming the same dream as you. Still don't change what I got to do. I'm behind you all the way now. Oh my Leave God. We're best friends with her now too. Let's go. I think that you would make a hell of a better king than I'd make a queen anyway. <laughs> I'll be cheering for you. That's what I'm saying. Apparently, apparently she, okay. This is the third time that we fought. And all of a sudden, she's just like, yeah, like, I'm just going to jump out of the running. And then there's also another girl that we just fought, Lena. And we just beat her fucking ass. And she's like, I think I'm going to jump out of the running, too. Like, like, literally, literally, what the heck, bro? This is so sussy. <laughs> Bitches. Yeah, why are, guys, why are women like this, bro? What is going on? It's from a girl called Slaughter VR. Oh, okay, I was going to say. I was going to say Tihi. Maybe her thing is automatic, though. How does this work? I can't just pull my name out like it's nothing, though. Mm. I've got a lot of people in my corner, and they're going to feel like I'm stabbing them in the back. I've got some hard talks ahead of me. <sighs> Still, I would rather face them head on than build a society drenched in innocent blood. There's no way to rule. Sorry, that is no way to rule. Bye okay, now. I'm assuming we get to unlock her later, and she's either going to automatically level up with us, or we have to go talk to her. Wee, wee you. Thank you for thank you for following Angel, by the way. Angel's really sweet. Her and um, her and her brother Ryu. Um, I don't remember how did I I I met you, Angel, from from Ryu because I remember jumping into his chat one time, and you happened to be there. Um, and I don't remember how I met Ryu. I probably met him through Dango. I could be wrong, but. What is what is that saying? All all roads lead to Dango. <laughs> I love that saying, by the way. It's so funny. Um, I swear, literally, like ninety percent of the, the the best people that I've met is literally literally through Dango. I know, and that's what I'm saying, Miss Fuzzy. That's what I'm fucking saying. It's Ryu's it's Ryu's sister. That's what I'm fucking saying. Isn't it fucking crazy? At one point, um, I actually had I actually had Rio modding here as well too, but um, he actually got really busy too with like other stuff, and I didn't want to like, you know. So, you gotta make sure that everybody happy, everyone has time to do their stuff. What a tangled webby weave, exactly. I was gonna say, um, yeah, if you happened if you happened to be in one of Dango's chats a while back too, I think there was like at least one or twice, once or twice that he brought up. I don't know if I happened to be there at least once for one of them, too, but apparently he brought up no, that he was like, oh, yeah, he's like, I met Angel and Ryu through Judy. And I'm like, bruh, I'm like, ayo, <laughs> yeah, let's fucking go. Yeah, he's very cool. He, he does. He plays the same games that I do. So honestly, guys, like if you ever see him online, go and say hi to him. Um, he could also use the support, too. Well, we've arrived. Time to knuckle down and get to slaying some monsters. Certainly. Interesting looking dungeon. The man sought the ebony horn, correct? To see a monster's horn and think only of making an ornament of it, he must be a true craftsman. Splendid. Indeed, the way that he hones his skills and strives to master his craft is in his most admirable quality. Got it. We're going to take down the ogre, the Orgus. If I recall, we should watch for it when it starts gathering strength. True. We should not take this foe lightly. Preparing our defenses against such brutal attacks will be paramount. Here we go. All right. Also, I want to see how much fucking... Um, I know I love him so much. It's crazy how many people I meet through Dango, and um, I was talking with Coco recently. I think, 
Um, and I was like, I, I, I met everyone. I, I, I met Coco Pup first. Um, I think he was modding for someone else's channel. And then he raided into Dango's channel. And I was like, bro, I'm like, literally, I'm like, everyone is like, the, like everyone's community just like eventually meshes in with each other. It's crazy. No, where was I? We're going to go talk to More. I want to see um if I can go learn some more stuff. So you've acquired a new... Ooh. Let me see. Oh my god, guys, we have like two hundred thousand fucking meg almost. That's crazy. Get the cat. <laughs> His fur is so soft and clean. It makes me curious how he takes care of it. Probably by licking it. Isn't that how cats work? I think I'm a fangirl. Oh my god. Please do make yourselves comfortable. All right, let's grab. Let me see here. Mm. How much would this all cost? 6,000, 8,000, blah, blah, blah. I might actually, you know what? Hold on. I might actually be able to learn all of these. All right. I'm just going to grab them all. I'm I think we're going to have to, we're going to have to level up um, the faker job, I think, for the debuffs, just in case, because they did say that we have to debuff the boss. Otherwise, it's going to fucking destroy me. I found new power. Yes, I give me all of the things. Right. I'm I'll have some fries while we're waiting. Does anyone remember what the spices that they use on the KFC fries? I swear there's like an actual it's like an actual thing. Hold on. New skills. Is it Cajun Cajun Spice Cajun Spice Fries? I think that's what it was. Cajun Spice. Mmm. That shit is fucking delicious. Fascinate this, alright? I'm counting on you. Of course. Really? I found you. Um, I can't send any huggy emotes, but I will give you an actual hug. Here you go. A nice head hug. I said the all right. Ooh. Oh, I I'm want to read that after. You. What does that say? Apparently, the sniper has a really good thing there. Really? Oh. New skills, new possibilities. Let's see. Comeback victory recovers HG and blah, blah, blah. Um, only usable from the back row. It deals weak physical damage to all. Oh, oh, hold on. Oh, whoa. Okay. Decreases their defense for three turns. Okay, that's actually really good too. Let's see. Better get going, going homie. I'll leave alert. No, no worries, babe. Thank you for coming out tonight, Dedison. Enjoy your time off. Enjoy um, spending time with your fam. Um, enjoy your lurkies. And can I actually can I get a shout out for Dedison before he goes too? Um, I appreciate you being here. Love you, BB. I'm gonna we're gonna be on for I wanna say at least another three three-ish hours let me see here it's been what four, four four and a half hours for me right now yeah i think we have at least like three more hours to go at least let's see yeah we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna teach everybody this other stuff too all right we have enough money i'm camp of course oh hmm a new power to wield. I fascinate this. All right. Oh my god. Dedison dropped everything to stare at an impressive fountain. I love that. Yeah. If anyone if anyone was there for it, by the way, um fucking Jester fucking told me to play Fantasy Star 4 for the first time, and there was this fucking fountain in the middle of the fucking city. And it's just like the most randomest fucking lying one or whatever. It's just like, it's just like, damn, that's an impressive fountain. Like, I had to fucking take that shit. I have right. not coined that. It is part of my channel. I All right. I'm counting Why does this mo his monster designs look so cool? A new ability. I said this, all right. 
I'm left. Oh, oh. A new power to wield. I'm sorry, guys. I know it takes it takes literally 84 years to get through this shit. Bruh. It's unskippable. Right. I could get used to this. Mm, how much? Oh, hold on. Ooh, we're hitting. Oh god, we're hitting 50% archetype mastery already. Ooh, okay. I think I got that for everyone there too. I thought the all right. Hmm. Is there any any interesting TV shows or movies that anyone is planning on watching or has watched? I'm just curious. Um, I'm trying to think. A new means of protection. What what was coming out recently that I really wanted to watch? Hmm. I think I mentioned earlier that they have like Alien Romulus, I think is now downloadable now. Um, the only thing though, is that it's not 4K. That's the only thing. You can't actually right watch it yet. All right. Hi, hello. Hi, Ryu. What's wrong? <laughs> I'm counting on you. Welcome in, babe. The way you said that was so sussy. How's the game? Oh, luckily, luckily, Ryu, um, there's nothing spoilery going on right now. Um, we're still doing, I think we're doing um, one of the harder optional dungeons. Um, so luckily, there's nothing story related. Um, okay, so, so far, um, I'm trying to think. Have you actually got to pick the game up and, and try it out yet, though? Or are you waiting? I guess I have really good luck. Yeah, I was going to say, I think that you have managed to jump in here every time when there has not actually been anything super sussy. Okay, I was going to say, if you end up waiting, if you're lucky, you might actually get it on a discount too. All right. Um, So there was, I'm not going to go into it, but there was like a really interesting story development that happened with like one of the characters. Um, It was like a little bit shocking, at least for me. And besides that, I mean, like, that's about it. I mean, I'll, it's really just kind of slow burning right now. I think everything is still kind of like mysterious. They're kind of like, they're kind of slow burning. Um, I can't say anything about what happened with the character at all, because obviously it'll, it'll spoil you. Um, but trust me, it was good. I was like sitting there and I was like, I was like, is this really fucking happening right now? I'm like, oh, fuck. Like, uh. <laughs> um, story's been really good so far, though. I've been trying really hard not to get spoiled myself too, because apparently a lot of other people, if you try to raid people on Twitch for Metaphor, um, some people are already like near the end game. I and I think one of the thumbnails that I saw from one of the one of the streamers, um, it showed something which I couldn't really make out, but I could tell that it was like really fucking weird. So I was like, mm, I'm like, I'm not raiding that person. No, thank you. A new means so of I think. At some point, I'm going to have to avoid raiding anyone playing Metaphor for now um, until we've managed to actually beat the game. So just in case, I don't want to accidentally see something I don't want to, right? I thought this all right. Ooh. I'm count of yeah, the game, the game channel, I, yeah, don't, don't even look at it. Um, I'm just trying to think, though, I mean, so story, story has been good so far. Music is good as always. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I feel, I feel like the music is kind of, like, like it's good. It's just that we haven't heard any new songs recently. If that makes sense. Like I kind of just heard the same repetition of songs. So I'm hoping that at some point we'll, we'll end up like maybe, getting some new music or something, or maybe like variations of like the battle music. I don't know, but that's about it. I feel like the first like 40-ish hours that we've been playing, 35 or 40-ish hours, has been pretty good. Steady effort is key. I see fast. Mm, I think I have enough. We're almost done. I I'm, I will say this. One of the things that I, I've been disliking is that every time I want to learn archetypes, you you have to go through this fucking cutscene every fucking time. And it's like part of it you can skip and the other part you cannot. But like with Persona, I remember that you can basically skip the whole fucking thing. That's about it. 
Like, look at this shit. I can't fucking skip this, bro. <laughs> like, hurry up. It's taking 84 fucking years just to get this shit done. Yeah, I, I feel like I feel like if they end up um. I'm counting on you. I mean, like, mm, I'm like subtly pissed, but it, it's it is what it is. Um, I feel like if they end up doing um a remaster for the game, like they make like an extended cut version of it, I'm pretty sure they're gonna end up changing that. That's usually how Atlas does. Is like they'll make like a they'll make like a, a good version of the of the game in the beginning, and then they'll be like, yeah, so we're just gonna completely change all the stuff and make it more convenient and like whatever, just to make things easier for people. Which kind of makes me wonder if I should have technically waited for it to be re-released because I know a lot of people said that they wanted to they wanted to wait as well. Um, but at least for me, I mean, like, I don't mind playing this game off the bat. I just think in the future, I have to be more careful. I'd rather have the most convenient version of the game before I have to worry. You know what I mean? Um, meow, 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 meow. Let me take off Cyclone here. Hmm. Interesting. I'm not entirely, I'm not entirely sure what I want to do here. I might have to back out of that for now. Mataro Kaja. Oh, you know what? Hold on. That's actually. Oh, that's actually not bad. All right. Let's do this. I am always prepared. A faker's roguery. Oh, I remember this one. Let me do... We're going to go into the dungeon in a hot second, guys. I'm just taking a look at this real quick here. I'm going to actually give her... I'm going to give her the Lurking I Nightblade 2. And then I think I'm going to give her... Um, what's the other one? Formation, Formation of Viger. Perhaps yeah, this? that one. This shit is broken. I'm gonna go get your burger. You know, no worries for you. Go get your go get your foodies. Um, if you have to head out or anything, or if you have to lurk, I totally understand. Don't worry. Um, I'm gonna try to make a semi-broken build. I don't know if this is gonna right. work though. Let's give this a try. What do they What do they have? Matura Kaja. This one here. All right. Time to Just in case. I think we should be okay. can solve problems a blade cannot does this hold on does this class have any kind of weaknesses hold on oh it's weak to light and fire oh no wonder we were getting sussied earlier let me try um let me see if i can put something else on him hold on Megiddo Slicer. Okay, that's what it was. Medium HP recovery for all allies. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. It's kinda hot. I like that. Oh. Alright, we're all Gucci. I've literally burnt through like oh, like 150,000 mag. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Mm. We are quite a distance away from the nearest town. We should avoid doing anything reckless. What is this? Oh my god, what is this music? Wasn't there a request from a craftsman that you mentioned? Let us take care of it, shall we? Are you ready to get started? Ah, no, what you saying? I believe that we have a request to bring that blah, blah, blah. Monster Viscera? All right. Do you need something? Hey, what is that? Aren't you a lot aren't you a lot after the treasure in here too? If that is the case, then you need to be careful. The bloody goblins started chasing me after I pulled out my staff, and then when I thought I'd finally found treasure, it was a monster too. Oh no, it's one of it's one of these dungeons. <laughs> Alright, I see what's going on here. Best be prepared. 
which actually hold on which means which means that i should probably put on something for him too hmm i guess no medica for you for now i'm gonna give him um i'm gonna give him hamion i think Why is that music going so hard? All right, gonna lurk and chill. Just have to pop and say hi. Yeah, no worries. Always gonna pop in if I see you want. Yep. Yeah. Girl, you're okay. No worries. Love you, baby. I appreciate the lurk. Okay, then. Let's All right, we're going in. We're going on balls deep, balls deep right now. Let's see. Yeah. Increases archetype experience by 3,000. Oh my god. Where's the faker? I just want to see it. Here we go. I found new power. I think that one's a good one. Tarunda. I think that's the one they want new me to skills, use. New possibilities. I found new power. New skills, new possibilities. Removes all buff effects on all enemies. Hmm. All right. I think I think that's what what they want us to use. So let me let me learn that one too. R Ryu and I did a swap really quick. I was gonna say I'm like I'm like and then Fuzzy just comes back. Ayo. You <laughs> can don't fucking kill me. Um, oh, okay. I see what's going on here. All right. We should, I think we should be okay. It's dungeon time. Climbing this big fat tower. Why is this tower forsaken though? Sassy. Oh my God. What the fuck is that? Oh my God. Whoa. We have yet to defeat them all. What the hell is that thing? What now? I need to fight this. I want to fight this one. That was the last of them. Yeah, what, what is that? What the fuck? We can't get It's like an octopus and a, and a thing. A pop polo. What? These are just small fry. If we play it cool, we'll cruise right through. Now Interesting. <laughs> Come forth, royal soul. Yes. Come My life is in your hands. Ooh. What a finale! Keep your energy up. Well, they everyone. have like nothing. Oh. Oh, no, never mind. We take it back. The danger is behind us. Nice find. A magician like white mask. Come on. We'll find a place for that. Okay, that is incredibly suspicious. Wow, I wonder if this treasure chest is a mimic. Wouldn't that be crazy? Whoa. <laughs> Who saw that coming? Oh, it's a rare one. Ooh. Let's go. Flair! You hit their weakness! By this power! That's your opening, Captain! That is so rude, bro. I just, I literally just lowered his agility to like zero. Get fucked. Let's say come forth. Get out of here. This is nothing. Nice one, Captain. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Not done yet. Wealth may be a fear. They yet cling to life. Be neither timid. A wise choice. Coin can hurt. Ooh. <sighs> that settles that. Nice. Here we go. A turquoise. Ooh. Still not very good, if I'm being completely honest. You can make so much more money just from farming than like actually getting the treasure there. Oh my god. Alright, how's that? Keep it. 
There are so many treasure chests here. Ah! No, get your fucking. Oh my god, bitch. I hate those things, bro. Looks like they found us. We made short work of them. There's an actual treasure in here. Oh my god, let's go. A sail cloth cape. Magic plus four. Ooh, okay, hold on. What now? Um oh we we don't even need the noble tuck the noble tuck's on anymore. Healing Hobart. Um which one was that? Wait, why do I have on the noble tux? Excuse me? Wait a minute, what the fuck? Oh. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna put this back on. Um, I'll give that to you. Modern invasive movement. Using its strike. 150. Where's the other thing? What? Why can't I... Am I imagining it? We just got a new piece of armor. What's going on? Why is this? Maybe it's for class. Maybe that's why. You found something. Let's take it with us. Ah, jeez, bro. I wonder what this is. I won't hold back. Flare. You hit their weakness. Now accept That's your, your opening, fate, Captain. Are you prepared? Right on target. Nice one, Stroll. Oh, oh, power of heroes. Are they squashing, bro? Are we gonna one shot that? Oh, we are. Let's All right. Go. Get out of here, bro. Eat my boosie, bro. Wish every fight was that easy, eh? All right. Don't oh. fucking shush me, bro. <laughs> Get out of here, bro. Don't kill me. Fortune slot. Let me help. What? Got you. Uh, too damn bad. Listen. Now that's finesse. Beautiful dodge, high bay. No, I don't like that. I won't hold back. I don't like that. How are you doing, by the way? I heard that you now have Metaphor, by the way. Have you started playing it now? No holding back. Right on target. Nice one. Ooh. Oh, wow. Oh, are we going to one shot that one, too? There you go. I was going to say low key. I mean, like you didn't hear it from me, but she yeah, did mention that she to. wanted to buy it for you earlier. And she was like, I don't know if they can do it. And I was like, bro, I'm like, fucking do it. Buy it for him. So I'm very happy for you. I didn't know if she'd actually be able to afford it right now, but I'm glad that she did. So if you're going to start playing it, though, I, I mentioned nice. it to her earlier yeah. and I was like, I'm like low key, like he can like come in and he can like talk about the game with me because like at least we have someone else now playing it. Um, but if you don't want to be spoiled on anything, I'll just make sure that I don't say anything like sussy and that's the only thing. So if you ever need help with anything, let me know. Or if you want to talk about the game, I'm always down. Superior enigmatic accessory. Ooh, okay. That's, that's really good. Okay. There should be one more chest over here, but I don't know if this is a real chest. What oh, is? Nice. I think I'm going to buy her a game now though, too. Oh, uh, but wait, hold on. But if you do that, then... The, what was the girl? I mean, like, I, I see I see what you mean, but, like, I thought you guys couldn't afford to buy the game right now, bro. Sir. Did, did you guys end up saving any money? 
<laughs> like what happened they noticed us. oh god no 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 that's one job done. Oh my god. Ooh. Wait, could I technically could I farm these maybe? I wonder. Wait, oh my god, you guys, you could literally use these things to farm for money with a merchant class. What the hell? I'm sure you'll find a use for it. Bro, this is crazy. This is like endless fucking experience, bro. What the fuck is this? Impressive as ever. I mean, I don't really need to do this, but um, how much money do I have? <laughs> bro oh, i do have some money saved okay i was gonna say because i was like i'm like technically if um if she ended up buying it for you i was like i'm like girl very impressive if you're gonna buy her a game uh do you have an idea of which one you want to buy for her any idea good job everyone let's see yeah You were thinking of the yeah. Wukong game? That's yeah. literally, girl. She she brought she brought that up earlier too. This is such a coincidence. Yeah, because of the the Denuvo. I think it was um Snowy was talking about it earlier too, um and how they were trying to crack it. Oh my god! Whoa! What in the world is this thing? Okay then. Interesting. Oh my god, that is a lot of mag. Oh my god. Oh my oh my lord, you guys. God damn. They've noticed us. Draw steel. We are spotted. Nice. And that will find a use for that. What is this thing, bro? for you. Exemplary. Jesus. That should come in handy. Pocket it. I think I'm gonna do it right before I go to bed so that she can wake up with it. Oh my god, let's fucking go. That would be so sneaky. I like it. Oh, oh god. They saw us! On your toes, everyone! Don't let your guard down. There's more of if you intend to take risks, I might suggest healing first. Wait, there's another one? Not bad. I'm sure you'll find a use for it. I think I I think I made an, an a save or something at the beginning of the dungeon, just in case. I'm not gonna lie, the grinding you can do in this dungeon is probably fucking crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Maybe. We oh my god, not this shit again. Stand ready. If you intend to take risks, I might suggest healing first. Don't tell me how to live my life, girl. Like They're trying to tell me how to heal. Fine. What now? <laughs> it's fine kind of rude though oh, okay i think we're at the top now all right let me uh, let me see yep oh okay before we do the boss fight i have to i have to learn yep. the kaja i think before we do anything hold on I'm gonna go to sleep now. Have a good night. Oh, no, no worries, babe. Thank you for jumping in. Have a good night. I appreciate you being here. Thanks for the lurkies. I will. Have good sleepies. I have to learn, um, what is this thing called? Decodger, I think that's all right. Hold on. Mm. Ah! Where is my thing? 
Thank you for doing the shout out, uh, Angel. Appreciate it. Um, let's see here. Welcome. Sir, what do we have? Let me do this. Let me do let me do this. I'm gonna give I've him Medica. I'm gonna take this off for now. Oh, here we go. Okay. All right. I have a few skills. Meow, 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 meow. I think this should be okay. Um, let me actually let me also take a look. What now? Uh, thing. Also use dark magic. Okay. Just between us. Wait, it said dark magic, right? Uh, okay. Let me say one more time. If I need to, I'll replace um, I'll replace the weird sword ability that I have with something else. Yep. This place. Also, while I'm at it, I'm gonna whip out a a twister, bruh. We were to identify the monster that we seek by its horn, yes? This one would certainly fit the bill. Are we clear? Sizable indeed, Ao. He's big. I fear that our chances would, uh, should it, I fear our chances should it hit us at full strength. Take defensive stances when needed. Yeah. Alright, sound good. Sound Gucci. See if we can get a crit. I, will fight with pride. I, wanna, I would like to start off the battle a little stronger, please. Thank you very much. Coin can solve problems a blade cannot. I won't hold back. Nice hit. Fight us power. You better be sure. Praise the sun. Hey yo. No, praise darkness. We have to use dark attack on him. Increases your critical hit rate for all allies for three turns. I like that. Quite a boon. I'm obliged. Helpful as ever. Some darker arts. You hit their weakness. Oh Take fuck yeah! Oh my god! Praise the dark soul. Exactly. This is beautiful because guys, this ability, lurking nightblade, it will decrease their hit and evasion for three fucking turns. That is fucking broken. <laughs> By the power of darkness, power bruh. Heroes. Attack! Break that oh, yeah. oh my god. Coin can solve oh. problem. Come forth, royal Bro, let's fucking go. Let's get the let's get the shit fucking going. Okay. Let's go. No, the next one's yours. Another one. Easy clap. Angel has drank too much iced coffee, needs to use the bathroom. No worries, babe. Enjoy your lurkies. Alright, dodge. That's what I'm fucking talking about. That's what I'm talking about, bro. Oh. Ooh, nice hit, bro. Are you prepared? It's so broken. It's so broken. I hate it. Alright, come at me, bro. Slam strike. Oh, okay, okay. Ear splitting shriek. Um, oh, did it? What the fuck? What did it just do? Oh, sussy. Oh, they're days. Oh, oh no. Whatever, whatever will I do? Surely I have only stew in my pocket that cures all status ailments for everyone crazy how did that happen another one justice prevail drown 
I read that at corny stew. I read it as corny stew. I was gonna say, yeah, it's corny stew, bruh. Meow. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. We can gonna go ahead and let me do medicine. Let's try this. This is only supposed to recover 100 HP, by the way, because the merchant has like this nasty skill that like almost like doubles your fucking potency for items. It's the merchant, merchant is literally the most broken class so far, by the way, Jester. It's fucking stupid. Mm, a big defense, please. It sounds nasty. I mean, it is what it is. God has a plan. Gained two turn icons. Heat Razor. Okay. Okay, I see. Uh-huh. Taking your aim. Now, normally, normally I would be a little nervous. But I defer to you. I won't hold back. I have the Kaja. So what's this gonna do? Remove all buff effects. It still has like the actual attack buff or whatever for the other one, but it's fine. Get fucked, bruh. Get fucking dunked on, bro. Ooh. Alright, we're gonna we're actually gonna kill him right now. Let's go. There you go. Bye. Bye. Nice knowing you, bro. Easy clap. You got Ogre Fists and a Strength White Mask. Why are they giving us the, the Strength and like the Chariot and Magician versions of the White Masks? It's almost like Persona or something. Weird. Wow. Too easy. Hard mode is too easy for real. I'm going to I'm gonna end up replaying this game, by the way, on like Regicide or something. And I'm, I'm actually hoping that it gets like really fucking hard. Ooh, okay, here we go. So what I'm going to do, by the way, I'm going to have my magic at 30 now, and um, I'm going to start focusing after this level. Um, we're going to start focusing luck until probably almost the end of the game, I'm assuming. Because I want to make sure that we have like high luck stat. You have to play it on Regicide. I know I have to show everyone how easy this game is. <laughs> I have to Good. dunk on this game. Oh, how excellent. We have acquired what we were tasked with retrieving. A horn such as this would please any craftsman. I should like to see his reaction. No, then. then shall we head back to the entrance? Um, give me like a hot second so. first. I want to take a look around. Oh yeah, by the way, um, you should be okay. There shouldn't be any spoilers until I think a bit later in the stream. Um, so just a heads up. Oh wait, there's another fucking floor. Oh shit. Okay. Interesting. Not what I was expecting. Ah. What was that? What's up these stairs? Oh my god, this is so this is pretty. Oh my god, this is so cute. I like this. You got a Regar Regaraja's helm. Has there been like a lot of side questing? Um so I would say for every main quest area, they will give you about four to five side quests. Half of the side quests are unlimited time, usually for like optional dungeons. The other half are timed, so they will disappear if you don't complete them. But we've had enough time each time to, to like go and do them all. And I don't feel like we're really struggling at all in any aspect yet. Um, I would say that also doing a bit of grinding definitely will help you. Um, so if you do have time to do some grinding, I do recommend it, but it depends on how overpowered you want to feel. Like even on hard mode, if you make a mistake, you will, you'll, you'll have someone die. So it's like, it just depends on how hard you want the game to be, quote unquote. Is that it? I thought we got everything. This game. Okay. In the beginning, I didn't really like it too much. And I think that once you find specific dungeons, it's not too bad. I think um, the abandoned tomb dungeon that I found earlier was like really good. A super, super good place to, to farm. So I'm thinking um, I still have the video all recorded. I just have to go edit it or whatever. And I'm going to upload it for people. But there's like a way in the abandoned tomb you can literally run through in like a minute and like a minute and a half. And then you just refresh it over and over again. It's like super fucking easy. What? 
In that case, all right. Before we leave, um, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna fight hopefully one more enemy type real quick. Um, because um, what was it? They have um, my characters still have MP, and if you know that, I, oh, this is a good one for you, Jester. By the way, um, once you get the ability to um, to I think it's called Seal Mag. It's like the the currency for like using uh, arc type stuff or whatever. Um, what's the ability that I have on right now? Hold on. It's called Debt Collection. It costs 100 MP. So if you know that you're not actually going into a dungeon or if you are leaving a dungeon, so like if you know that you have the opportunity to like refresh your MP because of the story or you're traveling around, um, if you use this on every character, um, you can literally farm, you can farm currency and then your MP will regen and they give you like over a thousand meg per steal. It's like guaranteed. So like I started using it like uh, today or whatever and like it's fucking, it's broken. It's like absolutely fucking broken. Allow me to show you. Here we go. Hey, hey, <laughs> Allow me to you. show you how broken it is. Um, let me go ahead and I don't know if this thing is gonna die or not. But let me let me use that collector now. Yeah. I'll use what I Again. Give me your mag. Thank you very much. Let justice prevail. Oh, is it gonna attack me though? Mm. That's a tea here. By this power. It's okay. Let me redo that. We can do this. It seems like the aim was to make you feel OP in a sense though. Yeah, I've I've gotten like I think some of the classes, like I think um if you actually use them, they make you feel very strong. And like merchant itself is like this disgusting. I don't know what Sorry. the fuck they were thinking. Come forth, royal soul. Face me. You first. Is everyone all right? Mm, Tee let me do that one more time. Let's set it up. A tough one. Coin can solve problems of late, cannot. Do a crit. Give me a crit, please. Thank you. I think I'm gonna take damage anyway, but I was hoping I get unscathed, but it's it's fine. What has a plan? The high the chance makes it kind of ridiculous. Do you think this is bad? It says high critical rate. Um, they have another version of this attack on the second, uh, the second version of the archetype, which does, I think, um, it does like great, great, uh, great alm almighty damage, I think, or something. It's like, it's like the third tier of damage. So whatever you see now, it gets worse. Okay, it will get much worse. Disgusting. Maybe not looking good here. No holding back. All right, here we go. Let me get out of here in a second. Let's go. What a finale! Keep your energy up, everyone. Literally 10,000 10, mag for that. Oh my god. And these scores 10, bro. What now? In that case. Leave it to me. All right. So when we when we go back. You, but here's the thing, though. So if you're doing um, a gauntlet runner battle or something, or you get attacked by um, by enemies on the gauntlet runner, like you're guaranteed to get your MP back at the end of every fucking battle. So like you can just fucking spam it over and over again. I had like two hundred thousand almost. I had I think I had one hundred ninety nine thousand fucking mag or something, and I just sat there and I'm like, bruh, just pop you back in to say good night. Yeah, no worries, babe. Thank you for your lurkies, babe. I appreciate it. Have a good sleepy. I appreciate hey. you being here. Um, I know you're gonna be playing um probably either tomorrow or maybe on the weekend. If I can, I will try to jump in and say hi, baby. Um, Jester, can you do me a favor just in case, can you give um give Ryu a shout out before he goes to? Um, I would appreciate it. Everyone, please, if you're not already following him, um, please go and drop a follow for for Ryu. And also technically, I know that I know that Jester, you haven't streamed for at least a little while. Um, but people, if you could also drop a follow for Jester, he's an amazing mod and he's a very good friend. Um, and he's in a lot of people's communities. So, hey. just a heads up. 
Let's see. We're going to head out. We're going to okay. go back to town now. Right. And hopefully I don't get attacked by any whammon and any angry whammon again. Wow. I believe. Oh, hold on. I can did it. Hmm. So apparently, and I, I'm not gonna. I'm trying really hard not to spoil this or whatever. A shameless plug. No, you're good. You're good. So like Loki, we ended up fighting um, Catherine like a billion times. By the way. And apparently she has finally decided to drop out of the ranking or like the tournament. And I think also Lena did too, which is random as fuck. It was like, it was the most random thing I've ever fucking seen. Have a good night, Ryu. No worries, BB. Right. Uh, hold on. Yeah, that shit was back to back. It was so fucking funny. Let us hurry. No. All right, we have we have four days to go and get this um this. Uh, main story dungeon done Time i don't know how this is gonna work though and the age of a new king draws nearer <gasps> beep boop there's no time <laughs> Boy, mm. Mm -mm. i don't want to bug bug him though let's do something else come on all right then Go. Um, I am eating what you call it. Um, it's like the twisters from KFC. They're actually really good, and they're very convenient if I want to eat them because I can technically like hold them off screen. This is a joy. But um. I think Uber Eats or whatever, they have like a discount going on right now. So I was like, I'm like, bruh, I need to have that shit right now. I'm being forced to... Oh yeah, I was going to say, you mentioned before that the KFC is really bad. I'm sorry. No, I, I feel you though. I feel like I feel like All some right. some places if I try to go to them, they're just not very good. I don't know why. Well, then. Huh? Hmm. All right, then. Hmm. There. All right, All let right. me do. There's one more quest here that we have to do. It's, it's somewhere. Where to? Um. Oh, oh hold on. Uh, we have to go to. Let's let me go, go to the Gauntlet Runner real quick too. I have to go take a ship, bruh, and get my luck up. That's like all the fast food, food places in my area. I'm so sorry. No. All right. And that. Okay. You know what? Don't get me wrong. Like you're not. You shouldn't try to eat fast food a lot. I totally get that. Um, the only thing, though, is that at the same time, if there's nothing better to eat, like, I would rather tea. I would rather, I'd rather have something quick. Because, like, sometimes I don't have all the time in the fucking world. So, I mean, it is what it is, but gold hash plan, as they say. I was feeling kind of stinky there. I had to have a shower. All right, I think this was over at. Is it over here? Where is that? Let's head there right away. The Colosseum. There's somebody hiding over here. Today was the day that I ate a bit of fast food today, and but I didn't eat anything else afterwards. Like, did it did it like make you feel kind of sick or something, or like Amazing. what happened? Have you truly been there? I've never met someone who had ventured inside before. And you'll tell me of the monsters and battles you encountered, right? I want the deed. Give me the deed, sir. Bro. This man's just like, fuck it. Oh, God, bro. What the fuck? All of that effort for that, and he didn't even give a shit about it? Ew. I haven't even eaten it in like, in like three weeks. I mean... I, I'll be honest with you guys, I have I have times where like I go on a fast food binge and then I have times where like I just don't want to have anything. I'd rather I'd rather have like Starbucks drinks or something. I just sit there and drink things. I don't eat. 
I chose a place that makes their food fresh. Wait, hold on. Is this the place that you were talking about before? I don't remember what it was called, but do you remember there was like a fast food place that we were talking about? I think other people know of it too. I could be wrong. Hmm? That's crazy. Anyway. Wee. Hail. Let's All right then. Ah, oh yeah, okay, okay. Let's this go. one here. Ah. Yeah, it's the Culver one, but no, I chose the Raising Cane the Raising Cane City. What bitch, what the fuck? What are what is up with these names? What kind of fast food fast food joint is called Raising Canes? What the hell? Oh, my most my most treasured friend. Thank you so much. With this as collateral, I will be able to start a brand new business venture. Hang on. Hey, um, by the way, I heard that you don't have anything to do with Night Prowler anymore. You were talking about it like you ran the place. Oh, I did tell you that I was the place's founder, yes, not its proprietor. I certainly didn't mean to mis and I'm sorry, misrepresent myself. The curse of a naturally silver tongue, I suppose. And now the reward I promised you. Ooh, okay. Mission accomplished. You got a, a chef's toke. Oh, okay. They have like really Thank good uh, dipping sauce. Oh, it's chicken. Ooh. Oh, I mean, I guess, on. you know what? I can see it. I can see it. I feel like places places that name themselves for like chicken or like stuff like that like they're not always like the most like convenient places like like the name or whatever um i don't know if i ever told you guys but in canada hold on in, in canada we have um a place called pizza pizza and I, I i'm not i'm not joking we have a place called pizza pizza and they actually have the same company owns a subsidiary or like whatever the other franchise is um they own a place called wings wings and it's literally just chicken wings so it's like one of those things where like you you have to like literally walk in and like see it to believe it but it's just like it's the weirdest fucking thing oh he's gonna support me wow <laughs> i'm not gonna lie though i would rather have like fun. domino's pizza yeah pizza pizza the funniest thing with pizza pizza is that like they're they're simultaneously one of the worst pizza places that you can eat in canada and also probably one of the best because depending on who's actually cooking sometimes the actual pizza is like really fucking good they do such a great job um and then sometimes it's actual fucking ass like it literally just makes me want to give up on eating pizza ever again All so right. it's it's funny i think i think it's just it, whoever is like prepping the food sometimes like they just do it completely wrong <laughs> and it just fucking sucks Pizza Pizza, that's the slogan for Little Caesar's Pizza. Well, apparently, apparently Little Caesar's Pizza's slogan has their own pizza shop too. That's how crazy Little Caesar's is, bro. The worship. Oh, hold on. Can I talk to other people too? No. All right. Hmm. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go All into right. the Let's worship. Go. Let's try this they they kind of are i've had okay i've had actually like decent pizza sorry decent pizza from them when i had like my friends hanging out with me and then there's times where like it isn't very good yeah it's it's like it's like a, it's an acquired taste little caesars is an acquired taste for pizza let's go all right oh yeah by the way jester um we're we're pulling off a heist by the way this is like a proper heist quote unquote we're getting ready for one I'm like, mm, I'm kind of like debating if I should like switch off the merchant for like another class, but I'm like, mm, I'm kind of broken right now. I don't know if I want to switch it off. Mm -mm. I think I'll, mm, I think I'll leave it for now, maybe. Although, hold on. We do need to take a look at the thing here. Hold on. Fancy a bit of info. Just between us. I'll take a look at it after because I don't remember what we're doing. Oh. 
<laughs> oh my god, is this just like another Persona 5? Yeah, That's crazy. Apparently this game was actually made on Persona 5's engine, by the way, which is kind of wild. Wow. Yo. So? Let's go. All right. <laughs> hey, you. <laughs> Place. Okay, is this like an actual dungeon though? It's not. What the fuck? This is weird. Wait, am I actually doing a dungeon? Or is this like are, are we just running around doing shit? It was actually pretty good. I mean I mean technically technically yes. At the same time though, I mean what mm. the I feel like I feel like for the time it was very good, but like I I feel like they did a very good job with this engine so far. I'm saying I'm just saying I feel like I feel like at the end of the day like it could have been better. Um, and I'll be honest with you, I love how they played. Um, sorry, I love how they how they made Persona Three uh, Reload and like how they did the graphics for that game. So personally, I do kind of think the move over to Unreal Engine for them was actually pretty good. I mean, yeah, but it's, I don't know. I don't know what it is. It's like some games, like if you can pull it off right, especially like Unreal, like it's very easy to get stuff done in Unreal. Um, it's just that you have to learn how to use the engine. But I think that they've already learned how to use the Persona 5 Royal engine or whatever. So that's probably why they did this one. Don't. I see. So apparently we have to get him to leave they have to get them to leave or something. Oh. I saw the guards giving you a hard time, you know. Oh, they probably chose Unreal because it's cheaper to use. Technically, technically, yes. But at the same time, though, um, it's like a, it's like a, I was thinking of it this way. Um, because Unreal is being used by so many different people and so many different companies now. Like, if you have people in your company that, that learn how to use Unreal, um, you can bring other people on from other projects and other, from other companies. Or if somebody gets fired, they can join your company. And if they know Unreal, it suddenly becomes like a universal engine. Like anyone that knew how to use it can help, right? Um, that's in video game design school. I mean, like technically, like the stuff that we used to, to like learn, like the actual stuff, I think we used um, uh, Unity, I think Unity engine and we used Unreal because apparently everyone in the industry was trying to like get people to learn those engines. Because technically, once you learn them, you can use that. Um, you can use them at like any fucking job or something. It's crazy, especially with like Pink for all the De Novo. Yeah, I was gonna say that too. That too. Not really about that. I would wager that you could sneak in when the guards are not around. But how? So what is our next course of action? It would seem that there are indeed some cracks within their vigilance. Huh. Hey, I've got an idea. Just watch. Wait, what? An idea? What are you planning, Stroll? Like, they still use the Novo in all their games to this day. Yeah, it's we I think it's kind of weird that they do that, but, like, I guess I understand why they want to. Maybe? Persona 5 Royal isn't even cracked yet? Wait, are you fucking kidding me? Are you serious? Bro, what the hell? No. That reminds me. <laughs> Bro, he's literally just telling them like, hey, you guys want to drink with me or whatever? Let's fucking go. <laughs> hmm. yes. Oh my god, you guys don't fucking kill me. Whoa. Oh wow, Stroll actually did it. Nobles really do know how to do know how to schmooze. Right. We should seize this opening. Wait. One of us ought to go ahead as a scout. Once they are assured that the area is clear of prying eyes, they will call for the rest. Oh. Mm. Ooh. Wow. What do you think? Let me go. Mm. Right? Yeah, I was gonna say, let me let me go. We're off. Oh my god, no. Right. 
Bro, it's a whole sleuthing mission for real? Oh no. I hope that you realize that this will be the tough part. That room up there is Sergeant Sans and he's in charge of this area. So what am I supposed to do? Kill him right now? Like what's going on? It looks like there are a, de a decent amount of guards around. So how should we secure it without getting noticed? Um, let's knock out the guards. Okay. Oh my fucking god, bro. We're assassins creating this shit right now. Let's go. Without being seen, approach the enemy from behind. Oh. Give it a shot. All right. Understood. Nice. Oh my god, let's fucking go. Oh my god. Look at you. Don't kill me, bro. I don't like this. Let's do it. Okay, what's gonna happen okay. here? All right, got him. Okay then. Yeah. Let's do it. All right. Can I cut in? Hey yo. Let's fucking go. I got everyone down. That reminds me. Wait, hang on. Do you remember what the informant told us about Zam? He was described as a huge man clad in armor. He must be the guy who hassled us earlier, right? Hmm. Poison burns and stuff like that might be effective. Okay. Ready? I was gonna say if we're gonna go in first of all hey. i would like to no i want to go mm, i want to go touch all the thingies bro okay hold on um let me read his thing again fancy a bit of info just between us morales is in somewhere too Gotcha. Okay. Mm. Let's take a look and see if I can actually do any of that though. Um status elements. We got poison. Poison shot. Not the All worst right. thing in the world. This is like a whole thing. I have to. I have to prep for the heist, bro. That's actually not bad too, though. I can get him to do that. Um, what can I do with you, sir? Wait, would this one work though? All right. Let me. No, no, no. no right. Hold on. Let me try this. Let me try this. I'm gonna give him poison and hex. Let me give let me give the the main character the hex one right. because low key he has better he has better stuff going on for him. That's a T here. I'll leave her alone for now. I th I think this should be okay. Let me save. All right, boys, let's do this. Yep. Ready? Yep. Hulkenberg is just like, yeah, we'd, we'd like to borrow something from you. Can you, like, do that, LOL? Again. And bro. Why can't we just ambush him, bro? Huh. If you were half as clever as you are bold, then you would know that power's everything here. You want in that door, then you better have the guts to back it up, bro. I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna beat your What's ass. Right, let's go. Is that Lord Luis behind oh. you? What? Are you, huh. are you fucking kidding me? Bro. <laughs> <laughs> Did we almost backstab him? I tried. I tried to. I tried to. I tried to convince him. 
Oh, comedy hour, is it? You really thought to swipe the key soon as I turned my back, hum? Well, this is Lord Luis's army, not a bloody stage show, hmm? You there. It is clear that you ain't gonna learn nothing unless it hurts, so I'm gonna straighten you out like a smithy on a sword by clanging your heads together. Right. Yeah, he can he can clang me anytime. Let's do you it. Know. Draw and have at me. All right, I'm a feature booty. We're in deep trouble if we let him call his allies. Strike oh, back. so this is Take another thing, by the way, Jester. We have limited term, uh, limited turns to defeat him. Now, show me what you can do. On guard. Crush him in three turns or less. He's falling back. Ah! Here's through. Just a scratch. Let's go. Oh, I hexed him. I hexed him. Oh, let's fucking go. Let's go. Now accept your fate. Some darker arts. Stepping back. Are you prepared? Let closing the distance. All yours. Merchants. Attack. Break the hexes. It is just a flesh wound, bro. Exactly. Take this. Oh, nothing. Easy clap. Bro, this guy's weak. Prepare I thought he was going to be way stronger. Also, Hex is not... It's not doing anything to him. It kind of sucks. Just a scratch. Face me. bearing. No holding back. Withdraw it. To the floor. Yeah. Oh, this should work. I just hit I just hit him with my abacus, bro. <laughs> it's crazy. Is that it? Alright. That was um not what I was expecting. I was expecting him to take like almost no Such damage and we had to beat him with like ailments or something. I'm beaten by a half with half with little shite. I can't believe this. But, and what in the world was that magic? Powers like that with no igniter? It doesn't make any damn sense. <laughs> I consider our strength simply, sorry, amply demonstrated. And now the key, please. What? No, I refuse. You are mad if you think I'm going to hand it over, bro. I'm going to have to knock him out again. I wonder what Lord Luis would have to say about you losing to half-wit little shite. Doesn't seem very be becoming of an officer of your station, does what? it? Wait, no, no, I, I get it all right. I'll lend you the key. Just keep your bloody mouth shut. That's more like it. I'm sorry, are you still barking orders? Did you forget that we just wiped the floor with you? Whatever. <laughs> what the all fuck? Right. Bruh. I need to teach him his place. Nice. Okay, interesting. I thought that they would have made it so that we had to get this done over a course of days, but apparently we can do it all at once. So Oh, is he is he just fucking what? standing there? Bro, what the fuck? That's actually so fucking funny. Right. Beep boop. Pushing forward. All right, what now? Here. Yeah. This lift should get us back to the entrance, and we ought to be able to get moving, get it moving with Zamp's key. Oh, okay. Let me actually let me heal before we actually go through here. Evidently. It would seem that the soldiers utilize this room for breaks. We may rest safely here. <sighs> Luis's private quarters are still ahead of us. We must go further still. Work always getting in the way. I was gonna say. Oh, you gotta go sleep. Yeah, no worries, no worries, baby. You're okay. You did you did good. You stayed up pretty late. I'm proud of you, baby. I'm also very happy, by the way, that you managed to get metaphor. That's you softly. Um, I hope that you have ample time to enjoy it later. Um I don't know if you'll end up streaming it, by the way, but I hope you do, because honestly, the story is, like, really good. It's, like, low-key. Consider it, but if not, no worries. Oh, is this a Magla Hollow? Hold on. Oh, it's a... This is a Magla Hollow. Oh. It looks like they use this place as a break room for the soldiers. Hmm. Be that as it may. You know, this certainly hasn't been a walk in the park, but I must say it is nice to have, sorry, be able to take a break somewhere other than a Magla Hollow. 
I will one day maybe. I just don't have the time to stream much right now. No, you're okay. You're okay. Um, I would say like if you do end up wanting to like maybe even like record it, like if you're playing the game, just like just like record it in like Streamlabs or OBS and then upload it to you YouTube or something. But it's like it's like whatever. Have a good night though, BB. Make sure you get plenty of sleepies. Um, I don't know if I'll go to bed right away after we finish streaming tonight, but I'll try to be up for like another hour or two and hopefully get some stuff done because I have to upload another video. Um, but I will still be up for a bit, hopefully. Sure, but it is a gauntlet runner. I wouldn't expect you to find melancholization here yet. Mm -hmm. What is it, last? If you have something to say, then it would be best to share it now. Hell yeah, Turkey's baby. Yeah. Well, it's just that this runner has some pockets of some oddly dense magla. I can only guess that it's because it uses a, a huge amount of magic to get off the ground. That reminds me. Nerus did mention something to that effect too. By his assessment, the Charidius brute forces its flight via magic, which seems to perturb him. It must be dangerous to push magic to its limit like that. We should ask Nerus to explain it when we're, um, you know, actually, let's not actually. <laughs> I was going to say further speculation does us a little good. I'd rather, I'd rather not have to talk to Nerus about that shit because he's going to pop off. Let us refocus on the task at hand and the acquisition of the curses formula. All right, let me go ahead and save. Let's go. Okay, so from from what I remember, we need to get I think two more keys, and then there's a boss at the very end of it too. So, um, oh, left or right? Which one shall it be? Got a sec? Hmm. Hmm. Truth is. Isn't that Um, okay, so he's the magic one. I remember that. We were advised to figure out some way to nullify his barrier. I mean, I technically, I have something, but like, mm, we'll have to see. We'll see how it goes. Apparently his shout is so loud that it can actually daze you. The informant said that Glacom was susceptible to being provoked. So? I mean, I guess. No. If so. Really? Oh, okay. All right. What do you think? <sighs> What's up? Do you need something? Would it be helpful to go over the end that we have? No, no, no. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. We have that. We're good. Then... I shall scout the starboard corridor. I would most certainly welcome your aid. Ah. Captain. Hmm. I mean, we, we get to pick either one. Um, I think let's just go left first. To the left, to the Ready? left. We're off. Um, also, by the way, I do have to take a break in about 10 minutes. So just a heads up. But we will... Actually, hold on. You know what? Mm, I'm kind of down. Let's give it a hot second. Let's actually take a break now. Because it'll give me time to actually eat. And then um, when we come back, we can just like go balls to the wall and just like get all this shit done. I'm pretty sure that within like the next two hours, we should be able to get the uh, the story dungeon done. And I'm assuming whatever else is coming too. So over there, Glucom's quarters. He's the master sergeant and overseer of this portion of the runner. Uh huh. Is it more sneaky, sneaky? Hmm. This area is very well guarded too, and it'll be hard to maneuver without drawing attention to ourselves. Hulkenberg has gone ahead of us already, and if we play this smart, we can catch up with her. Okay. Ah. Oh. All right, so listen, the, the deal is the same as before. We have to knock out all of the guards and clear a path for everyone. Let's all right. Go. All right, we're going yeah. to we're gonna have to keep sneaking around here. I hope everyone's doing good. Welcome back in. For anyone who else who has uh, just jumped in or maybe does not know what's going on. Yes, thank you. Congratulations on six hours. Let's fucking go. Thank you, Bones. For anyone who has no idea what's going on, um, we are going into Luis's quarters. Um, we have to go get some key cards or something, and we have to go beat some ass. But we have to be sneaky about it. 
I don't know how we're going to do it. This shit is weird. No good. Just saying, okay. So apparently there's stairs. There's like other stuff here too. What is he going to do here? I think the goal is we have to knock out every single person here. There you go. I knew it. Judo chop. This is great. I don't like this. There you go. I knew this is great. All right, you got two two down. Okay. Uh, ooh, oh, okay. I see. I see. Maybe we have to go talk to Hulkenberg because those two are being very sussy. Oh, but how do we do it? That is the real question. Yep. What are American units? Bald Eagles burgers aren't fireworks at McDonald's. I, I I don't know. I feel like McDonald's could be a very valid um a valid a very valid unit of measure okay, for then. sure. Look at Probably you. McDonald's burgers. Watch out. Did I get him? Oh. <laughs> oh my god, that was kind of scary. Oh my god. He almost got me. Keep it. Okay, I see. I see. I see. I see. So, watch out! I want to sneak by this guy, but I don't know if he's gonna turn around just yet. Yep. Glad that's done. Amazing. Okay. Watch out! Ah, to see you. You were swifter in your arrival than I anticipated. Obviously, I didn't read the third option. It was stupidity or opinion and confusion. Do you mean like? Do you mean that thing there? The other option? I mean, to be fair, I think I think that America has more, more burgers then it does have it does have opinions and stupidity like let's be honest right all right or mcdonald's mcdonald's is just one brand of burger but there are so many burgers i'm just saying i'm just saying Boy. what do we do this is no good okay is he gonna turn around Wait a minute. What's going on? What's going on here, sir? Yep. Oh, very Great. sneaky. America has more burgers than it does brains or brains to be stupid or form opinions. You know what it is? It's like people people have eaten so many American cheeseburgers in America that like their brain cells have literally just fucking imploded. That's probably what it is. As expected. You carried out our plan magnificently, as I had no doubt that you would. The guards po shall pose no further threat. Hell friends. yeah. <laughs> I like she she just walks off. Right. She's like she's like yeah, I just did an amazing job. Well. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Did we get did we get all of them though, or? Watch out. I think we did. <laughs> did I actually? Hold on. Yeah. We have to take out those guards. I did. What are you talking about? Yeah. I, I did take them out. Oh, come on. There's a sneaky one down here. Excuse me. As I make myself, this is hilarious. I mean, it's true. 
It's true. So many people in America probably eat like the fucking fattest, juiciest fucking burgers and it probably kills their brain. Mm. Which one is Glacomb? I don't remember. Ready? Right. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to brute force this boss, and if it doesn't work, yep. then I have a save, Ready? and it's fine. Understood. The homemade burgers are better though. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, um, I feel like I feel like technically technically like any any burger made at home is probably better than a fast food burger i will be honest um at the same time though i mean mm, sometimes i like the taste of fast food i don't know why i think it's because they put all the like the sussy the sussy ingredients in it that makes you addicted to their burgers some piss ants think that they can just waltz into glaucoma the great's domain and uh, unin uninvited do they what Oof, this guy smells like the floor of a distillery. Look at you, a little bitty elder kid. Sort of a rare breed, aren't you? Are you those new additions that, uh, what I got told about then, huh? <laughs> if you can make a, a juicy, supple, spicy big burger at home, then you got to make some of a fast food joint. I mean, it just, it just depends. I know that, um, some people like if you make the ingredients for like desserts and like other things like you can make them to a business too at home it just um it just depends on whether or not you actually want to go out of your way to like risk money on it you know what i mean doesn't matter here drink up like i always say the two things that'll cure your sorrows are booze and bloodshed huh. always oh, out of liquor now Careful, or you really will get promoted. <laughs> hey, you lot, you're the same as the rest of us, aren't you? Spurned by this dog shite world. Nowhere else to turn but Lord Luis, huh? Me? I'm actually a parapist, so I know the feeling. With Luis in command and Glaucombe the Great at his side, we will smash this world to bloody bits, and you'll be there too, well. yeah? Something to that effect. In truth, we'd actually like to acquaint ourselves with our new compatriots, which requires us to procure a key to access the remaining parts what of the runner. Oh, a key, huh? Well, you just want to see the bridge, that it? But, um, I'm not really sure if I ought to hand it over to a bunch of new recruits. It's a tea here. A parapus? No, a, a parapus. Parapus, bruh. He's a cat. He's a big cat, bruh. But our new, our being new here is all the more reason that we must deepen our friendships. Such companionship will ensure we're of use to Lord Luis and have a brighter future for all. Huh. Oh, okay. How about this? We scrap. You beat me, the key's yours. How does that sound fair? Why? Girl, why? Uh, just give me the key. <laughs> just uh, just give me the key. Give me the key. This man is rude. You wanna scrap with me, eh? Hey! You've got guts, that's for sure. Let's see how much of them we can spill. Bro, what is wrong with this guy? Also, if does he have a beer belly? Down? Oh my god. Come on, come on! Let's see some blood. Here I come. Okay. Uh, oh my god, why? Kill or be kill. No, <laughs> stop it, bro. Oh, oh my god, that dodge though. The captain's dazed. He's gonna have a hard time landing hits. Nah, I'm good. I'm Gucci. Here. Come forth, royal soul. Uh, looks like we can't brute force through this one. Let's go. Or can we or can we though? That's the real question. Shit. I'll use what I must. Ah. Are you prepared? Well, go for it. Attack up, please. Attack up, please. Oh, that's actually not even that bad. Bro, where the fuck are my fucking crits? Are you fucking kidding me, bro? You first. Let justice prevail. Kill on. Kill or be killed. Huh? Think. <laughs> okay, this might actually turn out well. Maybe. Perhaps. Oh my god. No. Oh my god. Fucking frick. What the Come fuck on. is his problem? Oh 
Uh, bro, I swear to fucking God, I swear. With healing power. Helpful as ever. Trust me. Much thanks. Uh... No, I don't like that. Let me do it again. Come on. Kill or be killed. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. You that just I just I just need you to not Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Oh, okay. Alright, okay, I see how it is. I see how it is. Lemon, a wise choice. Merchant! The shadows will take you. I'm drunk. Merchant! Still up? All right, we have one more turn. Oh my God, Jesus, bro. What is this problem? <laughs> you stop that. I leave it to you. He won't land any attacks like this. I do with this. Trust me. Bum 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 bum. This I'll stay my blade. This is a sick There we go. Okay. Oh, thank God. There you go. I feel like if if it were regicide, I'd I'd be fucked right now, but God has plan. Very nice. Okay, we have one more to do. We got a chariot white mask. Why do they keep they keep giving me these white masks? Why? That's so weird. Victory is ours. We'll be taking that key as promised. And he's out. Is he just like drunk? It could just be the alcohol. I think it was. I had no idea that he was the one responsible for the attack on the Grand Cathedral. It sounded like he saw it as revenge. I have no sympathy for the man. Among those who lost their lives in the attack, there were a great many parapets just like him. Yeah. At the end of the day, that is tyranny disguising itself as justice. Luis would just as soon sacrifice an innocent as promise them a brighter future. This is a discussion for a later date. For now, the key. Take it before he waits. Well, all right. Let's go. I think the only one left is the uh, the guy who is resistant to magic. I think so. Let me just double. Well, not resistant to magic. I think, but he reflects it. We'll have to see. What does this do? Pushing forward. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, I'm like slightly confused because I, I feel like the map is being weird. Do both of those doors lead to the same thing? I'm so confused. Here. Wait, hang on. This is familiar. We're in front of the reception room that the brothers showed us. Everyone, look, that's the lift to Luis's quarters. Then per Gallica's reconnaissance, all that remains is to ride the lift. Wait. Wait, hang on. We can't use the key that we have on that lift. We need the officer's key, and they keep that one on the bridge. That's... So the door at the bottom of the lift, are we safe in assuming that it leads to the bridge? Yeah, if we head through there, get the key, and then Luis's quarters are in sight. All right. We are a hair's breadth away. We must secure the formula and break the curse over his highness. Captain, how about you and I go on ahead to the bridge before the others? We're more likely to be questioned if we are moved as a group. Then... We shall await your signal and guard over sorry, over the rear flank in the meantime. I managed to learn the helmsman in charge of the bridge uh, is called Cavio, but I didn't get much more than that, unfortunately. So Wait, do I only have to fight two of them and not all of them? Did the other... Was it optional? Oh. Uh, Cavio watches the bridge when the ship's docked, and from what I hear, he's a fan of the songstress Juna, too. Isn't that... The informant told us a thing or two about Cavio, and apparently he got caught in a nasty thunderstorm, and it messed him up pretty bad. Came away terrified of lightning. He's actually so adverse to it that he has someone else take the helm when the weather gets rough. 
So if he really hates it that much, then lightning magic should do the trick. Let's use this information to help us plan. Whoa. Bro, I'm gonna have to destroy him. I'm excited. We're off. All right, let's, let's see here. Um, here. This appears to be a sitting room, aside, so set aside for these soldiers' benefit. So apparently. All right. Isn't that... Well. Understood. Interesting. What the heck? Is, what is this over here, though? I think they said so. We can't. We can't go up that way, but we can technically go down here. What is this room over here? Hold on. I just kind of want to see. I'd like to see what this is. Oh, what the heck is? What is this? A moon white mask. What are these things? What do they keep throwing at me? What is this? Yeah, they keep... What the heck? They keep giving me that item. What is this? Can be used as an ingredient in mask experiments? In mask experiments? What is that? What the fuck? What is this? Oh my god, these are based on the tarot cards. What the hell? This is a very suspicious. Let's stash that somewhere safe. Oh, and apparently I can't actually do anything over here. I think. Interesting. Is that a treasure chest? What is that? Guys, it's so hard for me to see. I can't see anything. It's, everything is so far in the distance there. We're gonna go in the room. We're gonna save. We should be almost done. I assume that we would have had, we would have had to fight the other boss too, but apparently we just have to pick one between the two. That's true. Knowing that, we still need to find the officer's key, which is kept on the bridge. After which, we will be able to probe Luisa's quarters at long last. Yep. Heisman is exactly right. We can't mess up now. However. An officer's key, huh? Well, it's likely the same one that the Magnus brothers had. Strange that they would leave it lying around on the bridge, though. We heard something about that, remember? One of Luis's officers had it, but he died, and so they left it on the bridge for now. He died, you say? Could this key have belonged to Zorba, who, are, who we ourselves felled at the Grand Cathedral? Well, wouldn't that be ironic? Zorba's key will be what gets us into Luis's private quarters. So oh my god, no. That is actually so funny. That's so funny. All right, let's go ahead and save. I'll save over those those two too as well. I had that old save for the Forsaken Tower, but I'm, mm, it's like whatever. It would it would, it would be like a decent place to grind, maybe. But now that I think about it, it's like whatever. Goal has plan. Let's go down here. I think that we have to go down this way. Wait, what? It seems like it's safe. There are not any guards around. Oh, wait, look. There's a window on that door. We can get a look inside from there. Why are there two First. doors, though? What's what's going on over here? Oh, just our luck. Of course the bridge is crawling with soldiers. We'll be spotted for sure. Well, this isn't going to work. No choice but to look for another way. Well, what else are we going to do? Is there a ladder here? I thought I saw the symbol there. Oh, here we go. Maybe we can... Oh. Oh, What's we can this? sneak in through here. Hey, this vent looks very promising. We might be able to get through here. Think? We don't really seem to have any other options, so we might as well try it. Um. Right. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me oh, no. double check. Just give me one second. We're going to double check to see... If we can put something on them. They said thunder, right? 
which I mean, I have, I have the regular one, which should technically, it should be fine. I'll keep that one on her. And then for you, let me do, I'll do that too. What do you think? <laughs> we made it. Um, but now we have a new problem. Um, <laughs> what the hell are we supposed to do? What are we gonna do about all of them? There's no way that we can sneak by these all of these soldiers undetected. Hey. Do you have any bright ideas? Let's take them all on. Mm. You mean you just want to fight them? I mean, maybe you could take them, but no, that wouldn't work. A fight this big would draw too much attention. Hey. Um, maybe. Huh? Hey. No, that would work. No. She could like fly hey. over. Maybe a distraction. What? Well, if we did that, then word of it would definitely reach Louise. Wait, that actually might work in our favor. I knew you'd come up with something. What? Excuse me. Stay hidden. I think that the others can help us. Wait, what just happened? This is the ammunition zip. Uh, sorry, the ammunition depot. A fire has broken out and it's going to blow. We need backup Damn immediately. It. Repeat, fire in the ammunition depot. Requesting immediate backup. Oh, good God. To me, last the fire is for everyone. Bro, th th if that actually happened, everything would blow up. Get out of here. <laughs> what the fuck? Are they just... Are they just literally spamming them with fucking alerts? What is this? Um, tis the... Uh, what, what, I mean this, what I mean to say is uh, this is the pantry. We, we swatted an intruder. We need reinforcements right away. And the fiend has eaten all of the dried meats and bread and um oh let's see oh some salted fish before before withdrawing send reinforcements immediately did she actually eat all that shit herself is that what she's trying come to say on. what the hell did an assassin come on board with an empty stomach or something whatever let's go get them two arms Give me a hand. Hail, this is the engine room. The primary engine is out of control. I fear an explosion is Sorry. imminent. All hands to the engine room on the double. Do not tarry. <laughs> what in the blazes? Now it's the engine room? This whole runner has gone to hell. <laughs> what the fuck? They're so stupid. They're so dumb. Oh my god. How did that work? Sort of keep you waiting. How'd it go? Um, it went so well to the point that it's kind of terrifying. It looks like their diversions did a, did the trick, though. All right. all right. Well, now the bridge is all emptied out. The plan worked out perfectly. The others should be coming, too, so let's take out this area's supervisor. <laughs> oh, Lady Juna, how is it that I still long for you when I always hear a voice singing in my head? Well, it looks like what we heard was true. He really is infatuated with Ju uh, Juna. The crew here really does love the songstress, don't they? What's your deal? Wait, what's this? Hang on. What are you doing all the way up here? Are the guards... Uh, sorry, all of the guards are supposed to be responding to the calls for backup. No. Oh, not us. We're new recruits. We've actually come to tour the bridge and introduce ourselves to our superior officers. <sighs> new recruits? Do you mean the ones that who uh, Lady Juna spoke to directly? Don't tell me. Is she the real reason you're here? I'm in love with her. Whoa. Hold on, Slow mate. those horses, mate. That is Lord Luis's lady you're talking about. Though I must admit, I feel the same. She has bewitched me, body and soul. I'm actually living for this. This is so good. So you're that kind of um, fan. The name is Cabio, the helmsman. I am Lady Juna's most devoted fan. The whole reason that I enlisted was so that I could bask in her radiant presence. Even a layabout like me needs to dream big. Mine is to take the Charitius here, up, here all the way up and sail the starry skies with Juna at my side. It seems we have only entered the prologue of his little rever uh, revier. Our time runs short. Get the get the key quickly. You're right. We don't even need to fight him. He's not even paying attention. Let me just go and grab. Go ahead and grab it. What the devil is going on over there? And why am I seeing soldiers without the proper clearance on the bridge? Wait, who the fuck are you? What? There's another one. You there? State your name, rank, and purpose. I haven't been informed of any troop reassignments. Understand. Entering the bridge without permission is a severe violation of regulations. You'd best have a good reason for being here, or else you will be detained. 
Um, we have permission. Indeed, tis just as he says. We borrowed the key from a senior officer and sought to familiarize ourselves with this runner. Oh. That is the most suspicious story I've ever heard. Hard to imagine a ranking officer simply lending a key to some grunt. I will have to look into this. I will have you know that you are speaking to Salva, chief of the guards. So once more, state your purpose and know that your life depends on your answer. Wait, hold on. This isn't the... No. I'm so confused. What's going on here? I don't remember Salva's name. Is this the other guy? Is this the weirdo who reflects magic? I swear to fucking God. If we have to fight both of them, I'm going to lose my mind. Chief, are those, they're, these are those recruits. You know, the, the ones that... um. Hey, wait a second. Just what are recruits doing in here anyway? No. Why, we simply just came to observe. Now that we've pledged ourselves to Lord Louise, we want to know the Cher Cheribidius, the Cheridius, inside and out. Oh. Well, even if that were the case, this is all still too strange by a half. A pack of new recruits gets their hands on a key, while the rest of the crew is dispatched elsewhere. Bro, just stop asking questions. Why is he being so dubious? Well, that's... <sighs> So you say you've come to learn more about us, do you? Well then, I will give you a valuable lesson in how to, how we treat sp suspicious curs. The ruse has failed. We have but one course of action now. We need to take them both out before the other soldiers return. Stop it. Are you kidding me? No. Is he the one who reflects magic? I swear to oh, fucking God. Military discipline is absolute. I've no sympathy for the kind of insolent devil who disobey a superior officer. Ha! Right he is. Now brace yourself, you amateur. I'll show you how to handle a real fight. We have to take both of them at the same time? We'd better take... Do we only have three turns? Are you fucking... Oh, are you kidding you me? Are you joking? Uh, uh, oh my god, this is so... Wait, hold on. Okay, I was gonna say, this is so fucking rude, though. Oh my god. No, I think, I think we should heal. Hold on. This should work. That helped. Helpful as ever. I need to get um I need to get Hulkenberg up in this fish right now. Fight. Mm. Wealth may be a fearsome weapon with blade in hand. I'll see you clapped in irons. Lightning. I will Maybe not. Oh, you know what? Hold on, hold on. I wanted to do oh, something else, up. and then I completely forgot that I did it wrong. Oh, did we lose this turn too? Ooh, okay, no more healing for us Let's two go. either. So broken, oh my god. God, I love you, babe. Oh my god, that is, that is disgusting, bro. I'll take much more. Merchant! Roar! I'll use what I must. Okay, what else do I have here, though? Uh, I'm gonna use the critical rate just in case because I need to I need to screw this guy up really hard. I don't know if this is gonna work. Depending on how cool the tech works on uh, on whatever this man is, we'll have to see how this goes. Uh huh. Oh my God, sir! <laughs> I I need you to relax. Like, oh my God, sir! This isn't how I imagined this. It's okay, babe. It's okay. We're gonna we got this. We got this. It's okay. The full HP recover with a merchant? Crazy. How does that happen? Okay. We can do this. Oh my gourd. How is this gonna go? Merchant!
Is he dead? Well, oh, he is. Touches. Okay. Oh my god, I hate him. I fucking hate him so much, bro. What is your problem? Oh, oh my god, thank god. Oh. Oh my god. dream. Count Louis trusted us to handle things in his absence. How could we fail him like this? I don't know, but it works out for me, so I don't care. Another one. Where are... No but so they myself. keep giving me these items. Admit, what is this? Good to get stronger. <sighs> we knocked both of them out. Getting trounced by recruits has got to be the grounds for a dishonorable discharge around here. So I doubt that they're going to tell anyone. I was going to say, just don't say anything, bro. Just just say nothing. I shall retrieve the key. It would be on Cavio, right? Yes. Oh, I already got it. Our work here is done. Oh. Quite the relief. Our route of infiltration has finally be se got been it. secured. Hey, while we've got the chance, we might as well go as far as, we've been a or as we're able. I think that we've earned a look around Luis's private quarters. Well, here's the thing, though. If, if we do that, then All right. what if he's in his quarters... Couldn't we, like, make sure that he's not there? Let's go. Isn't that kind of suspicious? I don't know if that's a good ah. idea. Alright, well, I mean... Let me go ahead and... Let me save. Where's my thing here? Wait, isn't it okay? Oh, it won't even let me go in? Oh, okay. Alright. I I see how it is. Let me go ahead and just in case, because I don't trust this shit. Um, let me put on the thingy. Where's my thing? What did I have on him before? I don't even remember. Um Let's let's do something or other. Oh, okay. No, no, no. I I remember. I remember. open now we can get into Luis's private quarters no wait the guards are incoming wait have we been noticed we have to take cover okay listen no this is a good thing because what if we went up there and Lord Luis was already there or someone else I don't trust that Sam. Fidelo wouldn't have sent me here for no reason but there's no one in sight and what the hell was that random request for backup Eh, can't be too careful. Stay sharp until the machinists have finished up maintenance. Yes. Understood. I will have security tighten. I'm leaving. Let us nose around the other areas too, just in case. Look lively. Oh no, hold on. Oh, okay. So they they're not gonna bother going up here. Ooh, okay. Sneaky. Look at that. Ooh. Hey, I think they're gone. At least we didn't get caught. However. However, they could tell that something was amiss, and he requested increased security too. It's fine. We've secured a path to Luis's quarters. Now all we have to do is wait until the day of the That's soiree. True. That's right. No need to push ourselves too far right now. Let's quit this place. Okay. Oh, I see. I see what they're doing. So basically, we almost went in and we almost checked ahead. But apparently, we may as well just wait now. Not bad. Ooh. Feels good. We got all that shit done in one day. Yeah, I thought it was going to take way longer. Well, our infiltration route is secured. I suppose that we owe our, th uh, owe our thanks to Gallica this time. Indeed. Indeed. Having detailed information about the runner's interior beforehand made it much easier to explore. Mm. 
Thinking back on it, you agreed to that solo infiltration with barely a moment's hesitation. That is admirable nerve. Hmm. Well, I suppose I had to make myself useful eventually. Sure, but... If I am honest, though, I know that I complain a lot and I'm not always at my bravest, but I'm always prepared to do my best. There's no point in focusing on what you can't fix, so I can still help in my own way. <laughs> the smallest tasks still need doing, and I'm perfect for them. It's it. because she's small. Leave the small tasks for the small people. I can sense Galica's dependable resolve. <gasps> Oh, did that give us the thing? Ooh. We'll keep going forward. We won't hesitate. Oh, and now apparently her face sight has increased too, which means that she's even more useful. Even so. Or as useful as she can get right now. Still, the soiree is the main event, and we have no idea what awaits us, so we mustn't let our guard down. Yep. That's right. Until we get the formula, why don't we stay on our toes? Or um wings if you got them. Time marches bah, 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 bah. on, and the age of a new king draws nearer. All right. Well, our infiltration route to Luis's quarters is secure. We just have to wait for the soiree. Can't imagine what kind of party a villain like him would throw. We have no clue what to expect Man. there. We should make certain that we have the strength to handle whatever surprises may await True. us. Or we could help more of those in need. Instead of idly wi uh, whiling away the hours, we should do whatever we can to ensure that our efforts are not in vain. All right. I'm assuming that we can just go do other people's stuff or whatever now. I think we have, what, was it three days at most? Oh, only two days. Oh, well, oh, oh okay. Um, apparently, right. God has a plan. What now? Um, let's do... We have the relic search, but we can't do it just yet. Moore's task, blah, blah, blah. Um, well met, eh? I think we've done all the debates, too. I feel we're actually doing pretty good. What is our thing? Hold on. What is our popularity ranking? 26? All right. Let me move over to... Uh, I don't know if they still have it, though. Okay, it's only at night. Um, We want to go take a look at the gambling stuff after. But before that... Um, who can we talk to? I think I'm going to go ahead and we're going to go talk to Stroll. Oh, it's you. Oh, hey, what are you up to? Ironic how fidgety one gets when told to wait, isn't it? Oh, that's right. Regarding the matter of my inheritance, it seems that my father's merchant friend reached out to Lord Hydran. I would like to go to the Grand Cathedral to negotiate, and if you have time, would you accompany me? Sure. Thanks. I think if we end up getting him to max rank, I might low-key replace him with Juna, because I know that we're going to get her soon, probably. So, just in case. I have been informed about the land. This conversation could have been far less roundabout if you had only informed me of your assets. Hmm. Yeah, but we didn't actually know at the time, right? What are these documents? The contract, lad. You seem rather hurried, so I wasted no time preparing it. With but a signature, you become a land owner. Worry not. This is countryside land, yes, but the price is a rare bargain. The owner forfeited it forfeit forfeit after losing his fortunes on a gamble. I see. There was an owner? Then am I right to presume that this land still has tenants? Yes, quite a few. They are yours to command. Vacate them, employ them, the choice is yours. Your property, your people. A bargain, wouldn't you say? <laughs> Excuse me? This guy, literally, I like how they're just like, yeah, he's a great ally to have on your side. No, he's a fucking prick. He's awful. The total acreage is a bit smaller than Halia. Oh, minor details. This land is readily available, and that alone makes it valuable. There's even an estate manor that you can claim at your convenience. No. No, it matters, actually. Yeah, something is off. Something seems very off about this. Yeah. That's right. If there are already residents there, then I would be introducing conflict by moving the Hellions on top of them. Needless to say that this land will not let me realize my vision. <sighs> Why do you concern yourself with the squatters if they are no, of no use to you? Sorry, of no use to you. Push them out of sight and out of mind. A lord hardly deserves the title without land to govern. You would reject this contract knowing that? <sighs> Bitch, this is not the point. 
stroll. You should be honest with him about this. Apologies. I do apologize, Lord Hydran, but I can't in good conscience sign this contract. Girl, do you know what a refusal would do to my reputation? As a noble, you must know that this will have ramifications. Yeah. All of the land in the world does not make a lord until he shoulders the responsibility of protecting his people. Yeah, he's like, he's like, yeah, just take over and just pit, push everyone out, bro. Like, that's fine. Like, no, that's not how that works. To hell with nobles who cannot recognize that. In fact, I would like you to make, sorry, I would like to make a counter offer. I will buy 100 of your vacant houses here in the capital. Wait, 100? Vacant or not, residence does not come cheap in the capital. Your ilk could never afford them. I'm, I'm already verified the going market rate, and my ilk has more than enough to cover the cost. Are you surprised? I looked into it while you were helping me make inquiries. Ooh, wow, clever. He's so smart. That was a clever move, Stroll. No, then. I know that I'm just a countryside noble, but you wouldn't dream of overcharging me, would you? It would certainly have ramifications. You must be familiar with my compatriot by now, yes? Indeed, your reputation would certainly suffer were it to come to light that you were trying to scam us. Oh my god, yo, get out of here, bro. <laughs> oh my god, the finessing is real. Surely you're not threatening me, are you, boy? No. Well, of course not. I have simply made a competitive offer for vacant houses that you could not seem to find a buyer for. You, st you stand to profit, really. Hmm. <laughs> Just the idiocy that I would expect from the son of a backwater lord who could not even flee correctly. Excuse me? Excuse me? Are you good? I'm going to punch this man. You would sacrifice your house in the name of sheltering peasants? You may as well toss the money down the latrine. It insults the entire aristocracy and you will live to regret it. Fine. You're the one who will live to be sorry. This country will change and then the corrupt nobles like you are on the cusp of extinction. My parents who risk their lives to protect their people are the real nobles and my heroes. No, now, Lord Hydran, shall we put ink to the parchment? I like how he literally was just like, he's like, you're, you're a corrupt POS, and let's shake hands. That's crazy. I would never. I would have told him to, to get out of there. Young master, you used your inheritance to, bought, to purchase houses for us in the capital? Your generosity for us goes too far. <sighs> Be at ease, old friend. I'm just being stubborn, perhaps even selfish. The more that I pondered what I should do, the less clear the answer became. But when I asked myself what I truly wanted, I knew without a doubt. Hmm. I wanted to see sorry, to, I wanted to see your smiles again. The ones that I remember from a simpler time, and I wanted those smiles to come naturally. A nobleman is the shield in his people's hands, durable enough to protect them, but light enough to carry. Else what value does he have? Oh, is he like is he quoting his parents? Another gem of my parents' wisdom. I am sorry though. I know that you wanted House Heliotis to rise again. And no, you have shown us a way to live with more pride than any fortune or glory could impart. It has been my life's greatest honor, greater than any words could express, to have served such a dignified family. Sorry about that. Well, I'm sorry to have left you to languish for so long. From here on, I hope happier times win the day. Wow. Oh, young Master Leo, I mean, pardon, Lord Shrawl. Thank you. It is with our utmost gratitude that we accept these accommodations. Let us begin our lives anew, dreaming that one day we will unfurl the banner of House Haliotis and serve its new lord proudly. Yeah. Oh my god, everyone's gonna have a happy ending. That's nice. Thank you. And thanks to you as well. I couldn't have made it through without you. <laughs> I mean, I've done nothing of real value. <laughs> you are a genuine friend, you know that? Oh my god, best friends, yeah. best friends. I didn't choose to help these people out of sense, some sense of noble obligation. It was far more simple than that. If I have the power to save someone, then I will, as straightforward as it can be. When someone needs a helping hand, I will be there to extend it. Yeah. I would wager that my parents were much the same, and I think that living my life with that in mind is what they would expect of me. I can sense Stroll's intense determination. It's like nothing I've ever felt before. Hey. The proud and noble Stroll, keeper and inheritor of the warrior's no. virtues. Your tempered bond has become a fire-forged trust. And thus a new pinnacle of heroism awakens within thee. Bear this new power, foster this connection, and by their strength fulfill thy destiny. Okay. I've got it, Father. The party can now study the samurai. Ayo. That's cool. Oh wow. 
You can now study the samurai in academia. Try seeing what new powers await you. Well, Ooh, okay, you know what I want to do then? I kind of want to take him off and put him on to, um... I want to put him on the warrior path again. We're going to, like, raise him all the way up into samurai. I want. I just want to see what it does. I want to see what it does for him. I'm so glad that you can. You have found refuge here in the capital, Rangif. I even found a merchant that my father knew as well. Dutch. Your father would tell us all of the time that if there was ever an emergency, we should gather at the capital. Huh? And Grand Trad, but that's, uh, pay me no mind, but before we return, shall we tour your new accommodations? That's weird. Why did he react like that? Nice. Okay. So it should be nighttime now. We're going to go take a look at the gambler. I don't know if I actually won the gamble. I'm pretty sure I lost, but it could be wrong. Hmm. Oh my god, Alonzo. Why does Alonzo look so sad? What the fuck? Such a weirdo. All right, let All right. me go to... Let's go. Yeah, we're going to go over here. Wait, is it over? Don't tell me that they fucking took the gambling away. I'm going to be so fucking mad. No. No one more to do. Wait, bro, where's the where's the gambler? Where'd he go? If he doesn't fucking come back, I'm gonna be so fucking mad, bro. I swear to fucking god. Alright then. Judy Judy is a cutie patootie. Oh, thank you. Oh my god, thank you, Angel. I appreciate it. Let's go. <laughs> You're cute. No, thank you for saying that. I appreciate it. I'm All gonna right. I'm gonna jump over to talk to this weird man. Mr. Alonso, I'm like really high. Oh, I was gonna say you skewed like really hard with your friend today. So like low key, like like what happened? Did you guys literally just like veg out on the couch and just like just like have food and just like chill for the entire day? Because like, honestly, that sounds like a vibe. That sounds like what me and um what me and my friend Frank used to do once in a while. No food, but like super skewed. Why didn't you order food too? You gotta have like at least like a snacky or something to eat too. That's how you that's how you get in the mood, bro. You gotta veg out. Ah, oh, well met. What are you up to? Oh, um, about checking on my home village. I was wondering if now is a good time for you to join me. Ooh. Thank goodness. Oh, thank you for the shadow bones. I appreciate it. Having grown up in the same village, we were inseparable as brothers, and I would like to firm up in our next steps and then head over. Oh, okay. Ridiculous. Well, this should do. Oh, hold on. This should do. The owner was kind enough to give us some space. My collaborator, that is, my good friend from back home, should arrive any minute now. Hmm. Kill me. Oh my god. Hmm. He's late, and you've come all of this way too. Come to think of it, I haven't really told you about where I grew up. It was a beautiful village full of flowers. Not wealthy, but not destitute. There was a cheerful tranquility to it. I... Apparently, I had been abandoned on a nearby road as a baby. Oh my, what? The woman who took me in is my mother and all but blood. She is Parapus, and I am a Nydia. We couldn't look more different, but she raised me like I was her own. She would never stop smiling at me, and she was always so proud to call me her son. She sounds like a very kind yes. person. Oh, she is. So kind, it's astounding. Must protect at all costs. Protect protect the bean. Mother is a good person, and she trusts far too readily. Though she has this uncanny ability to know when I'm the one lying. 
Anyway, she was an easy mark for fraudsters, and I can't tell you how many times she, an expert, sorry, how many times an expertly told sob story was all it took to rob her of everything she had. What? Why would, well, I mean, like, shouldn't you have helped him taken care of her then if she's that bad, or at least, like, help her out somehow? Fuck, bro. In fact, my only memories of her without a smile are the times that she would apologize to me for having nothing to eat again. Tears welling in her eyes. Come on. That's why I started conning, you know. I decided that I would give any miscreant scum who's ever taken advantage of such kindness a taste of their own hell, each and every one of them. My latest mark is the worst villain of them all. It is the landowner of my hometown. He changed my, idyll my idyllic village into what it is today. Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. That was more than I'd meant to say. It'll be fine. We're gonna save your village. Thank you. Aww. I like him a lot now. He's a lot chill now. I have been blessed with a silver tongue since I was born. I can fool anybody except my mother. You know, you're a bit like her too. Strangely enough, <laughs> I had forgotten what a nice feeling this is, being able to have a genuine conversation with someone. So thank you for listening. I can sense Alonzo's deep-seated gratitude. Give your bond to me. Feed my bond. I find myself wanting to believe you. Oh my god, yes. Believe me. Believe me, daddy. Let's go. Hear me. Is Kakulis here? Oh my god, he's mad. Well, well, oh my god, who is this creature? What is this creature doing here? Why, um, welcome, good sir. Have you come to check on the clients? Hmm. You can drop the act, Kukulus, or beg your pardon, should I say Alonzo? Hmm. Good grief. You are from that village of paupers, aren't you? Did you fancy yourself your, uh, some sort of hero with your little tricks? A cheat is still a cheat. We are the same, you and I. Except that you're more of a fool if you think that you'll ever get justice. <laughs> you have money that belongs to the village, and I would see it all return to its rightful place. Is that not justice? <laughs> Perhaps you will change your tune after seeing the sorry state that your village is in now. Excuse me? Your associate, the one that you meant to meet here, it took some doing, but we managed to squeeze sorry, squeeze a few details out of him and about your family. What? Hmm. What have you done to my mother? Well, simply killing her wouldn't teach you any lessons, nor would it be any fun. What did you do? What Ooh, oh shit. <laughs> you can't change things, and you can't save anyone. This one is on the house boy. Alright, I'm gonna fucking beat his ass. Yeah, we're going after him. The distraught Alonzo and I rushed by carriage to his hometown. Did they burn his town down? Oh my god, no. <laughs> I'm hungry. I told you, Angel. I told you you had to get food earlier, bro. Girl, I'll get cereal. Yeah, go get yourself some cereal, babe. Or better yet, order Domino's. We arrived at a village near Brylehaven, and it has been set ablaze. Are you fucking... Are you kidding me? Ugh. Um, a man, he asked if Alonzo's mother was here. Oh, don't speak, mother. I'll save I'm you. Sorry. I told him, that's me. You're my one and only son. And I love... Please. Mother, I'm sorry. This is my fault. <gasps> are you... Alonzo. Are you fucking... Guys, are you fucking kidding me right now? They're gonna fucking kill his mom? Live on. Mother. Can you hear me? Please say something. Mother. What is up with this game, bro? What? <laughs> like, what is this? This is so fucked up. Hey. The landowner's servant told, the, told us it was you, that you were chumming up to the land landowner to suck this village dry. <sighs> and now you've put us to the torch. What the hell did we ever do to you? <laughs> it's my fault. I can pay for the reconstruction. I have the money, so I'll, I'll give it. And you traded your mother's your mother's life for that money. What? No, I didn't. Keep your blood money, you filthy murderer. Wait, no, please take the money. Use it for the village and, and to bury her. The only one who belongs in a grave is you. Yeah, you should have died instead. Burn in hell, you damn parasite. No, he's cute. D bro, this is awful. Oh my god, I'm so fucking mad right now. <laughs> a villain will always strike where it hurts the most. At the family and home. I should have known. I said the damn words myself. People are never more vulnerable to tricks when they think they are playing one on themselves. Playing one themselves. I should have known. 
Was I blinded by revenge? No, I was simply unequivocally a fool. Your mother said to live on. You have to be strong for her. Why? Do not wish that upon me. I have been feeding on my mother's life this whole time. <laughs> Just like a parasite or whatever. <laughs> I'm sorry. I never had the power to change a single thing. Alonzo refused to move or even stand. But after ensuring his safety, I had no choice but to leave his side. Bro. Time that was kind of rude. And the that was rough. Of a new king draws nearer. <laughs> oh my god. I was I was not expecting that turnabout. Oh my god. Hmm. It is the day before Luis's ser a soiree. Let us do what we are able and then simply wait. We have done all that is within our power, and then the die has already been cast. Excuse me. I wonder if we will really find the formula within Luis's quarters. Sorry, I just can't help by worry. Oh well. All we can do now is hope that the operation goes off without a hitch. This one will be a real tightrope act, but if we can't pull this off, then we have no hope of ever saving the prince. <sighs> Man. Man, he did not deserve that. I'm not going to so? get... I'm going to be thinking about that all night. Boy, that is rude as hell. What else we got? Apparently Barden wants to talk to me. Well, guess what? I don't want to talk to Barton right now. Um, let me take a look at our thing here. Um, okay, so Wisdom is getting pretty close to leveling up. Tolerance is about halfway leveling up. Eloquence is about halfway. Imagination needs some work. I think Courage is also halfway too. Um, I'm going to go ahead. We're going to work on Imagination. So, where go? I think it's this one. Let's head there right away. Oh, so we're all on. All right. We have to go right take a poop. Time to take a poop, bruh. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow, meow. Meow, 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 meow. This. Here we go. I don't remember where the bathroom is. Right. Got it. What now? Did I already? Uh, oh, I did. Okay. I was like, where'd my points go? Sussy. Hmm? All right, then. Go. Imagination. Was it this one here? Where is that? Oh, here we go. You, you're the ones from the exhibition. Why would you do such a thing? As if you sought to denounce sanctism itself. I take it that you're angry. No, I only have a tale that I would like you to hear. My intent is not to criticize. It is a thought-provoking folk tale that I imagine that you have not heard. When I saw you at the exhibition, I was reminded of it. Hmm. We reminded you of a folk tale? I admit that I am curious. If I listen to his story, I think it'll hone my imagination. Thank you. Absolutely. A long time ago. Once upon a time in a faraway village, there lived an old woman with a talent for making miraculous memories said to cure any illness. But the people of the village despised her medicine, which had a deeply unpleasant taste. What? Excuse Are you fucking kidding me? People are really out here being like, ew, your, med your medicine sucks because it tastes awful? Bro. <laughs> what the fuck? It also had a terrible side effect, causing terrible pain. As though the entire body was being stabbed with needles. Oh, okay. Well, never mind. I, t I take it back. Some even told her that I would rather die than endure such a fate. And yet still, they could not deny... Oh, ayo. They could not deny its effectiveness. And though they were reluctant, they sought her medicines when it was necessary. One but one day, a man came to the village. The man said, I can make better medicine than the old woman's poison. 
and from his pocket he pulled a vial of sweet-smelling liquid and handed it to one of the sick. The sick man, who had been taking the woman's medicine for years, always looked ill, and he eyed the vial with disgust, but after he quaffed it, his eyes widened in surprise. It tastes like sweet fruit, he said, and then suddenly the pain and suffering of his malady vanished. The people were stunned by this medicine's effectiveness, and the villagers begged the man for all of the medicine he had. It was not cheap, but they offered the man uh, what money and crops that they could. They grew furious with the old woman as well. How dare you deceive us with poison disguised as medicine, they said. The woman looked as though she might deny the accusation, but then silently, silently continued making her draughts. However, the people no longer in, were interested in her medicine, and they shouted abuses at her, calling her a fraud, and eventually they drove her from the village. Oh, is that, is that that time already? I've gone on long enough. Okay. No, I wanted... It was just getting interesting. I don't like Gandhi. <laughs> okay. Congrats on seven hours. Thank you, BB. And I'm actually going to run... I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to run a three-minute ad. We're going to run a big fat ad because we have about an hour left before we have to uh, to sign off or whatever. So um, just a heads up, you guys. You're not going to miss anything. Don't worry. I'm not taking an actual break or anything. All right. Yeah, I feel really sorry for that old woman. I, I just, I can explain why I don't like Gandhi. Okay, explain it to me. Tell me. All right. Spill your tea. Well, then. I need to understand why you suddenly are so adverse to Gandhi's teachings, bro. What happened? What did he, where did he touch you? What did he do to you? I'm just... A symbol of peace, right? I mean, technically, I mean, like, I don't think that people necessarily saw him, like, as a symbol of peace. But, like, they saw him as somebody who tried to preach being peaceful. So, like, I mean, like, it's one of those things, like, he had, like, teachings and stuff like that, which I guess some people follow. Let me double check to see if there's actually anything else here, too. Hold on. I don't think there is. Um, nor... Uh, what? I... Oh, I don't think that... Sorry. I don't think that Brigida would have much to say given my current courage. Oh. Alright, I see, I see. Mm. Oh, I need higher... No! What the heck? Bro... Why are they so rude? He said that the Jews should have thrown themselves from the cliffs into the ocean as it would have aroused the world. What the fuck is... What are you talking about? He refused to allow his wife medicine, arguing that it was alien and her body wouldn't accept it, yet he took the medicine himself. Oh, that's kind of sus. That's kind of weird. Excuse me. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, Bones. This sounds almost like you're just like listing off like a bunch of like random things or something from him. Like that's kind of weird. Is this actually on Google? Cause like, I think you should send me the DM like link or whatever so I can actually see it later. Cause like that sounds kind of sussy. Like it actually sounds so fucking random. That sounds so weird. Wonderful. Huh. Hello again. Isn't that? Oh, hold on. Will it let me go right. to the guy? Let's go. It will. Okay, we're gonna go. Hold on. Is it here? All right. I think that they, he should hopefully, I don't know if it's like now or after, but he should give me the gamble. Don't be in such a rush. Ooh, excuse me. No, I want my fucking winnings now, bro. All right, then. And he's so rude. Let's go. All right. Time to do some Amy Janie Chambre. Oh. 
Hello. Isn't that... Oh, well. Hello. Isn't that... Thank you. Then... As a group, all of the villagers sick... Sorry, all of the villagers sick drank the medicine that the newly arrived man had brought with him. Doing so made their pain vanish into euphoria, and soon, even those in good health started to partake in this miracle medicine. But they soon discovered the, the, the effects... T. <clears throat> oh my god. Somebody, somebody give me a fucking miracle cure right now. Um, they soon discovered that the effects were not long-lasting. Illnesses that appeared to have been cured soon relapsed. And worse still, the afflicted found their symptoms even more painful than before. We need more medicine, the sick cried. The medicine man, now in short supply, raised his prices, and yet the sick continued to pay what he asked, despite its effects growing weaker and weaker. Until finally, the village was too poor to pay, and then the man disappeared, leaving the sick writhing in agony behind him. The old woman was true to us, someone whispered, and the villagers hurry hurriedly went to find her and beg for forgiveness. The old woman did not blame the villagers, simply handing them her bitter, uh, her bitter medicine. This time, the sick endured the terrible effects and began to recover. And then the villagers asked the old woman, Why did you save us? Did we not deserve punishment for rejecting you? Quietly, the woman replied, If a life can be saved, I would save it. The old woman continued to treat those who were suffering, asking for nothing in return, and eventually she came to be celebrated as the, as the Healer King. Some believe that the Healer King was one of the Mustari, although voicing such heresies forbidden by the Sanctus Church. I hesitate to speak of things like this, given my position, and I couldn't say why, but I felt like it was a tale that you needed to hear. That's weird, how convenient that he tells us that story. But much like the old woman's medicine, the truth often leaves a bitter taste, such as my thought on the matter anyway. Oh. Huh. All right. That's interesting that someone who works, who does like, he like works for the church, he's like, he's like, yeah, so just, just a heads up. Here's some shit I probably shouldn't be saying. Well then. Kind of weird. Time marches on, and the age of That's kind of sussy, right? Like nearer. someone from the church being like, "Yeah, maybe, maybe this isn't how it's supposed to be," or like, uh, I don't know. Whatever the fuck he said was just apparently her it was like heresy or something. Why would he say that? All right, everyone. The soirée will be held tonight at the feast hall that Luis is staying at. Let's go over our roles one more time. Okay, guys, guys, the the story is about to pick up. Are you ready? Got it. I mean, hopefully, hopefully it picks up. This should be like a, a, a thing that we're going to deal with. First, we all greet Luis together. Let him know that we showed up and ex accepting, sorry, accept, accepting Galica. Of course, she will stay hidden so that he, the way they wrote that, accepting Galica, wouldn't you just say accept Galica, of course? Why accepting Galica? That's a weird way to write that. He stays hidden so that he only sees one person go missing. Once we are clear of him, the captain and Galica will slip out with all speed and head for Luis's gauntlet runner. Heisme, Hulkenberg, and I will keep tabs on Luis and buy whatever time we can. Watch this turn into a completely, like, a fucking massive disaster. <laughs> like, I can already see it coming. We have one objective. Take the curse formula from Luis's Skyrunner. All, right. all hangs upon this mission. His Highness, the Prince, and the very kingdom itself are at stake right now. I know that I'm acting like I'm calling the shots here, but honestly, you're the one that we're depending on. Once you're in, if you run into any guards, it'll be on you to take them out quick, and we can't have them raising the alarm. Things will be fine. You are really the only one who has a chance alone against Louise's best. Sorry to put all of this on your soldiers, but we believe in you. Yep. All right, pray for me. Let us watch ourselves up there, all of <sighs> us. Okay, we're going to move at nightfall. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Ooh, all the people are here. Ooh. Sharp soldiers all. They carry themselves with more poise than Martyrus guards. They comprised the most elite unit of the military until Luis's secession. Now they are his private guard. I don't see Luis. Those brothers, all that songstress. 
But this many people here means the runners got to be all but empty. Shh, they're here. Glad you made it. Mm. Could stand to loosen up a little, though. What's got you lot so wound up? Well, you have to admit, the assembled company is more than a little intimidating. <laughs> You'll get used to that. You'll have to if you want to survive. Hey, pups. Oh. Where's that Ishkia man? The lanky old chap with the glasses. He's keeping watch over our gauntlet runner. What? Don't feel safe leaving your gauntlet runner empty. I was going to say like, he's always in the gauntlet runner, though. He never comes out. Is she not coming? Ah, uh, she's under the weather. Poor girl went and lost her voice. Not many others could refuse an invitation from Lord Louis and live to tell it. Be looking forward to having another chat Wait. with her, eh? What a shame. Zell got a bit tricky What were they implying by that? Too. That's God weird. Belt up. There he is! Oh my god, he's here. I'm glad you could make it. I feel somewhat out of place. No need to be modest. Standing in attendance here proves you've won my approval. Everyone recognizes that. Now, while the drinks in their cups have yet to reach their heads, let's get the formality of introductions out of the way. Friends, today we welcome a most emboldening addition to our ranks. Doubtless you've heard of the young candidate who brought great shame to Sanctifex Forden. Before you stands the young man himself. Indeed, I was much surprised to learn he brought that Sanctorus forward with the intent of winning my regard. Commendably bold. Now, let us greet our new allies with warmth and pride. <laughs> Bro, I'm so confused. We're trying to get on his good side. Why would I say follow me and this land will be saved? Why would we say that? If my sword will be of use, you have it. It's your life on the line now, boy. Don't go losing it too quick now. The rest of the night is yours to drink in. Enjoy the party. Go. We'll take care of the rest. Hey, new boy. Slow down. Wouldn't be wise to snub a ranking officer now, would it? Well, look who it is. The only blowhard who showed up to the competition with a head smaller than his own. You little red-eyed! You want to say that again? I was gonna say that was perfect. Thank you, Heisme, bruh. 23. Right. Ooh. More people have taken an interest in me, and Luis has formally acknowledged it. Now we just need to find the formula to the prince's curse. We managed to slip out of the soiree and infiltrate the Charidius while the guards were shorthanded. Wait, what does he mean, we? Right. Okay, it's just those two. Okay. The security is nice and light. We were smart to do this on the night of the soiree. The lift to the ah. Luis's quarters is right there. Oh, shit. I'm ha oh, no, I have it on auto. Ah! Slow down. Hang on, there are guards in front of the lift. Of course they're watching this door. I'm, I'm gonna have to beat their ass. What is going on? We can't afford to get slowed down. Just beat him up, bro. Knock him the fuck out. We don't have a choice. We'll have to look for a way around. Stop. Hey, come here for a moment. Wait, what are you yes. doing? Did you hear that alert this morning? We're just making sure that all of the extra security measures are in working order. Wait, what's wrong with you? Has something got you worked up? Oh, that's right. The bridge is locked and I can't get in. Can you give me a hand, would you? Cavio is on duty, isn't he? What is he doing locking the door? Well, I heard that someone saw Lady Juna enter the bridge. Wait, you don't mean... Are they alone in there? What do you think is going on? Wait, what? Yeah. Oh, you sent them to me? Okay, but good, good. I was gonna say. The shit that you said was, like, so, like, <laughs> so wild. I'm like, I'm like, I need proof. You have to send it. Oh my god, no, the key's not working. This is the one that worked before. Did they end up changing the lock somehow? They were just talking about some extra security measures. Oh 
This isn't good. What do we do? We don't have much time. Oh no, we're basically fucked. Now we just keep up the charade as long as we can. Might I have a moment, please? Stroll, if I recall. I've heard you're a titled noble. Yet you stand behind a commoner candidate. I stand with a candidate who's proven he has power and potential. Oh, they were teens? Okay, I was going to say. I was like, ooh, I'm spicy. I'm lineage alone. My house no longer stands. Where are you from? Have you heard of a village called Harlia? Certainly. It was the first village to be destroyed by the human menace. Only because help never came. They requested reinforcements, but the army wouldn't spare a single soldier. Are the rumors true that... that was by your decision? That is true. But why? To save this country. Stroll! The Fool King and the fossils of the Sanctus Church refused to face the threat looming over this country. An adequately dramatic demonstration was required. They say you could see Halia burning as far as the palace. Why is he smiling? Why is he smiling at that? Fire, Excuse me? could no longer deny the human threat. Your bale fire cost hundreds of innocent lives. Do I offend you? Are you repulsed? Surely it helps you realize that you can protect nothing without power. The natural blessings you enjoyed are not infinite. Few have the luxury of living with no need to struggle and harm just to survive. But our nation would have you believe such hardship is born of moral weakness. So the punished are punished further. They die in silence like livestock. Their reality denied. It defies reason. All people deserve the chance to fight for their lives with their lives some will fall some will triumph and therein is true equality forged however cruel <sighs> i am not one to stand idly by as history is wrought. all their sacrifices and yours shall not be in vain a valuable conversation i do hope you enjoy the party Alrighty then. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Humblest apologies. He's a young heart and hasn't yet learned to temper his words. Oh, no worries. Truth told, I'd take him over the sycophants. But Brett's nowhere to be seen. Where'd he slip off to? He couldn't have. Oh my god, Glodel, no. Actor. All right, okay, something sussy is going to happen. I can already tell. At this rate, the guards will come back, and if we miss the opportunity, we'll not get another. Okay, but how the fuck? How am I supposed to get inside? I feel the strangest sensation, like my body is being pulled down. Wait. Wait, what? What, 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 what happened? Oh. Hey, what's going on? There wasn't a takeoff scheduled for tonight. Was it Juna? Did Juna make the runner take off? And, oh, and she went in with Cavio. Oh, no. She, oh, no. she went in with Cavio, the guy who's like her biggest fucking fan. Oh no, I see what's going on here. Wait, hang on. This is bad. We've got to change the flight path. Uh, we'll ram straight into the sphere of water. That whole area is thick with distortion from the magla, and if we get too close, the whole damn craft will tip. <laughs> what are we gonna do? All of this commotion is gonna have this place full of panicking guards, and if we stay put, they're gonna find us. I, I don't know. Girl, I don't know what to do. All right. We came here earlier, but there was not any anything here. Uh, what was that? Floor suddenly tilted. Um... Oh my god, no. What is going on, sir? What the fuck? What happened? Did the oh, did the entire ship fucking What's fall over? On? What the fuck? That soldier from earlier was freaking out about some effect from a magla crystal. 
Maybe this is it. <laughs> what is happening? What the fuck is going on? Hello? Wait, I'm so confused. What happened? Wait, are we still are we flying? That helped a lot. Wait, what just happened? Are we still are we standing on the outside of the chariot charidius? No. Well, I knew that this vessel this was a big vessel, but this thing looks like it goes on for ages. This isn't going according to plan. Yeah, no shit. I wasn't expecting to go throw get thrown out onto the hall. But failure isn't an option. I have to think, what can I do to keep this track what on mission? Do do? Sorry, mission on track. What the fuck? Brain. This isn't good. What do we do? Um we have to head for Luis's huh? private quarters. Did you Ooh. Hmm? Wait, if you're serious, I'll get ready. If we ride together, we die together. Luis's quarters are straight ahead, all the way at the end. If you're careful, you should be able to jump across the glowing sections by using them as scaffold. We We're losing time, so let's hurry. I'll hide in your bag. Please do not kill us. Okay. Oh. Gangway! I, I kind of get it. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay, I see, I see, I see. Yeah. Oh my god. Whoa. Sweet. This is a lot. Oh my god. Where, did, where am I going? I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> what happened? This is weird. What's going on? Bro, what the fuck is what is this? This is so crazy. Literally a uh, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater over oh, here. Nice. Wow, we actually made it. We got to Luis's quarters. I thought that we were gonna die there. You can be so reckless. This is no good. Um, I think that we're moving away from the crystal. The runner is gonna go back to normal now. If we don't get back inside, we're gonna die. Yeah, just get in, get in now. Run, uh. run. Oh my god, it's starting to tilt again. Uh. We have to jump through the door. Hurry. Coincidence or not, it is nice to have a bit of luck on our side. So here we are. Well, I do have very high luck, so. And yet. This room really is beautiful, huh? Maybe it's got some kind of special special spell so that nothing falls when it's turbulent. Let's hurry. Anyway, the formula that we're looking for is somewhere in here. Let's hurry and find it. All right. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Oh, we're, are we gonna get some weird plot yeah. information? Some some plot dumpies. Yeah. Magic book, magic book. Oh, another magic book. <gasps> some of these texts are pretty dense. It's like a little research library in here. Maybe the curse this formula is hidden somewhere. Oh, God. Mm. <sighs> I'm seeing several books on magic stacked on the shelf. All right. Yeah. Oh, can't get that open. It's like a closet or something. There are books on books about magic here. Such beautiful flowers, but I feel like I've seen them before somewhere. Wait, are these? These are royal flowers, the ones that Luis scattered at the royal funeral. Yeah, no, I was going to say no worries, baby. If you got alert, no worries. Um, I, We're going to be finishing in like, um, I want to say 40 minutes to an hour. So no worries. We're almost done. I'll try to message you, though. If you're still up, or when I'm still up as well, then um, we can, like, hang out or something. Keeping them in this room like this, it's like he's displaying a trophy. I wonder if that ego of his will fit inside of a crown. Yeah. It makes me sick just, just thinking about it. Let's find the formula quick. We have to save the prince. Is it the painting? It is a map marked with different routes. It looks like it shows the Oceana area. Check this out. Wait, hold on. What the fuck is that? 
Wait, there's some there's something there that they we don't have on our map. There's like a tower down there. What is that? And there's there's like a village in the center. What the fuck is that? Is Luis interested in this island for some reason? I wonder why. Yeah, weird. This is quite the art collection that he has here. This one looks like an exterior shot of the Char Charidius. Incredible. It's enough just walking around on the runner, but this painting really helps put into perspective just how impressive this vessel is. They say that it was originally developed by the state army and then Luis claimed it for his own. To him, it is a symbol of power and no doubt about that. <laughs> You don't think that he hid the formula behind one of these paintings, do you? Mm. I mean, it wouldn't hurt to check it out, though. Hey, what is it? Did you find something? Wait, hold up. Is that... Look! Wait, hey, look. It's the same novel? It's a forbidden text. So there shouldn't even be many copies left. That's impossible. Do you think Luis is actually reading this? If so, it doesn't seem like he's really getting its message. That's weird. Wait, in there! There's a hidden box! Yes! Magic formulas! Which one has the prince's curse? Oh, forget it! We'll just take the whole box! Oh no. What are you doing here? Um, <laughs> uh, I, um, I got lost. Um, I got lost. You're a terrible liar. Hey, didn't you just come out of the storage room? What were you doing in there? You're that fairy from before. Hm. Count Luis gave me permission to come and go as I please in his private quarters. Hey, didn't I hear you had a sore throat or something? They said you lost your voice, but you sound fine to me. Uh huh. I get it now. You snuck in this room last time too, didn't you? Wow, you're a real Ooh, repeat offender. Okay, okay. Oh, I'm really losing my touch. Oh, ma'am. <laughs> what the fuck? So, oh my god. Remember how I said I'd keep my eyes on you? Well, I have to say, I like what I see. Hey, get away from him! I don't suppose we could keep my little investigation secret. I'll keep quiet about you too, now that we're accomplices. Or, or you could just join my party. I feel like that would also work as well. What exactly are you looking for? Can't say, but I'll ask you no questions either. That makes us even, right? So, your little cohort cases the place first, leaving you to slink in once you've got the brief. Pretty sharp. Hey, I'm not just a little cohort. I have a proper name, and it's Gallica. Gallica? Your name is Gallica? Wait, does this mean... So you're here for... Someone's coming! Oh my god, no! Oh, no. The occupant's absent, but the door's locked. I see why the guards are in a panic. There's no use hiding. This is quite a turn-up, isn't it? The runt I might have figured for a rat, but even my lord's favorite little songbird? <laughs> what a scandal! And when he hears it from me... Maybe I'll finally get Wait, some Oh, he knows that they're both in there? Oh, no. Everything's falling apart. What do we do? We have to kill I him. I think he's gone. If he'd stayed, he could have trapped us here. Thank goodness he's as stupid as he looks. I'll take care of this. Just listen close and act fast. The box you found contains the formula to the curse. I knew it. We both know what you're here for, right? Take what's inside and leave. Okay, we're gonna be good. We're gonna be good friends. I can already Who tell. Are you? What are you? Let's survive now. Talk later, shall we? She told us to run, but we can't just leave her. I, I say we go after her.
Your attention, everyone. Assembled comrades, let us speak of the old vulture's last grasp at power. The tournament for the throne. It hardly bears saying that the competition is a farce. It is a transparent conceit of the Sanctus Church orchestrated to win Forden the throne. For all who bristle at their hubris, and indeed for the sake of the public, this hollow pageantry must be put to rights once and for all. And it shall be done by my hand. I hereby announce my formal entry into the competition. Ooh, okay. That is kind of weird. My lord, Forden would surely never allow you to enter the race midstream. Why would I care for his permission? The late king's decree was that the crown would go to whoever had won the people's trust, not whoever indulged the church's sideshow. I will enter at my leisure. Should he deny me, Forden will be rightly denounced as the coward he is and lose the nation's faith. Then all will know he was never the one in control. For all that we believe and all that we have proven, we shall bring their own dogma down on their heads. Yeah! All hail Lord Louis! We got one sanctuary strung up. Now let's send Forden to the gallows. He's entering the competition? Even knowing it was rigged, there's still a lot he could get out of it. He's just been biding his time all along. Louis. Unfortunately, I am told we have a rat in our midst sniffing for morsels at our esteemed colleagues heels <laughs> wretched rat if you stand among us tonight you may tell your master this i will neither run nor hide if you think you can stop the rule of power interesting come and hmm. Louis will be king. Hail king Louis. so there's like multiple people here who are like loki rats ayo oh my god i know whip out the popcorn for real They're going outside. No good. They're bound to check the gauntlet runner. We've got no choice but to chase and stop them. Oi, new bloke. Didn't hear you shout in Count Luis's name loud enough. Come now, let's see you cheer with your gut, eh? Ugh, out of the way. Oh my god, are they all drunk? Oh my god. This rate. Hey, Del. Look. The Caradrius is airborne. What? Why? You hear anything about a takeoff today? With its own around? Impossible. A rat's behind this. You know what's been on my mind? I want to know who took out Zorba. Wouldn't catch me dead sharing drinks with him, but he weren't some halfwit. If it was the Cathedral Guards, they had help. Think the rat nipped him too? Lord Luis has plenty of new friends I'm in about. I wouldn't be surprised if some think they're clever. And me. I'd start with those stooges who cast all their magic without igniters. Whoa, Del, eyes up. It's coming down. Secure the perimeter. Anyone so much as blinks the orders to kill on sight. Whoa, Del. I, I literally, I can't get over that he's the older brother, the little one. Oh my God, bruh. This is no good. Oh my God, Aurora. Hey, babe, welcome in. Hurry. How have you been? I was gonna say, I think I think you were on earlier, right? But I'm assuming um, I think you had to take a break or something and go do stuffies. My sinuses are fucking killing me, by the way, you guys. I don't know what is going on with them. Like I'm literally having such a hard, uh, blah, hard such a hard time fucking breathing. It's fucking annoying. How are you doing, BB? We're literally like right in the middle of the story right now. Oh, it's open. Ready? Huh. Um, there's no telling what would happen. Mm -hmm. oh, go for it. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. What's going on? I'm doing. How about you? I am also doing. Oh, stop it. Was that? I think she's on the deck. Mm 
Did I jump scare you? Oh my god, so yeah, scary. Oh my god. I told you to run. You're too soft. Behave now. I'd hate to stick you through that precious throat of yours. <laughs> you know, I didn't expect you to actually bother to come. The songbird baited the trap nicely after all. I suppose that settles it. The rats were working together. Must be quite a story behind this. But more importantly, time and time again, you dragged my name through the mud. This was and not even my fault. This was his fault. Oh my god. Oh, I'm going to make this hurt. Hector, come. Hector? Wait, that's your dog? You mean he transformed at your command? I mean, what? That animal's been corrupted by melancholia, and still you tamed it. Gladell, why did you hide such an amazing talent? Isn't taking hostages a bit beneath you? What? Don't you dare patronize me. You think I don't realize it? I'm not strong. I'm no towering the sun war hero. All I've got is my wits, damn you. How could I win a rigged game but through foul play? Foul play? And now, I'll wipe those arrogant smiles off their faces. I should be the man being served and worshipped. Me, no one else. And yet every time, I watch them surpass me in everything I did. That bastard Luis included. They've been thorn after bloody thorn in my side, but that all ends today. I'll offer you up on a silver platter, and one day, the world will know me as its rightful ruler. Oh my, you're pathetic. I told you to shut your damned mouth. Go, Hector. Don't move. That goes for you too, fairy. Unless you'd rather see her pretty little neck. Oh my break. lord. Ooh. What do we do? Right now, all we can do is make it through this. If we're not careful about I mean, I don't want to I don't want to fight the dog, but like I have to. <laughs> Spectacular. A fitting end for a pack of rats. Get I can rats. show you the world. Thank you. I appreciate it. Isn't there anything we can do? What? Why isn't it? Bro. <laughs> <You're> like, <laughs> like what the fuck is this? Yo, he's being so rude. Don't take hostages, bro. This is disgusting behavior. You let your dog do your fighting. You're such a disgrace. He has no pets here. So what's the matter? Are you too scared to fight him alone? A duel? <laughs> Have it your way. Come then. We'll do this right. Wait, what? Oh my god. Guys, I do not support violence against women. I'm sorry. I, I, I'm, I'm so sorry you had to see that. King. So, who are you to me? I am the one who would save this country. Well, that worked better than I expected. This is bad. That guy is near the top of the candidate rankings. That means the royal magic will make him invincible to us. <laughs> <laughs> you have the right of it. You fell for it. She brought you straight to me. Now I have you, and I'll ensure your suffering is long and painful. But see reason. Juna, if you take my side, I might be persuaded to spare you. Am I not worthy of your affection? Oh my god, ew! I'm more of a man than that bastard Luis could ever be! Over my dead body! I am Juan Cygnus. I am no one's trinket. My life is my own to protect, and I will accept nothing less. <laughs> what? It worked? I mean, if he doesn't actually try to hurt him, then it should be fine. Just, yeah, just push him. Smack him around. Well, you're not invincible. Damn you. Wait, what? What's going on here? Huh? Wait, hold on. No, no, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, what's going on? Your powers have intrigued me from the start. You and your friends. You call it an archetype, right? What? 
I thought as much. Surprising, though. I'd written them off as a myth. Not even my sister got close. The fuck, what Still, the fuck is she talking about? Now that I've seen their power a few times, maybe I can do it myself. Very well. Oh, Lord Star, who wandered in sorrow. What? Oh, She's just like, can I do it too? And they're like, yes. The Here you go. From the start. Henceforth, thy fears and insecurities become thy light. Thou art the I can't believe it. She literally, she just asked to have the power now. and they gave it to her. Are you Awaken. fucking for real? Look. Look at me. What you see now is my commitment to my song. Oh, oh my god. Hey, yo. Ma'am? Oh my god, girl. Oh my god. Girl, oh my god, she's so pretty. Okay, but what the fuck was that? My voice rises from the depths of my heart. This is, this is a lot. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> this is, there's a lot going on here. Oh my God. Uh, how, how does she have the same power? Does Where did this come sing? from? I'm so confused. She, Never it, underestimate a singer. Every song is a burden. The weight of a lifetime. I have sung a thousand songs. I've known their power my whole life. Whereas all you've ever been is a lackey. My music is lost on you. Listen and learn. <sighs> Do it. Chew them up. Tear them limb from bloody limb. I see. So this is the power of an archetype. Where, where is this coming from? What? And I can be whatever I want. Poetic, really, especially for me. That's just as well. You can lend me your strength too. This isn't the kind of thing you can just imitate. You know about this. Yeah, power? how did you, how you did must? this happen? It's been a while. Now, I hope you've had your fun because they better explain this to me later because people. I need answers. This is ridiculous. Shut up. Just shut up. I'll crush you with my own hands. A duel, then. You can die together. Oh, along with its own skills, the Masked Dancer archetype can equip different masks to use additional skills. Oh, oh, okay, I see. This is what those other things that they were showing us before. Interesting. The Seeker Mask is currently equipped to obtain new masks, visit special experience in academia. Wait, but can she... Is this like something that everyone can wear or is it just her? I'm so confused right now. What? Ooh, oh, wow, okay. Okay, cool. Burn! Ow! Let's stay calm. I'll Wait, get some did, did, it, did it miss? Did it miss the other one? Wait, what? To the rear guard. Let's wow. go. The magic seed. Ooh. Mage flow. Wait, what the fuck? Oh my god, that's big damage. Raging fire! My stuff won't hold this rising. We're not out of this yet. That helped. I'm not gonna lie, they're hitting me for a lot of damage. With I don't like now, that. Hector. Your defense rose. Okay, well, too bad. Oh my god, excuse me, bro. Don't be fucking rude. I'm just gonna have to have him carry everything. This is ridiculous. Oh my god. 
she's not she's not bad but like he's, he's just so much stronger i'm just gonna pass her in can you fucking can you leave her alone holy fuck bro i won't hold back this is it still up come forth royal soul you're right we're not at it yet that helped Take this. Mm -hmm. this! Oh my god, stop that. Excuse me, sir. Holy fuck. I won't hold back with healing power. Thanks. I am your rightful king. A tough one. Oh my god, come on. Show you. Wait, did we win? Hold on. Uh, help. Help me. Oh, okay, thank God. <laughs> I was like, I'm like, this is a little spicy for, for this kind of fight. Two two versus two? I don't know about that one. The magician white mask. What the fuck? Why do they keep giving us this shit, bro? What is this? I I give. Please. I'll not say a word about you sneaking in. Just spare my life, I beg you. I don't believe what him. What do we do? If we let him run off, he's obviously going to rat us out. But killing him would give us a lot to explain. Maybe we should work out some kind of deal. Idiots! It's the oldest trick in the book! Wait, what? Why? Wait, what? What's happening? No. I'm the future king. I Wait, what happened? Can't. Why why is it I can't breathe. Why? Wait, did did he die? It killed him? What? Is he dead? So the magic protected us. Ah. Uh, but why Okay, now? okay, okay. So so there was a brief period where the king's magic that protects people who are in the running wasn't working, but now it's working again, which makes me think that maybe something either something either happened with him and like maybe some other people, maybe they're not being affected by it temporarily, or somebody used something just to, to, to like prevent it from working for that specific amount of time so that they could do something to somebody else maybe i don't know that's fucking weird. where What's did you hell? what the fuck where did you come from where did they come from <laughs> what the fuck is okay? this no, no. what no he's the one who attacked us and then the king's magic did all that to him that the truth of it oh he snuck in to count luis's private quarters must have gotten in with all the confusion of takeoff i suppose right and why did the bloody thing take off like that we could hardly believe our eyes oh well you know oh my god they're so dumb stop boys. it perhaps i got a bit carried away but we're in brylehaven i simply had to see the night view over the city you have an alap Anyway, <laughs> yeah, Ben what, Liddell what went the from fuck? crass to violent. That's when he stepped in to help. Right? I'm I'm assuming that they're all in on it. Oh, you know what? Oh, maybe they're all working. They're all working together. That would make a lot of sense. Uh, yes. Maybe. Exactly. I'm so right. confused right now. Crikey, Lady Juna, I'm sorry. Sounds like you've had a right awful evening. Also, he's very polite. Hold on. You were supposed to be at the soiree, weren't you? That's a lot of ground to cover, isn't it? Why? One would think you don't believe us, Fidelio. I'm wounded. You truly doubt me. <laughs> you well, what the no, fuck? This just, is so weird. I suppose that means the rat was Glodel. Lord Louis said we got a traitor in our midst, is all. We came by thinking to catch him. This... Is that so? Well... Hadn't you better report back? Shall we make what we can of this party together? Your throat's all better then, Lady Juna. My... Ah, oh, yes. Much better. He gave me such a thorough examination after all. <laughs> what? 
He took good care of my throat, my tongue, my lips. <laughs> what? Is, what are you saying? What is she saying? Really? What the fuck? Oh my god! Stop. Hardly matters to me. Anyway, I'd say this bears reporting. Let's leave the guards to their cleanup and get out of here. There's no fucking way in hell that would ever work on anyone. That was bullshit. I do not believe that. Yeesh, looks could kill. Scary. Fucking sussy McSuspants over here. What the fuck? So Gladell was our rat, was he? And he's already been executed? Afraid so. The two of them were the only ones who left the soiree early. It sounds like Gladell overstepped and Lady Juna and the new lad had to fight him down. Or it could have been the other way around. Too right. Dad can't speak after all, and we've no other witnesses <laughs> Yo, to the scene. I like how he's just like he's now, like, I don't fucking on. believe that shit. Gladell was a <laughs> right fucking prolific stupid. candidate. We know the king's magic protected him. Their story goes that he attacked them and got petrified to death for it. If that's true, the boy'd have to have the stand-in for it. That fact is no longer in question. I received a report a short while ago. They say your face has emerged on the king's rock. It appears your stunt with the Sanctares earned you some renown. Hey, good for you, Paul. And that's how the magic got to Gladell. Oh, so it seems that we were in more danger than we knew, but the risk ended up paying off. One wonders what you stopped Gladell from doing. What was he after there? Yeah, who knows? We were hardly in a position to ask. Wonder if he was on old Forden's payroll. Nah. He'd been at that monk Godot's neck since the race had barely started. Tried to snuff him out in the wilds, too. Not anywhere he'd have had an audience. No matter. Forden has been kind enough to whip the people into a frenzy over this race. I'll step in and reap what he so graciously sowed. From here on, you will serve as my eyes and ears. I'm glad we've cleared your doubts. Results are all that matters to me. Let us see what oh, I see. He doesn't care. For the next task. He can probably throw me away anytime Until he then, wants to. I see. You take your ease in the city. Oh, and with Gladell out with the rubbish, might I promote him to the role of my chauffeur? Are you serious? Is it so strange? He does have his own gauntlet runner. In fact, I'd better go make sure it's up to my standards. She she is not subtle. I, listen, if I was reason. any, no, if I was any of them, I'd be like, this is so fucking sus, bro. Like, What's what wrong, the Del? fuck? Looking a bit green around mm -mm. the hills. Gladell was an ambitious man, yeah, but is that enough to justify him looting Count Luis's personal quarters? What was in it for him? All right. I don't know. Maybe you're you're asking the wrong questions, bro. Ooh, rank twenty. I'm assuming that means that he ended up either. No, actually, no. Maybe they were Sorry they were both within in. the first twenty a ranks. For introductions, I expect. All right, welcome to the party. Oh my God, Queen. What? The Queen has you joined the party. Told them about me yet. I can't tell them what you haven't told me. So, can I assume that you are one of us? That is, we too stand alongside Count Luis, but how to say it? I think you and I were after the same thing in old Luis's room. You really weren't told. Uh, wait, Don't tell what? Me. You're the other agent Grius mentioned. Grius. Wait, I don't even I don't even remember the shit. This this was probably so long ago. What? I'm sorry. They kept the finer details confidential. So I never really knew who the other agent was. But I understand the objective well enough. The curse on His Highness the Prince can't be lifted by conventional methods. So we either kill the caster or get the formula. I see. So you and Grius were the two prongs of the operation. You get the formula, he hunts the caster. Ever since the King's magic made it impossible to kill Luis, I've been ready to meet up with a new contact. I just wasn't expecting one so young. If I hadn't uh, learned the fairy weren't. messenger's name was Gallica, I'd never have realized it was you. I'm pretty shocked myself. Oh. I never figured the big famous songstress would be on our side. Okay, I see what's going on. I um, wasn't aware that we I had a partner coming, but she knew. Uh, 
or you something. Were his, his lady love. <laughs> God no. I wouldn't be caught dead in that madman's quarters unless it was to rob him blind. No. Luis keeps me close because he likes my voice. That's all. He made the lines of that relationship quite clear, with no room for messier entanglements. I think that clears up your place here. But I have to say, you're risking a lot for a side job. Why go to these lengths when you've so much to lose? Yeah, what is going on? First, she was, was like so ready to get her archetype too. Like, she didn't even have to do shit. She just, she was like, can I have one? And then just got so, it. In sooth, you were strong armed into this? I want to. No, she has a reason no, for no. it. That, that's no. BS. I to join. When fate beckons, one can't just turn her away. A singer's whole self is built off all she experiences. This seemed like a chance for a once in a lifetime inspiration for my art. And nobody else had a plausible way or reason to get close to Louise. So, you could say our interests aligned. All that just so you could grow as a singer. You really are devoted. That's it. That's the only reason? <laughs> she just wants to be a better singer or something? What? something like that, don't you? A devotion that anyone else might see as foolish. The girl's bold as brass. No wonder she's got all the crown subjects by the heartstrings, eh? Well, half of it might be because of my birth. The Midia girl's got to be bold to step out into this world at all. Though it's hard for most people to understand why. Singing is everything to me. To truly stir even a single soul. I'd take that over a thousand of the church's accolades. Well, anyhow, that's what's going on with me. I'll stick close to Luis for now so he doesn't start suspecting anything. Any objections? Captain? We'll be counting on you. I knew you were the sort of man who knows what to say. Glad to meet you as a proper comrade. Gets your heart going, doesn't it? Oh my god, new ally Juna. Juna, the kingdom's premier songstress, has become your ally. Ooh, she's super pretty too. I like her. I'm gonna have to throw her in and have well, her replace somebody at some point. Coming. But I guess we've got another ally now. Our journey looked pretty precarious at first, but it's gone surprisingly smoothly. I'll do my best to help too. Let's see this through. I can sense Gallica's strong determination. Oh, uh, she's also getting a rank up too. Oh, okay. Gotta get back on track. Wow. Okay, we're popping off. Anyway. Not, not what I was oh, expecting right. at all. I'm not gonna lie. That though. was a lot. Hopefully, we can finally break the curse. Do we even know anyone who can read the blasted thing? Oh, I love a good blueprint, but this formula leaves me a tad glazed. What? Actually, <laughs> it leaves me a little bit glazed. Oh my god. Seems like he had it in mind. I know about that, Skuma. Rella. The girl they call the Saint? Saint Rella. Indeed, she would be the most qualified. After the attack on His Highness, we sent for the kingdom's best healer. It was she who answered our summons, and she who saved His Highness from certain death. Oh my god, wait, so Hold she on. knows the too? Oh. Oh Lord, have mercy on my soul. Was ten years ago. He probably knows. So called saint looked about my age. Rella was a prodigal talent, one of the most gifted at the Mage Academy. Even as a child, she outclassed her teachers with an igniter. Wait, you know her? I'm afraid she's a bit out of our reach now, though. She left a while ago to return to her work at the royal capital. We couldn't manage such a trip under Luisa's gaze. Well, a trip to the royal capital would hardly put us out. We'll just pip over with a bit of magic. No, really, it's dash it convenient. There are some conditions, but oh, we okay, can yeah. She doesn't remember that we can do that too. To she doesn't know. Places. Well, no sense waiting. Let's be off. Right, all yours. Oh my god! So we're just we're just going there. We're just gonna go talk to Rella right now. Okay, what the fuck? actually did it we're at the royal capital wait 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 how did you do that don't shout in the streets would you 
How can I not? Wait, no. If you if everyone knows that you're here, then eventually they're gonna send word back to Luis and be like, "What the fuck is she doing here?" Isn't that the songstress? Oh my God, no. Oh hell. The price of fame. If this is all your fault, Juna, girl. It'll be hard to explain yourself later on. Rella works at the church on Main Street. I'll lead the way. You know Wait, she, way around, she's eh? at the church here? Wait, this Rella's a world-class healer, and she's working as a local doctor. Wait, what? Is that uncommon? Igniters are not known for their use in healing. Indeed, it is a virtually impossible feat, often reserved for the nobility. I'd have expected Saint Rella to serve the court only. If she turned down that prestige in the name of helping the common folk, then I suppose she really has earned her saintly titles. Congrats on eight hours. Thank Let's you. Oh yeah, we hit eight hours. Let's fucking go. What do you make of all this, Captain? Also, thank you for the shout-out, by the way. To decipher the curse, we risk exposing our identities and our aims. Do you trust her? Why don't let's just meet her first? Let's meet her first. A fair thought. We need not be so reluctant. If you say so, then let's get on. I mean, she she seems okay, but like this is very, this is just weird. Didn't they mention that she's Juna's sister? She mentioned that too when she was doing her speech before. Bro, the fact the fact that she's been working here this whole time, I probably what if we accidentally saw her at one point? Terribly sorry, putting some elixirs away. Be with you in a moment. Hello, how can I help you? <sighs> Juna, long time no see. Sorry for all of us storming the place. And you, you're the one who was at the exhibition. Mm. Right. Now that you all know each other's names, Rella is my older sister. Adopted oh. sister, that is. <laughs> oh, adopted. Her ah. family took me in. Though don't spread it around. The public doesn't know, and we don't know who tried to exploit it. It's been forever, Juna. I'm so sorry. I really was planning to meet you after the opening ceremony. I understand. You were attending to Sanctifex Forden until Brylehaven. But that's wonderful. Such deft social climbing even puts father's efforts to shame, eh? Oh, social climbing. Glad to make your acquaintance. I am Rella Cygnus. I'm a healer. But somehow, I doubt that's why you're here. Okay, Actually, I, there's something we'd like you to I see. At. I recognized Juna's last name when she said her name was Junai Cygnus. And I was like, I'm like, what the fuck is Cygnus? I've heard that before. And now we remember it. Now we know why. It's because Rella's last name is Cygnus. There you go. It all makes sense now. Where? Where did you get this? I know it's asking a lot, but could you share anything you know? Without asking too many questions? I've seen something like this before. I'd never forget. Objectively speaking, the magic involved is a direct inversion of a healing spell. Popularly known as a curse. Hmm. I suppose that stands to reason. Pardon the late introduction. I am Hulkenberg, a Knight of the Crown. As you may have guessed, that is the formula to the curse that slew his royal highness, the prince. Hold on. The death of his highness was a tragedy, one I would see repaid in full. As his royal guard, it is my duty to punish the treasonous snake responsible. Then surely the man who penned this was Luis. Look, what happened with the exhibition? We were trying to get closer to Luis. You're a holy woman, so I couldn't ask your forgiveness. But if you could at least understand... The Lady Joanna's penitence was sincere. To hear her, I thought it must be so. It was Forden who chose such a terrible punishment. That was what scared me. Oh, Rella. Ah, but I'm a bit relieved. I heard rumors Louise had swept you off your feet and you'd been hanging on his arm since. Oh, I worried for you so, Juna. I see now I needn't have given it a second thought. Of course. I am Juani Cygnus, and my life is... Yes, yes, your life is your own, I know. Just make sure you're not causing trouble for everyone else. 
I suppose this is another dramatic and risky gesture? Like when you ran away from home in a frenzy of passion, declaring you'd take the stage or die trying? No! Well, sort of. Maybe, yes, but... Oh! You didn't have to put it like that. I've looked over the formula. From what I can tell, this spell's effects are... enduring. As long as the magic source continues to exist, the effect shall never fade. The trouble is, while most curses simply consume the magic released in the moment's casting, this one is designed to perpetually draw on the magic of the caster. So as long as Luis lives, it doesn't matter where his victims run and hide. Sounds just So basically like it just never fucking stops. I'm afraid even if his highness still lived, I don't think anyone could have broken the curse using this. Wait, what? This formula isn't complete. It's a mere outline clearly jotted from memory. I couldn't tell you how to lift the curse from this alone. What? Then I'm sorry I couldn't be of any help. No, you, you've done plenty. Especially since we're the ones. So we're still fucked. We have to kill him. Me, oh ma my god, why? May I say one last thing? You're a friend of hers, aren't you? Please, keep Juna safe. Of course. I'll do what I can. Thank you. She can be reckless sometimes. I'll be here for the foreseeable future. Any friend of Juna is welcome here, so stop by any time you like. The curse is impossible to break? What? No, it's not that it's impossible to break. It's just that we can't currently break I've it. Never seen you lot so glued. With that. What do we do now? We still have the to kill him. The only way left is to take down Luis himself. The impossibility of that is precisely what led us here, Stroll. And now, we are no further than when we started. Plenty of assassins have come for Luis, but the king's magic works every time. They all died frozen in agony. Even if we could fight him properly, do we stand a chance? The man's an unparalleled master of both martial and magic arts. This might be the end. Still, we have to stop Luis, no matter what. The royal magic's not an absolute shield. It cost Gladell his life. We've just got to maintain the trust we've earned from Luis, and eventually we'll get our chance. For now, he told us to wait until the race's next task is announced. Then we'll have to do just that. <sighs> I'm pooped from all this brainstorming. I could use a break in the gauntlet runner. <sighs> if we can, sorry, if we take Juna out in the public, we might attract a crowd, and we can't risk Luis catching on that we're in the royal capital. I was going to say it might be a little late for that. <laughs> Considering that like she immediately started fucking yelling when she went outside, but okay. At least for today, I will ask her to stay in the runner and away from prying eyes. Well, I must say I'm impressed. You have enough beds to accommodate this many people. If you want to call them that, they're, they're yes. tubes. As much as they grumble about cramped quarters. Apologies. Tis hardly accommodation worthy of a diva. And I confess the ride itself is often jarring. At the very least, I'll be happy with a bath. You have a room for that, I trust? Right this way, milady. Well, no point getting reckless now. Let's think about this some more tomorrow. By the way, what have you been doing all this time, Nurus? Thinking mostly. Been having a good old ponder ever since I saw Luis's guy. Is he still day. trying to get his thing to fly Always in the air? My dream to fly on wings, you see. Not with any of this magic levitatory. But then in you come with this teleportation. Made me start wondering if there was any valid point at all to my flight theory. What? A long while back, I did a flight experiment to prove my theory was sound. Failed spectacularly, though, and got myself all crunched up in the process. I was still in bed midway through my convalescence when they, when they told me I was to be demoted. <laughs> Can I go to bed now? Can I go to bed now? The bally nerve. <laughs> no, I don't care. I want to. I don't care. 
My flight theory is complete. Principles are sound and tested. All that's left are the practical, eh? Incorporating it into the gauntlet runner. But ever since that accident, I, I suppose I've, I've been afraid to move forward with it. Afraid of failure. You and the rest of our merry band are risking your very lives for the prince. And here I sit moping, eh? The way I see it, your teleportation can only take us places we've been. If we okay, want literally, to see horizons, we'll need get to, take to the to point, Nurus. Like, I understand It'll he wants time. to fly. I get no that. Doubt. But I'll put my very soul into it. No shortcuts. And when I fly, I'll do it my way. All right, sounds good. Okay, now the character can actually go to bed now. That's crazy. You can change or add members to your party from the party option in the main menu. Press X and form a group of up to four. Note that reserve members will gain less experience at the end of battle than active participants, and you can never remove the blah blah blah. All right. Well, let's yeah. actually take a look. Hold on. So, oh, she's only 34. I mean, could be better, could be worse. Uh. I think what I'm going to end up doing, um, let me actually move. Oh. Oh, okay. I see. I see. Uh. Yeah, let me put let me put Hulkenberg, Juna, and then Heisman here, maybe. Yeah. Who do I want? actually? Who do I want next to me right now? I think I think this is okay for now. I do want her in my party. Apparently, she's very good. Um, let's take a look to see what else we can put on her. So apparently, hold on. By equipping special accessories called masks, it can change its skills and resistances. I mean, I mm, a seeker's mask. Oh, okay. I see what's going on. Okay, so I have to use those masks that are dropped by enemies. Like the fragments to make actual masks or something interesting don't know if i actually think that's like the best thing ever but could be worse do i have anything else here do we have other stuff here too uh, maybe this one holy moly Okay, you know what we're going to do? Um, we're going to go just a little bit further because I want to get to a point where I can at the very least um, find a place to save. I don't know if they're going to put us in, put us into like a new town or something. We're going to go just a little bit further. I know you guys are probably tired. Pets you softly. I know. I don't worry. I promise that we're not going to be up for too much longer. Um, I just want to make sure that we're in a position where I can, at least in my own time before tomorrow... I can take a quick look at like the party and like hopefully like um maybe even even give like Juna more archetypes or something. So we'll have to see. Um let's go ahead and let's just go. I guess they just want us to rest up. I don't think we can talk to anyone. Sure. Good night. I'm finding it hard to sleep. Yeah, me too. I'm I'm so confused as to what exactly is gonna happen now. Do they have to like go out and like oh, cross the good. ocean? Sorry, Tihi, to awake. get to the other area, the other town. The Can't sleep. <laughs> well, that is rather the problem. I'm wide awake. Once we're back tomorrow. I'll sneak the formula back into Luis's room. Even if he suspected us, he'd never work out that we got to the capital and showed it to Rella in a single night. He won't find out about our mission. 
Hmm. I should probably have Juna return any Magla keys that we got on the Shirtius 2 just to be safe. I will give them to her later. You know, I'm a bit surprised. I thought I was fine doing all that infiltration at Luis's place. Turns out I wasn't. Finally having others who know the truth and having gotten to see my sister. I didn't realize how exhausted I am. And you personally saved me from danger back there. I'm terribly grateful to you. You're lucky, really. I'll have you know I'm rarely this candid. That's the forbidden text you mentioned in Luis's room, is it? I've seen him reading it from time to time. What's it like? Can I read a bit of it? What? What? Hold on. So this is like acknowledged as a forbidden text by everyone? What the fuck? The prevailing culture of the world is one of freedom in all things. No faith, fealty, or philosophy enforces ideology. All are free to create, and all are free to embrace those creations. This culture's influence spreads throughout the world. It is even said that a song of peace was powerful enough to bring an end to war. Oh, how inspiring. It's hard to imagine that a single song could be so influential. I wonder what the world would be like if a song really could reach all people's hearts. No matter their status or tribe. We Nydia, we're all liars, you know. Everyone told us we were inherently worthless. Just a fact of our birth. So I learned some glamours to make myself at least look valuable this form it's all just a fancy disguise really a gilded mask for the world to admire or not no do forgive me that was all lies 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 i don't think lies 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 lies, lies lies idea to reveal yourself <laughs> entirely but you should always have the freedom to if these new powers are to give form to my ideals i want to create a world where we can appreciate each other's freedom I'll make sure everyone hears that in my songs. No matter what happens. Juna and I talked into the night. Interesting. Time marches on, and the age of a new king draws nearer. Very weird. Very, very weird that Luis has also been reading this book alongside us too this whole time. Very strange. Now! Prepare to hear the race's next challenge. Let's find out where our fierce competitors are bound. To recap, the 20 candidates with the current highest approval on the King's Rock will be the only ones to proceed. All others will be disqualified. I'd say the results of the exhibition are sure to have spread by now. Let's have a look at the standings, shall we? In first place, the undisputed winner, bane of sea monsters and savior of the people, our very own Sanctifex Pardon! And the traitor Luis in second, despite not actually being in the race. But in third, we have the warrior monk captain, Master Kiddo! Furthermore... In the end, everyone but Luis is just representing the Sanctus Church. What's your point? I dare say that's a relief. We'll finally be done with all this chaos. A return to normalcy. Ha! Normalcy. Funny how it's only the rich who miss how things used to be. But now Count Luis has the people behind him. He'll save the common man. Yeah, Eat the rich. Eat the rich. That's what I like to say, boy. I agree with him. But we do have one standout who's seen a stunning jump in popularity since the exhibition. The lad responsible for exposing the sins of the Sanctress, Joanna. Valiant human slayer. Yes, it's the young Elder. <laughs> right, wasn't expecting that one. Nameless to famous in a single night. Just like that, he's in the top 20. Oi, cryer man, where's the windbag? The one what acted all high and mighty over a tiny human head. Who? Oh, right, that Gladell or something. No sign of him. Probably saw the writing on the wall and dropped out. 
So it really was all talk then. <laughs> and they're not gonna mention that he fucking room, died. Oh my god. <laughs> Don't kill me. Oh, I feel so bad for him. Not really, but he tried his best. It's fine. A rising star by the name of Katharina. Some big ideas that um, go. I hear she plans to put a price on every I'm pretty sure she said she was dropping she out. So I don't know about that? that. If they're sitting on most of the kingdom's money, they can afford to hire a little extra security every day. Let them sweat it out. Now here's a surprise. We've got a Mastari candidate still in the running. And my sources say they hail from Well well. Virga Island. A pagan island. Wait, what? They're filthy barbarians. Besides, they have a Mustari candidate? Where? They haven't showed the have they showed this person at all this whole time? Pretty diverse. We're just about ready to announce the next leg of the race. <gasps> What's happening? That's the bell. Thank you for waiting, ladies and gents. It's time to begin the second round of the tournament for the throne. First of all, congratulations to the 20 who have won their places on the King's Rock. You are now officially Wait, what? the oh, winner of the Oh, that person. What the hell is that Let's outfit? Give them a hand. No sign of Luis. Even if he does plan to take over, suppose he's still not eager to play by their rules. I haven't seen Juna this morning either. I heard some noble say she had a job suddenly come up. Better that the audience doesn't see her with us, anyway. Now, at long last, we are ready to announce their next challenge. This time, the task for the candidates is... Recovering and offering a divine relic! What? A relic? Don't worry, we're happy to explain everything. You'll not want to forget this, so we've arranged for you to hear it from an unforgettable voice. To I tell feel like... us more, please welcome to the stage our Oh guide, shit, what the fuck? Our songstress, the lovely huh. Okay, I was gonna say though, I remember the Forden brought up earlier that they wanted to get the relics brought together though, so I think that makes sense. It's also kind of weird though. Your next destination is Alterbury Heights, the capital of the Principality of Montario. You are to gather there by the deadline, with a divine relic in hand to offer the Sanctus Church. What? I don't want to give it to the Sanctus Church. No. Tragically, there are still heathens in this land who choose <laughs> what to reject the fuck? Sanctism. They care nothing for salvation. Oh my god, I fucking I hate religion they so much. It's so annoying. Get the shit out of here. Them divine relics, believing them gifts from their eldritch gods. But their rituals are unstable, and their relics just primitive magic tools. It is time we put an end to this misguided witchery. Take these relics from the pagans. You're gonna head to bed. Yeah, no, no worries, babe. I feel you. We're gonna head to bed soon soon. I feel you. Heights. In Montario. Have a good night, Aurora. Thanks for coming to out today. I'll see you around. In God's hands. Bed very soon. May I will be following soon after. Be blessed with good fortune see. and the favor give you huggies. Ah. Have a good I night, babe. Pray for your success. Got a real presence before a crowd, doesn't she? Most of them plucks at your heart. <sighs> Focus, Iceland, focus. By the deadline of the second oh my god, she's such a big fan of her. She's just like, she's like, oh my god. She's like so hot, yo. This two-day event kicks off on Saints Day Eve with the main celebrations on the day proper. And this year's event will be historic. His Eminence, Sanctifex Forden, will be personally sealing the collection of the Pagan Relics. To celebrate... The songstress Juna will be dedicating a ceremonial song. You won't want to miss this, folks. Now, ladies and gentlemen, on my mark, let the second round of the tournament for the throne begin. So, I'm assuming if we if we can only 
if we can only find like a few relics or something there's only going to be enough for what like half of the people or maybe like even like five of them i don't fucking know there's no way that every single person can get a relic steal relics from pagan land now that's plunder they would steal our very culture that candidate's a mustari small wonder he's so aghast Forden's stooping to a new low what do you mean by and large the mustari are a pagan people their relics are cultural touchstones vital to their hearts and faiths and Forden's just ordered us to loot them as we please but in our case we won't even know what we're doing until Luis gives the order either way we're bound for Alterbury. it's further east we've a long trip ahead of us oh, my shoulder hurts I don't care if it's the crown theocracy. You think they'd ask me a little sooner than the morning of? Still managed to put on a hell of a show for him. Lady Juna, Count Luis has sent for you. And you lot too, I suppose. Looks like our first job's come in. These men have me running all over. We're back, Lord Luis. Funny, isn't it? Since the Gladell incident, you've been inseparable from this gang. Well, one has to keep one chauffeur in line, don't you think? <laughs> hey, He's like, what the fuck, the you? Festival? Good on you. Thanks. Though I don't know if it's worth celebrating. Okay, I actually love him. He's so stupid. Seems to me, it's to keep Lord Luis in <laughs> check. Like, he's he's like he's like he acts like so I innocent. I don't know why he does that. He's so weird. Party. And if we try anything, they'll use it as an excuse to blacklist you. Just the kind of shite you'd expect from those Sanctist stooges. You need fear nothing. It is Forden who now stews in his dread that he seeks the divine relics is common knowledge. But who would simply give up an idol on par with the god's reverence? He has all but commanded that we take it by force. The king's magic ruined his schemes. You humiliated him in the public eye. And in one desperate final grasp for authority, the fool has placed his fate in my hands. Forden's game will soon end. Let us at least give him the finale. He I was going to say, if everyone grab these idols, or some of the idols, the, um, the relics, and use them against the uh, the church, that'd be, mm, that'd be kind of spicy. I would love to see that. What do you mean, a finale? What? Do you need to hear it repeated? I will give Forden his death. And what of the king's magic? <laughs> You'll see soon enough. For now, you need only follow my orders. Your task is to obtain a certain divine relic on Ooh. my behalf. The artifact in question is a lance known as Dracodius. Dracodios. The Draco implies something to do with dragons, I presume. So so that whole thing that happened earlier with um was it glodell or whatever the the guy who got like suffocated by the chains i have a feeling that um that luis probably did actually do something or tried something and maybe he knows how to get it to work now where he can like he can like prevent the um the king's magic to work on people who are like Suffice candidates or something behind this particular interesting you will acquire it in time for saint's day and bring it to me Pretty high stakes, my lord. You sure you want this crop of novices on the job? Rest assured, my other agents have their own relics I've assigned them to pursue. I've no urgent need for this lance, nor for them, should they fail. I'll go along and keep an eye on them, shall I? You can bet that if they try and run off with the relic, I'll put a stop to it. You certainly are attached to them, aren't you? Well, it's their first formal assignment in your service, after all. I can be your eyes and ears. So be it then. You may act accordingly. <laughs> so, my lord, where can we find this fancy lance? Find your clues elsewhere. You have nothing further from me. Prove you think as well as you fight. Sir, I swear. Why may are people like this, bro? find success in the pursuit of our shared vision. Why are you like this, sir? Why do you make me do all the work for you? All right. Just, just write. Can you write it down on a piece of note or something? A notebook, notebook paper? <laughs> just slip it to me under the door. I don't fucking know. 
god. Oh lord. Okay, hold on. Search for clues about the divine lance. Oh wait, hold on. Uh I think actually, hold on. Am I okay to go to the thing? Man, oh my god, no. Wait, hold on. If I talk to more, if it lets me go in, then where was I? Okay. Okay, so what we're gonna do. Um, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go visit more, and then we're gonna save here because off screen I will go and I will spend all of the mag that we have, and I'm gonna go get I'm gonna just like give her like archetypes or whatever. Um, I'll try to level her up as much as I can with the items that we have too. Um, so we should be good to go. What what is he saying? Your ally's awakening has revealed a new archetype called the Masked Dancer. It holds a power both unique and interesting. I prepared a new special experiment to enhance its potential to the highest level. Now then. Should you desire to hear more blah blah blah? Well, okay. Well. Interesting. I, I do want to take a look a look at this before we wind down. Hold on. Hold on. You can create create items that certain archetypes use utilize in battle. Oh. Hello. What? Can I no? Can I not get items for other classes too? Oh, this is interesting though. Wait, seeker, magic seeker. Uh, wait, what? Am I the only one that finds this like slightly weird though? Like, So what, do I have to like specifically go farm for these items just to make the mask that I want? Why? Listen, why would you even put the dancer on an, on on her then? Like, what's the point? Why not just take it off and like level it up for people and then take it off? I don't know. That makes no sense. Although technically, technically you could put on the merchant mask for her, I guess. I don't know. This is just weird. I don't know if that's just me. The magic seeker's mask. Um, alright. This is very, very strange. Um, okay. Let me just double check. Can she actually learn other things? She can. So what the fuck what is the point of having her put those masks on? Or how do why do I why should I bother making them? I okay, this this is another thing, and I will say this, and I'm not trying to be a downer. Uh if it were me, I would have just had it to, so that if you have somebody have the mask dancer class then just automatically make it so that they can just switch between the masks. Like, don't make me have to go farm for materials to make them and put them on as a fucking accessory. I think that's a little bit sussy. I think, I think it's kind of um weird. Like, why why am I gonna use this class? I'm so confused. We have, let, let's 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 read this shit out. Hold on. How does this work? Ice blue dance. Inflict enemies with a one-time weakness. Why would I do this? This seems really weird. A high chance of one hit killing all enemies. Okay, that's actually not bad. Um, let me take a look one more time. What else do we have on there? Mass revel revelry. Recovers a medium amount of caster's MP every turn. Well, this is this would be good to like actually like level it up and put it on your character after, but it's fine. Um, deals heavy magic damage, fire ma heavy magic fire damage to all enemies. Mm, what does the other one do? This is the the last one there. Inflicts one and oh, inflicts one enemy with a one-time weakness to electric, one-time weakness to wind, a one-time weakness to light. What? Removes the target target's buff effects. Oh, okay, that's actually really good. But again, I. I I don't really, I, I don't really understand the point of this, of this job. This is kind of weird. I feel like this is the kind of thing like you would do this for like a challenge run. I think, I think that part of the experience of this game is they probably want people after they beat it to like go and pick specific classes and then try to do a run with a specific set of jobs. You know how like Final, is it Final Fantasy IV that has like the job fiesta thing that everybody loves so much? This is kind of the vibe I'm getting. It's like, they're just like, well, this class kind of fucking sucks. But like, if you want to do a challenge run with it, you you can. I just don't see the point in using this job 
when we could just like level it up or something i'm gonna pass out bb i was gonna say we're, we're literally about to head out right now angel but have a good night um i was gonna say if you have time after like in the next like 20 minutes like let me know because like i'll jump on and um i'll have a quick call with you and just chill um but i'm gonna go we're actually gonna head out like literally like right now like give me like a hot minute i just wanted to jump in and like see whether or not we could actually like change her her archetype job let me go ahead and we're gonna save here hashtag badge